only got my Christmas earrings on and Elle's got a full-blown hat and I'm jealous. <laughs> <laughs> What's up with his leg there? Merry Christmas in July! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone! <laughs> What's going on with this one? Look, is... His legs fallen down. Look, his legs have got hats on. Hello! Oh, <laughs> yes, it's Christmas in July! We both had the text message from uh, um, our seniors. All I could find, because all my Christmas stuff's in the attic. <laughs> As most normal people's was would be. my Christmas earrings. So yeah. Look, I have made an effort. Yeah, you have. Here's my Santa earrings. And you're wearing green. That's and they're festive. wearing green. Yeah. And that's festive. There so you go. There they are. Oh, they're Who's amazing. Ho, ho, ho. Ho, ho, ho. Did you make those? I did. They're lovely. I like them. Yeah, we had our messages <laughs> saying, please, can you wear um, Christmas jumpers? I was like, I don't own a Christmas jumper. And I'm fairly sure I'm not going to be able to buy one in July. I think I've got <laughs> one that lights up, but I honestly don't know where it is because that was like five years ago. I do like them, but not in July because I can't find them in July. I mean, also not very funny. It's like... But I like this. This is much better than a Christmas <laughs> jumper. So, yes, got the family <laughs> turkey. Amazing. Oh, we love Christmas in July, though, because it's always a fabulous weekend. Yeah. Full of deals. And historically, Christmas in the July is Christmas in the July. Sorry, Christmas in July at Jewelry Maker is a huge weekend. You know, a mm. bit like our birthday celebration. Yeah, it is. It's amazing stuff. It's bought for, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. It's bought for. So I like those bought for weekends. And me. You always get incredible pieces. Well, let's tell you about those, shall we? Because. Your deal of the day today. Shall we start with the deal of the day? Is that, does that seem to make sense? Yeah. So your deal of the day today. We are massive fans. I can't take myself seriously ser with this. Uh, massive fans of your sterling silver, aren't we? Because yes. it's a must, especially with the gemstones that we work with here at Jewelry Maker. Um, but not often do we actually get them in all the different colours. Now, your deal of the day today is silver or gold-plated gold silver or rose gold-plated silver in your chain. So we've got chain by the metre length. Ooh. Now, remember the other day, and I was actually saying the biggest auction that I've ever done in jewelry maker history here was a quantity of 2,000. Mm -hmm. It wasn't on a gemstone. It wasn't on a kit. Mm -hmm. It was lengths by the, by the metre of sterling silver chain. And you don't often see the gold plated. No. And the rose gold no. plated, do you? Sterling silver, yeah. that's amazing. Well, we've got quantities of those lovely jewelry makers. We have 200 of the silver. Um, oh, a bit more limited on the yellow gold and the rose. We've got 50 of each of those. So coming up at 10 o'clock. And these could be your extended chains. You can, yep. uh, this style of link means that you don't have to be a solderer to work with it. Definitely, and you know, you can make your charm bracelet. You can basically get anything through those links that you want to. Yeah. So I think that this is the kind of chain that I run out of constantly. All the time. Especially in silver. Yeah. Well, stock up on those. They're coming up at 10 o'clock today. Can I also show you an early bird? Because you can shop ahead on this and it's absolutely adorable. Um, Tiffany's Eat Your, I've got, hang on. Hang on. Um, eat Your Heart Out. And did you? Did you? Ross is just saying he saw a woman wearing that exact Tiffany & Co necklace. What, this one? The one with the toggle that we show on air? Did you? Well... Oh, was it? It's quite small. Oh, OK. Oh, that's okay. so pretty. So, <laughs> well, then her bank balance, you know, she'd probably, you know, she'll need a considerable bank balance to afford a Tiffany's and yep. piece. Look at how adorable this toggle oh, is. It's gorgeous. It features, a uh, it features a cultured pearl in 925 sterling silver. Now, you can shop ahead on these. It's your early bird this morning. And I've got a quantity of 150 of them, and they are going crazy, crazy low for the detail. Isn't that a lovely? I mean, that on a length of chain just at the front. I'd have it at the front. Yeah, me Most too. Most definitely do, like a lariat sort of design yeah and you could even add some more uh, charms or pearls to the actual little heart that's so pretty so beautiful so so beautiful um look what sorry we're already on the website if you want to mm. shop on this we're already at 29.99 and it is going lower ah. it is going lower so 150 might seem like loads not when we're starting here and you know that we don't like to finish where we start so um that's coming up shop ahead on that along with all the other items nine o'clock today um we've got the most where is it i saw it earlier on here we go the most amazing bundle of mixed color natural 
freshwater pearls and wait until you see this color palette they're absolutely beautiful um let me show you all those Ooh. i know aren't they stunning and, then the pearls. and how often do we see that shape <gasps> look at the colors yeah look at those colors there those those oh they're unbelievable aren't they they look better in real life everyone they do because <laughs> we're actually looking at the side profile of them aren't we really? yeah but, yeah um full of luster totally natural in their color as well so these are coming up look, oh there they are oh. these are coming up at nine o'clock today so um, we don't often see those and they are let me just double check before I say it yeah they're your um, beautiful through drill buttons yeah through drill buttons so you could use those with your deal of the day chain for example your kids today very high end very high very they're very very, very posh end. today they are well if you look at the necklace on the end um see if you can guess the gemstone oh yeah we go oh, that looks like a little octopus I know. I thought you looked like a little jellyfish. He does. That's it, jellyfish. That's right. He's a jelly. For. Well, it, yeah, that wasn't what I was going for, but then when it was done, I thought, oh. oh no, it's beautiful. <laughs> I love that. That's grand digerite. I know. Grand digerite alongside multitudes of your head pins. So if you're yeah. desperate for head pins, Make sure you're with Debbie for a nine o'clock kits because they're amazing, aren't they're they? They're sterling and they've got lovely little motifs on the end. So I immediately thought stud earrings. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, you think of the faff of getting out a little heart and then getting the post and then soldering it and blah, blah, blah. I'm going to show you how you can make stud earrings out of those head pins. Perfect. But all you do is but butterfly backs. Is that yeah, all? yeah. Good to go. And then your 12 o'clock kids? <gasps> well, we've got three boxes of leather cord, um, all different colours. Um, and you've got the, all of different style end caps to go on and all of the findings that you need as well. So that's so, so useful. Oh, my goodness me. Uh, so if you love the looks with these jadeites, which have been specially set for today's show, mm. they are coming up today. So we've sold the items individually. Mm. But for those of you maybe that don't wire work, that don't gem set yep. um, or don't bead bezel, these are set in sterling silver. So all you need to do is either attach them to the leather yes. that we're bringing you by the way brand new they are yep. or simply feed them onto a chain so these are also being launched today so um you can cast your eyes across the entire desk there's loads of absolutely beautiful goodies um i also need to mention that on the web and it is web only um you can get 40 percent off all beads to celebrate your international beading week, use the code BEADS40. 40%! 40 we said that in unison then, Ross, didn't we? That's loads, in isn't unison. it? In unison. You know, you say it out loud and then all of a sudden it registers and sinks in. Yeah. 40% is amazing. A lot. It's almost 50. <laughs> it's not far off 50, is it? That's, oh, is it? In, it doesn't seem a year since International Beading Week last no, year. No, no. Totally, no. So every time I shake my head, the leg goes... I'm trying to take you seriously. I'll get used to looking at you with that on your head and it won't even register in a minute. Yeah, but also, when I like, so I was thinking earlier, I was like, I can't, I can't talk to you about these amazing jades <laughs> with a turkey on my head. I think that just adds to it. Can you, can you imagine if for one spontaneous moment, like Sotheby's decide to tune in? Or a high-end jeweller, you know, which we do have high-end jewellers that source jadeite from us. Can you imagine them tuning in? And here's, here's Al talking to you about the rarity of jadeite, you know, <laughs> the turkey on the red. <laughs> and also, I was trying to figure out, is my head the head? <laughs> or oh, yeah, am I down the other end? <laughs> which end am I? You're the head. You're I'm the, I think I'm the you're head, head end. Okay, so I almost want to turn my head upside down and go, oh! <laughs> I was going to go, Pagar, I thought, no, that's the wrong animal. <laughs> I watched a little video. I watched a video on YouTube the once, um, and a woman stood in a. They were talking. Oh, it was a newsreader, and they were talking about the shortages of turkeys. Oh, yeah. One year, and and she kept laughing, and every time she laughed, the turkeys would be like, oh, woo, 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 around her. <laughs> it was so funny every time she laughed. Oh, they thought she was communicating with her. <laughs> yeah basically hilarious Aww. right then lovely jewelry makers we're gonna have a lot of fun it's christmas in july here at jewelry maker i know it's something only we understand <laughs> even my husband's it's what it's what it's what 
Christmas. It's Christmas. Don't even bother trying to explain it now. Um, anyway, so have a little look on the website because you know it's lounge hour in the eight o'clock hour. So take a little look, see if there's anything that you fancy. Know that some of these items will be a little bit more limited in their quantity. Some of them are very plentiful. Some will be locked at their price. Some will be going even lower. E wow. Um, amazing. That's for the one for the presenter reel, isn't it? <laughs> Fabulous. Um, yeah, there's your star buys. Oh, you can shop ahead on those pearls. Okay, you can shop ahead on those. You've got sterling silver toggles. You've got some chalcedonies. You've got some, oh, I love, oh, those mame zircons are amazing. Uh, <coughs> you've got a couple of those gem set baroque pearls. Amazonite, you've got within there sterling silver chains. Um, spacer beads. In fact, we're going to start with the spacer bead. Get your messages in, everybody. Come and say hello to Debbie and I. It's lovely to be with you, darling. And you, Miss, well, Miss Turkey. Miss Turkey, yeah. Should we, should we name Turkey? Yeah. Should we name it? Terence the Turkey. Terence, okay. Terence the Turkey. Oh, <laughs> Be doing that. Be tired, yeah. Last time it was, and today it's, yeah, yeah, yeah. You do that better than me, that turkey sound. It's obviously a natural gift. Do you reckon? Yeah. Oh, there you go. I have talents I didn't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know I had. Um, here we go. Starting oh, with the sterling silver space sardis beads. Yeah. Oh, they're back, but. But um, they always absolutely fly out the door. You get 20 of them in total and you're getting a mixture of your sizes. So from your two and a half to three, four to six millimetres. Look at those. It's like they're parve set with beautiful diamonds. Hello, Margot. I just opened my eyes to lovely people. How nice. Oh, I love Debbie's work. Good morning, talented Aww. crew. Thank you. What, Isn't that sweet? What a lovely comment to start the show off with. Absolutely. Thank and you. I'm, oh, that's lovely. Open your eyes to us as well. Morning, Margot. Morning. Morning, lovely. Thank you for your message. Right, let's get cracking, oh. shall we? Look at all that beautiful luster and sparkle. Absolutely stunning. Yeah, like they were rolled in melee diamonds, giving you all that lovely brilliance. It's not. It's all this, uh, the texturing of that precious metal. We're at £19.99. pence. I'm happy. Are you happy? Are you happy? I'm ecstatic. Yeah, over the moon. Over the moon. Always happy. Next crash, though, says Roscoe. We were at a pound per space of eat, not right, bad, considering yeah, no. the 925 sterling silver. We're now at 75p. Woo! 75p per starter space of eat. But we are starting your Christmas in July with sterling silver, pack of 20, under £10 for you today. Oh, there that you is go. good. That's very good. We used to sell them in packs of 10, didn't we? We did. And they just lift a design. Yeah, they do. You know, you just put those in amongst any gemstone and it just lifts it yeah. immediately. Gives it a completely different kind of luxurious feel. Totally agree. And you only need one. I know. I only need one. You so can smart. even, if I try and pivot this one forward. On a chain. Stay, yeah, feed them straight direct onto a chain. That would be lovely, wouldn't it? Um, use them with the sterling silver head pins that we've got coming yep, up absolutely. as well. Make sure you check it out because we said it out loud. How many do we have, Roscoe? Exactly 20 available out of the 300 that we originally Ooh. launched. You're up and at it this morning, though. Well done. Mitha says, I'll have two, thanks. Uh, Yorkshire and Karen and John in Norfolk and Lynn and Valerie and Swansea and Kathy and Michelle. Good morning, everybody. Happy Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> la, 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 la. What's your favourite Christmas song? Did you know that was going to be the next oh. question? I, uh, I, I like so many. <coughs> okay, favourites. Uh, last Christmas. No, it's got to be up there. Um, I love all the hymns. Yeah. I like a bit of Michael Bublé Christmas. Yeah. I like Alleluia. I like uh, that one too. Oh, and oh, oh, Holy Night. Yeah, I love that. Oh. Love that by Il Devo, I like. Oh, I love them. They are. Il Devo, do you remember Il Devo? Yeah, they were I mean, amazing. It makes, when they hit the high notes, it just makes you have It's the spots. guy with the really deep bone. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. He's he died. A, no. Yeah, one of the guys from El Devo died. Oh, no. Yeah, a while ago. But I'm talking a couple of years ago, but their voices just worked in this incredible perfectly. harmony, didn't it? Sorry, I put a downer on that, didn't oh, I? Oh, really do you know what I was about to say? I'd love to go and see them in concert. I, I don't know if they're still touring. They might still be touring. Um, well done, everybody. I think these are almost sold out. Hello, California. Hello to Jacqueline and Julia, Michelle and Julia, Nottinghamshire and Lynn and Valerie and Robert and your cousin <laughs> and Swansea. Uh, what, are they, what are they singing in the gallery right now? <laughs> oh, it's not a Christmas song. E17, Stay Another Day is not a Christmas oh, song. Oh, no. It just happened to be out at Christmas. So, 
No, I don't like that song. It gets on my nerves. No, I'm not a fan of E17. Although I did like when they brought it out. Steam. That's the only lyric I, I know. It's the only word I know to that one. Amazing. Steam. Yeah, text in. What's your favourite Christmas song? There's a few, isn't there? There's, Pogues has got to be in there, hasn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Pogues. Uh, what about Shaken Stevens? Oh, no, I do like rocking around the Christmas tree. Rocking around. Is that, is that Kim Wilde? No, there's an, there's an original, isn't there, from oh. the 60s. I like all of them. Yeah, they're all good. They're all good. Um, oh. And what time, uh, what time of the year, uh, what day, more specifically, do you allow Christmas carols to start being played in your house? <laughs> See, I'm pre-December. Pre oh, me too. Yeah, pre-December. I'm pre-December. Tom's like, no, you can't. It's too much to effort to just to have it. it to have it for like a week or something. Yeah, absolutely. Because yeah. I do go all out. And me, and me. It's the best time of year. I love it. Um, Eleven ninety nine only for your beautiful man-made. So these are man-made, but you get like like with your zircons. Um, you get absolutely beautiful, Ooh, so beautiful pretty. light performance. So amazing amounts of luster. These flew, absolutely flew on their launch, which was not that long ago, by the way. And I know we haven't got many of them left now. Originally, I think they were part of a kit, weren't they? Oh, the blacks were never in the kits, but the other ones were. But I know these absolutely flew. These, I'm thinking alongside your jade carvings, wouldn't these be nice to spend them from? Yeah, I mean, you can obviously, you can take the jade carvings and just put them on a chain or on a cord or whatever. Or you can add a little something, can't you? Little, and little make them your something. own. Add yeah, a little, a little summon, something. Summon, summon, summon. Um, you can do all your, your stitches, like that bracelet that you created. Yes. What's it called again? Capriccio. Oh, the Capriccio. I almost feel like that should be an Italian restaurant. We're doing it again. Are you? Yeah, we're going to do a special kit for it. Love so. it. Love it. £6.99 yeah. only uh, for your beautiful man-made zircon. But now, um, if we can, we're going to squeeze it under £5. How many have we got left, Roscoe? We've got quantity. OK. Just under 50 available, but at £4.99, they're not going to hang around. Use them as an alternate to spacers. Yeah, they're lovely in between, sort of maybe pearls. Also, if you're doing your seat beading, <coughs> excuse me, uh, the three mil is a lovely size yeah. to stitch in with. Yeah, stunning. Here we go. I can show it alongside some lovely pearls. No, I haven't got. I haven't got any issues with that. That's beautiful. Instead like of that. your, instead of knotting, actually go for, um, <coughs> go for, go for a man-made gemstone. Um, Ross is saying he likes jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle, jingle bell, bell rock. rock. So do a I. Jingle bell. <laughs> Lethal weapon. Um, that's. Is that no? That reminds me of Home Alone. Oh, yes. Home Alone. Home Alone. Oh, did you just say that? I'm sorry. <laughs> there's, a, there's a house in Aswood Bank. Adam will probably know this because it's his neck of the woods. There's a house in Aswood Bank, just as you're leaving Aswood Bank near to the studio, that is exactly like the Home Alone oh, house. Oh, really? <laughs> exactly like it. Every time I walk past them, I'm like, Home Alone. <laughs> it, 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 it totally looks like it. It's amazing, this house. Um, <clears throat> it's further down from the school. Maybe they did it on purpose. Maybe. Maybe. And it's at what age? Do you know, do you know the mummy, uh, the mummy, the mum and dad in Home Alone mm. were like in their late 30s? Yeah. Do you ever wonder what he did for a career to be able to afford a house like that? <laughs> it was a pretty amazing house. Three ninety nine only. The houses. Have you ever noticed in American films? Yeah. They walk into a mansion and the person's sleeping over and they put them on the couch. Yes. And you're like, but you must have like ten bedrooms in there. Oh, oh, we'll just put you on the couch. Yeah. It's like Macaulay Culkin sleeping in the attic. That's what I mean. Yeah. And he's got a massive house. And you're like, well, surely you've got a spare bedroom. You must have. <laughs> $3.99 only to get hold of these, everybody. That's good, $3.99. Very good, yeah. So your Capriccio, you could get these and you could be making along with Debbie in that show that's on the horizon. Or tassels. I love them for tassels and pearls. Tassels. Yeah. Dotted in between your pearls, absolutely. You know what to do. We had 50 of them. Make sure you're checking them out, though, everybody, because they will be flying, yeah. Um, same as, you know, we had glass beads the other day or acrylic or 
uh, um, your cubic zirconias. We embrace them. Shaolene's stocking up on these. Amazing. Well done, lovely. Sandy's multi-bought as well. Kathy, you know, Shaolene, you've taken, uh, you know, we had 50 and you've got 10. So amazing. They're, they're absolutely flying out the door. Make sure you're checking them out though um, because it's Christmas in July where we're going to be, what's on our radar? Sparkle. Oh, yes. All things sparkly. Because actually on the back of what Wayne said, I was like, right, go to the wardrobe, see if I can find anything sparkly. Um, hello, me saying these zircons are beautiful. I was hesitant, hesitant at first, but they're fire and sparkle. Won me over. Oh, well, that's good because they are lovely. They are absolutely amazing. Yeah, I get it. You know, and the same, we don't, you know, if you're a sea beater, they're man-made. So yeah, why, exactly. wouldn't we, uh, why wouldn't we embrace these as well? Um, hello, Mandy saying morning. Um, I can't stand Christmas. I'm a Halloween girl. Oh, I love Halloween. Enough. Yeah, I like Halloween too. Uh, but the Monkeys Christmas album <laughs> has some cracking songs. Hey, hey with the monkeys. Right. Well, monkey around. That's what my dad that does. Yeah. Because uh, you know, you know, like proper dad dancing. If ever you were at disco or sort of disco, <laughs> like, I'm sure I'm my dad would be like that. I know this one. My dad used to dance like that with his arms. It was like, <laughs> it was very amusing. <laughs> I used to look at the thing. Not, nothing else sent him to move, but it's, if he got really excited, his arms would go. <laughs> That's amazing. My dad's, my dad's favourite party trick dance yeah. move, like, come on, Lynn. So you get my mum up. <laughs> come on, Lynn, up you get. And they'd start dancing. And uh, of course, mum's shoulders would be going. <laughs> as, you know, the, I've, I've, don't worry, I've inherited the shoulder dance as well. And then dad, dad's trick would be like this. And she'd come in. Oh, I right. love that. <laughs> it's adorable. <That's> so cute. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fabulous. Right, on to <laughs> toggle. I bet you've never seen a person with a turkey on their head no. do that before. <laughs> right now he'd right now he'd be going, Yeah, I did that. I did that. I didn't do it with a turkey on my head though, did I? <laughs> <laughs> Joke's on you, Elle. That's brilliant. Um, <laughs> oh, these are so beautiful. Look at the selection of toggles that you're getting here. So in total is five. Here we go. Ooh. I don't know if you can see them from there. Um, so yeah, you've got five different sterling silver toggles. You've got your very contemporary. You've got your very <laughs> Tiffany's. You could very much personalise that um, square one. Yeah. You could stamp onto that or engrave onto that, couldn't you? Or you could even set a little gemstone on yeah, there. Yeah, perfect. Well, just think about the deal of the day that's coming up, your length of chain. All you need to do is just attach it with yeah. a jump ring or a featherweight head pin, which yep. we've also got in today's show as well. So these will be fantastic with your deal of the day, folks. So, um, yeah, we brought them an absolutely unbelievable deal. And we, if you remember, we spoke at length about toggles. I didn't realise toggles were, were actually um, invented, what they think anyway, in the, in the medieval times. Really? I yeah. didn't know that. Uh, <clears throat> it's one of, the, one of the first ever clasps of toggle. Ooh. There you go. Um, but these days, of course, they're worn as a feature, not yeah. just as a class. They actually wear them um, to the rev uh, not just at the back, they wear them at the front. Mm. 19.99 gets you all five. You haven't got to choose. That gets really you all good. of those lovely details from the contemporary to the modern to the classic to the traditional. Mm, I think that they are so useful. Yeah. And again, so many designers are using those at the front of yeah. their designs or as the feature yeah. rather than, you know, just something to do up. Yeah, the piece. Definitely. Well, we've shown that mulberry one, which um, seems to stick in my memory, mm. where it's got quite a big statement toggle clasp at the front. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, 500 quid, by the <gasps> way. Yeah, it's a lot oh, of gas. No, no, no. um, in 48 seconds, though, apparently we're going low. Have we got quantity, Roscoe? 30, okay. Now, there's quite a lot of sterling silver in today's show, which I'm really excited about mm. um, because we have been desperate for it. Sorry, I've just clocked Debbie your bracelet. That's amazing. Um, <coughs> sorry, just sidetracked there by Debbie's blink. Um, <laughs> lots of sterling silver in today's show. If you're, so if you're you know, crying out for your essentials, then you're in exactly the right place. We're going even lower than 1999. Even lower. And you do get all five of them. Yeah, I had to film that promo, Ross, yes, uh, on, on, what day was it? Yeah, on Wednesday. Um, I said Ross's. Or did I say Ross? I might have said Roscoe's. Because I call you Roscoe, don't I? Um, yeah, Roscoe's stash, stash grab coming up tomorrow. Ooh. Yeah. Amazing. So Is again, that tomorrow? Yeah. Oh, All okay. your essentials coming up tomorrow. Uh, 12 99 Goodness me. That is so good. That's like, how much? Two, three, four, four. 
No, £2.50, something like that. Is that right? That is so good. About two fifty per cup toggle. Don't ask me to do maths without using my fingers. Two pound fifty nine. I'm impressed with myself there for a second. I mean, I'm impressed. Yeah, I'm not very good at maths. You did all that with a turkey on your head. <laughs> not many people could do that, you no. know. I know. <laughs> Never let it be said that we're not happy to take make fun of ourselves. Oh, I've had yeah. um, bunny years. Yeah. on at Easter before. I really enjoyed that show, these big ears. Do, yeah. Do. yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Elka. <laughs> Adam has just said, whatever you get up to in your own time. Well, you know, just answering the door with, uh, with yeah, bunny yeah, ears. Well, bunny <laughs> ears, yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, Debbie, yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Um, make sure you're checking them out. Fabulous. Congratulations. I've got the most beautiful strand coming up in a few moments' time. Oh, I saw my husband sold, uh, sent me the funniest, uh, the funniest video. So it's a woman who's uh, um, answered the door to a, a, a DPD or something yeah. like that, one of those delivery guys. And, you know, they take a photo. You know, they take a photo yeah, yeah, to, yeah. to obviously to prove <laughs> delivery. <laughs> anyway, um, the husband phones her and he said... Uh, I've just had a, an email saying that my parcel's been delivered. She goes, yeah, 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 I've got it here. She's like, he's like, yeah, T I, I'm going to send you the photograph. I'm going to send you the photograph that he took of you receiving this parcel. <laughs> and <laughs> she's answered the door just with a boob out because she's just been feeding the baby. And the photo is her like this and one boob. <laughs> tickled me. So tickled me. And you can imagine the DPD guy like, <laughs> yeah, but I bet he didn't want to say because he was in bad. So, yeah, she'll be feeding the baby, just a boob out. Um, anyway, <laughs> how about some beautiful calcedony, everyone? I love this strand, and I think this would go absolutely stunning with those zircons. Oh, yes. And the cubes. I have the cubes too. Okay, so we're going to start with the cubes, but I'm going to show you the two together. Look at that. Oh, it's like a powder blue. I love this blue. And Me I'm not too. really a blue girl. Are you not? No, but I love this blue. It's, it's more like, like um, oh, I've gone blank. What's it called? Yeah, blue lace agate. Blue lace agate. agate, there you go. That blue lace agate blue, I find very calming. It is, yeah, absolutely. Um, it goes beautifully <gasps> with pearls. Yes. It goes amazing with white pearls. We're going to start with the cubes, which if I just move that one there to um, avoid any confusion. So... Uh, I mean, cubes, you can still do a lot of the techniques that you can do with your rounds, can't you? Absolutely, because if you think of uh, when we use sort of delicates in seed beading, they're like more sort of square little shapes. Yeah. So they fit together in different configurations. I love the sparkle on these. Yeah, they're gorgeous, I didn't gorgeous, expect these they? to be so sparkly. I love calcedony as well. I think calcedony's got this really lovely semi-translucency. Yeah. Look at those! Yeah. You know when a cube is so much more than a cube? Do you see where I'm coming from? Yeah. They've got like crown facets on these. Oh my goodness me, is there many of them available in the, vo in the vault? 20 of each. Okay. We've got the, the sort of faceted rondelles in a, uh, coming your way as well if you want to secure both. Going to get an amazing deal on these, says Roscoe. Not your price. Going lower than £24.99. pence. Lower. How low can you go? How low can you jingle go? Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bell bells. Uh, Muppets, they sing Christmas carols, don't they? What is oh, their Christmas Oh, I love word? Muppet Christmas carol. I like Kermit. And me. Kermit. And the rats. I like the rats. Yeah. Heat wave! <laughs> this is my island in the sun. <laughs> $24.99. Anyone tunes in thinking, what on earth is going on right now? Well, they've asked Mr. Scrooge for a lump of coal for the fire, haven't they? Yeah, and that's he's like, right. No. And then they pretend that they're in a, on some tropical island. This is my island in the sun. Love it. I'm a big kid, really. Uh, we're going even lower. How many have we got? Do you say 20? Right. And of the rondelles. Okay. That beautiful heavenly blue. You know, it's almost angel-like blue, it but is. with translucency, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it really is. These are not going to hang around, says the boys in the gallery. My goodness me, no, they're not. Again, tassels, they'd be quite nice, wouldn't they? Quite a gorgeous. modern tassel. 
Yeah, because you, as it moves, you're going to get that beautiful flash of yeah. ooh, light and stunning. Just Don't forget your deal of the day that's coming up as well, because mm. you've got lengths of sterling silver chain that you could almost tessellate some of these from. Hello, Alison saying, I love these cubes. Into a beady bead, real sparkle. Great yes, idea. Yes, that's Lovely. a great idea. Because I guess then you get, Alison, these angles, I suppose. And you would then, yeah, and you could put it in between the chain. Nice. Because I like that look of beady bead and then a bit of chain and another one. Almost like a station yeah, bead. Yeah, beautiful. And there's so many different ones you can make. Yeah, loving that. How about this? Alongside, how about uh, alongside your d early bird, sorry, your early bird sterling silver heart and That's pearl toggle so clasp. Really designer. dainty. So designer. Really dainty, just putting that heart on the bottom. Loads um, of people are wearing like their stack of necklaces and then a little strand of gemstones at the top, just like that. Just in the nape of the Just neckline. in the yeah. nape. Yeah, I can see that. That's what I'm thinking. I'm visualizing just that that single pearl, sweet little tea, uh, toggle clasp on the, t on the calcedony just at the front. Love it. Love it. 12 dollars but again, these are absolutely flying out the door. Well done, everybody. Linda and Tim, Mary in Lancashire, Cardiff, Ruby, London. Hello to you, Meath, Genoifa. Hello to you, Angela, Sandra, Linda, Annette and Wendy. Uh, lovely to be with you this festive morning. <laughs> Is it snowing? We had a barbecue last night. Did you? I love yeah. a barbecue. Yeah. You know, just trying to, the irony of it all, you know, it's probably summertime barbie. But then if you're, your salads. if you're in Australia, yeah, it's normal. they have barbies at Christmas, don't yeah, they? Yeah, it's normal. Yeah, totally. My sister lived in Australia for a period of time and she spent Christmas Day on the beach. Yeah. Yeah. Very different very to us, different. isn't it? Very, very different. Uh, 12 99 these are on the verge of selling out, everybody. We've got the faceted rondelles coming up as well. I think this is the perfect combination to go alongside your early bird. Just, the, I don't know, it's that lovely, really delicate powder light blue will work. So shop ahead on both of those. Well done, everybody. We're on the verge of selling out of this one. Mary in Argyll and Butte, Lancashire. Well done, Sandra. Congratulations. So straight into your rondelles, which are beautiful linear in their faceting I love these so shall I just shall I just scooch you that over yeah I mean look at that just one little heart use <coughs> excuse me yeah look now slightly bigger carrot weight on this one I love that little necklace you've made there that's really lovely it's a bit of you isn't it and it's a bit it's very sort of designer like you'd see that for like three figures yeah there, absolutely you? And if you can make it that's extra special just using some of your silks or maybe beading wire or yeah it's tiger tail tiger tail that'll work won't it mm -hmm. um even here at 39.99 like i said you've shopped ahead on this one look at that blue it definitely has this blue lace agate beauty about absolutely it absolutely does i know we're talking different gemstones here but it has that sort of like summer's day sky vibes yeah it's a completely different blue it's very recognizable yeah. not many gemstones have this blue. I mean, they, those are the only two i can think of yeah they're just um yeah because angelite's more opaque yeah it, it's calming mm. well it is it, you know when i look at it I, it's a calming gemstone to me it's beautiful hang on i'm gonna put something else with it debbie what do you think to <gasps> that? if it's maybe a bit too delicate for you and you want some Ooh. bigger carrot weights how about alongside your Amazonite that's also in this hour. I know, delicious. Good luck. Now you have got a bigger carrot weight on this one. Obviously a different cut. And we're still bringing it to you your, for, for your Christmas in July deal. 12 99 That's good. That's ever so good. It is, isn't it? Because mm. there's a bigger carrot weight on this one. Mm. Um, well done. Do I have 20 of this one too? Yes, um, but they have proven to be really, really popular. Could you do like a bubble styles with the deal of the day? Yeah, definitely. And you could, do, what I like to do is have like a slightly larger gemstone. So think about maybe a pearl yeah. and then a coloured gemstone either side. I've actually done it on that necklace I was just right looking on the at, end. I was just looking at it there. Um, if you look at the necklace right at the end on the green bust, yeah. on the large jump ring, I've put a little, if you go up to the, large, the side to the large jump rings, that's it. I've put a little cluster and I like ah. to put like a pearl and then two little gemstones either side. It's quite effective. <coughs> so think about doing that on a bracelet, like on every other link or yeah, something. Lovely. That would be so pretty, wouldn't it? Yeah, gorgeous. Loving that. I definitely think that should be a jellyfish necklace. I really like that Jelly. one. Jellyfish. They are beautiful, aren't they, jellyfish? They're so amazing. Like well, sometimes we go to the deep in Hull and it's like a huge aquarium and they've got this huge thing it goes from the floor to the ceiling and there's all jellyfish there. they are so beautiful and they're quite ethereal yeah. space-like really yeah. and they're so so beautiful i mean you wouldn't want to get stung by them but yeah. you know they are they are beautiful you, you could appreciate them, their amazing. beauty yeah. yeah 
Um, I, I went years and years and years ago. I went on a cruise ship. And, and I remember, I can't remember exactly where we were, but we were sort of going into port, is that what they call mm -hmm. it? Anyway, and I remember looking over the side and just seeing a mass of jellyfish everywhere mm. um, and just watching the movement that you get. This would be perfect for your jellyfish, wouldn't it? If you're it inspired works. by our lovely Debbie's. In fact, you could work it with Debbie's uh, kits in the next hour. That would hour. be really pretty, yeah. Incorporate it alongside the Tanzanite or alongside your Grand Digirite that's Ooh. coming up. Um, these are on the verge of selling out uh, or, as well. So well done, everybody. Congratulations. Make sure you're checking out on those. And don't forget your early birds. Um, shall we do... Oh, the strands, right. Okay, I was looking individually then. <laughs> Not single pearls, yeah. Strands of pearls. Oh, these with your chalcedony would be amazing. These with your kits would be amazing. You do, I just can't get enough. I've got a, I've given myself, and I don't know how long it's going to last, a, a pearl buying ban. Right. Because our pearls are so amazing that I keep buying them. So over the last weekend, I sat down and I made all the jewellery that I wanted to make for myself with the pearls that I had. And I've still got loads left over. But I used a, strand, a couple of strands like this. And then I had a, another strand that had like a mixed colour. Mm -hmm. And I rosary, li kept rosary linking, kept rosary linking, kept rosary linking till it comes oh. sort of down to my navel. So then I can put it over my head again and have like a choker and the long thing. Oh, lovely. And it's really, really effective. And I just interspersed with, you know, when you get a couple of larger pearls that you get left off of strands. But wh why have you... Why, why would you sign yourself up to a pearl ban? Well, I thought, you know, I need to really use the ones I've got. <laughs> But this is probably last till about one when I get on the app. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Let's be really I love pearls. And for our too. prices, yeah. uh, you know, I just think, oh, goodness, I couldn't get that anywhere else for that. Especially natural pink pearls. That's like, what I mean. These are not dyed. Do you remember the days when we only had dyed yeah. coloured pearls? Yeah, yeah. Only dyed. And now I'm a bit of a snob. Yeah, me too. Because I can be. Yeah, and also because there's not that big a difference in price point no. to what we used to do dyed pearls no. for. So two strands of natural papaya pink, which is if you speak to if you speak to Charlie, Charlie Barron actually says that the pink pearls are the most popular. Right. Um, whether it's a solid colour or whether it's their overtone, that's the most popular colour. Here we are bringing you the two strands for what's effectively a hundred pounds each. Oof. Yeah, I mean, we say it every time, don't we? You try and find natural pink pearls on a high street for anywhere near what's on your screens yeah. right now. Yeah. So, unbelievable deal. I think it's one of our greatest strengths. Now, £100 a strand. How about we bring you the pair mm. for less than the price that one is? Ooh. I had to re sit, think about how I was going to word this. Under £100... For the two. And you know what I love about these pink pearls, and you'll see it if you, if you get them when you work with them, the colour, other colours that come off them yeah. as in different lights. Yeah. And, and you put something else with them and it kind of brings out a different colour. They, they reflect the colours of their surroundings, pearls. Yeah, so like they're your skin amazing. tone, etc. So, and, and pearls have overtones and undertones, mm. they have a body colour, so there's lots of different things, to, to you know, so much more than the five virtues. Um, so yeah, we've said it out loud, we're going to go to a double figure price point and that gets you both. And they're not dyed. These are natural pink pearls, which is astonishingly rare. And um, when we start talking about strands, which we do a lot here at Jewelry Maker, it's not just the fact that you've got the five virtues. That five virtues is really discussing one, one single pearl. Yeah. You have to. Add, it's six when you're talking about strands because you have to add also, uh, um, you know, how complementary the matching of them. There's five of them left within the vault. Mm. You've still got your split pay as well. Se oh. <laughs> Ooh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> that is amazing. And you know, I'm obsessed with watching those YouTube videos of people getting pearls out of the oysters. Yeah. You know, they get like one or two. Yeah, and people I think, pay probably more than what's on your screen. Exactly. And I think to myself, how do they get the, the pearls to all match and the strands for the price that... It takes years. It's amazing. Matching is, is, is like the sixth virtue, if you like. Mm. So, um, yeah, we had five. Is that right, Ross? Oh, five okay. left as we speak. Straight away, you've got collectors um, in London and in Yorkshire multi-buying. 
Um, I'm not surprised I would do two. I've got four of them left now, everybody. So make sure you are checking these out. That's an amazing, amazing deal. Because Especially wedding jewellery. If, you, yes. if you're someone who, who has a business making wedding jewellery or you know, occasion jewellery or even a special present. Mm. You know, pearls are timeless, aren't yeah. they? That's an amazing And not everybody price. wants the traditional pure white pearl. No, no. But normally you'd have to pay a premium for a naturally coloured pearl. Think Tahitian pearls. You know, mm. Tahitian pearls, the reason why they're as expensive as they are, um, all right, they form in salt water, is because of their colour. The mm. colour is so distinctive. Um, same applies when you're talking about your purples and your papayas. Well done to you, Anne, as well. I've only got a couple of these left now. Um, make sure you are checking those out. Fabulous. Moving on on to oh this is unbelievable now this is one of our new pieces right this i beg your part oh i was gonna say oh right i got confused sorry my bad I know which I know which I'm gravitating. That's the thing. Now this is a closeout deal. Um, if you work with things like gallery wire or your bezel strips or bee bezeling, there's only ten of these available. Um, you've got birds and flowers oh. hand carved into your high goo. We are going to do a closeout deal on this. It hasn't been on your screens for about a year. Um, oh my goodness, that's so low, so so <laughs> so low. Look at the split pay. Oh, that's really, really good. This is a beautiful one as well. I love yeah. the, the flowers and oh. Uh, apparently, historically, flowers and birds um, are um, symbolic of love and in particular young love. Oh. How lovely is that? I mean, just pop that on Lark Said Not. But don't forget your deal of the day that's coming up. It'd be lovely on that chain too. It would. That's a major closeout deal, lovely jewellery makers. We've got your high goo symbol. Now, the high goo can be plain or carved. Historically, they were both. Mm. You know, um, the high goo symbol, which has immense meaning, and I've been re learning recently, not just in Chinese culture, Incas and Mayans also right. used high goos because they believe they were protective of their home, their family, and their livestock. So, you know, this is something that is international effectively we call them more we call them donuts here don't we in, yeah. in, in the west so not quite so romantic not as really. a haigu however still very you know just a lark said not that's all you need to do that is all you need to do and you know if you're gonna you could even put some sterling or like, you know with with the lovely uh, gemstone set in across the top you could do a lovely sterling silver motif on there if you're so you know i think there's so many options for whatever kind of jewelry that you make absolutely that you can do with something like this absolutely 12 pound 49 on your four split payments goodness me that's very good did we have quantity of these we oh 10 jane's got hers claire's got hers i've got sharon and susan and cheryl and fiona and make a wanting four um make sure you do check them out you know if i had the time and remember it's lounge hour so i don't quite frankly <laughs> um but if i had the time you know um i would absolutely be referencing the places like first dibs etc no good sat in your basket says roscoe i mean look at that close out deal price tag when we launched this it would have been, I'm going to guess, probably 129, 149 when we launched it. Yeah? Now we're talking about £12.49 on your split payment. That's Cheryl Ann, you've got yours. Who was that? Sharon, you've just got yours. Amazing. I only had 10. Make her in. If you see your name, you need to check it out because uh, we're over allocated, natural fact. And if you don't see your name, you're thinking, oh, I wanted to get this. Look, you can jump ahead of everybody. Um, you can jump ahead of everybody. Like Tina, for example, if you check out your basket, it'll go straight to you. It's not confirmed to you in your basket if you don't make that confirmation. Shropshire, hello to you, Christine. I've got three left. Carolyn Oxfordshire is there as well on the web. Um, yeah, if you check out or you've pressed your option one on the phone lines, then you'll be successful. Amazing. Alison in Stockton on Tees. Good morning to you, lovely. I hope you're well. Um, happy Christmas. <laughs> it's so bizarre, isn't it? It is so bizarre. Um, well done, everybody. Stay where you are on those phone lines. <gasps> the, oh. One auction. I've got an idea for those. Have you? Hold that thought. Okay. Coming up. But right now, if you are a lover of the high goos, and these are amazing. I'm going to put them on a black background, I think, so you can actually see them. Now, these were an early bird. They've been on once. And out of the 150 that we had, 
I've got Ooh. just 16 of these left. Oh my goodness me, they're absolutely beautifully carved, aren't they? I think these are amazing and just the simplicity of them. Yeah. Just pop them on a chain, again, have them at the top of a necklace stack or, you know, something that you could wear all the time. It's going to feel lovely against the skin. You're yeah. not going to know you're wearing it. And you've got the benefit of having, you know, your jade next to your skin and... Just not, you know, it's not, not everyone wants a big statement pieces of jewellery, do they? No. Nope. This is very elegant and delicate. Oh, my goodness. Now, that's type A. When we say white, it, it can't get any whiter <laughs> than what's on your screen. I was screens, just going to say it? that's very white. It cannot get any purer. Um, yeah, that would be a nice name, wouldn't it? Like Ghost Jade. Oh, yeah. Because it's the purest ethereal white and then you have got your um gosh the most amazing apple green there's no polymer impregnation there's no dyeing there's no uh, uh, uh um heat treatment even because they do that sometimes with jade so it's not type b or type c this is type a grade which means totally and utterly naturally natural and also in terms of, of the future, I can't say the I word. Obviously, I'm not a financial advisor. However, um, really, the grade that you want to be getting is A um, yeah. because it means there's no enhancement whatsoever. These were a previous star buy. Um, you get both of them. You haven't got to choose. And at $49.99, straight away, we've got collector's multi-buying. Now, the first price crash is not your closing price. Really? What, this isn't your price? No. Oh, okay, that's amazing. For the pair. Hang on. Imagine. Oh yeah, rings. Set a gemstone in that. I think I've done that in a in a um, show once. I set a gemstone. I think it was a zircon in a tube setting, in the middle of the ring. I Beautiful. made a ring. Oh. I'm sure Claire's done that as well. I'm sure if you go on YouTube, you want to do that. I definitely did it, and I'm sure Claire's done it. She must have done it. Yeah, because we do those tube sets, don't we? That yes. you can put a gemstone in the yes. centre. A minute clock, we are going even lower, which is just madness. £20 for one of them is... Bearing in mind that white jadeite was once upon a time reserved exclusively uh, for the Empress. You know, this was not something that, you know, us mere mortals would ever be able to own. Yeah. Um, in fact, the consequences of owning white jadeite um, in that time, you know, were fairly significant. Let's just put it that way. You know, thankfully, this, this day and age, everybody can choose their favourite colours. There's, they're not dyed, they're not bleached in any way, shape or form. It's all Mother Nature. You get the both of them. So straight away at a tenner, for a gemstone that is one of the top ten rarest in the world. That's not my words. Look, that's Forbes, that's the Guinness Book of Records, that's, you know, or... or uh, uh, GIA, the rarest gems in the world, and probably moving its way up that list because, as we know, the Burmese mine is now closed. Mm. And here we are saying, oh, yeah, it's type A jade. We can't replace it. Our team are in China right now trying to. Don't know if they've been successful as of yet. That's amazing. That's an amazing price. £8.50. Yeah, that's just amazing. I mean, when you think... You, I, I just don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm trying to think, you know... That, you could do wire work rings if you, even if you're not a silversmith you can wire it you can just put anything through it because you've got that but, lovely space of hole in the middle can we put this into perspective and it's not really put it into perspective because actually jadeite is rarer than these gemstones but can we imagine for a second ever buying a, a brazilian Pareba tourmaline for eight pound fifty no 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 can we just you know for a second can you imagine can we imagine buying a natural pink diamond for eight pound fifty? No, 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 no. Or, or what? Yeah, taffetite. Yeah. Can you imagine buying any of those gemstones for eight pound fifty? No. You're not going to. And these are in that league of rarity and preciousness. And you might be thinking, well, how are you doing it then? I'm saying that because I know that if my brother were watching right now, he'd be saying those words. Well, how are you doing it now? We purchase very differently. And during COVID, yeah, we may, you know, we had opportunities to buy a big quantity, which we took. That, and we pass on those savings eight pound fifty though you know that's not the true re reflection of value so you can afford to get two and make earrings so yeah you could have like your lovely white jade earrings and your lovely green jade earrings yeah that, you know that's literally two pairs of earrings if you got two and that would be so beautiful eight pound fifty i can't get my head around that <laughs> me neither how many do we have of these that's blown my mind this morning 
Seven of them left. I can see way more than seven of you with it in your baskets. Maya, Jackie, Jill, London, multi-buying, Dawn, Mariska. Hello to you, lovely. Angela, Carola, multi-buying. Hello, lovely. Sue and uh, Maker in London, multi-buying. I've got Jennifer and Fiona in London. And Suja and Julie and Christine and Marcia and Brenda um, and Kent. Hello to you all. Make sure you do check out. You can still do it. But remember, you've got 11 minutes on this hour. Um, or until it's an on-screen sellout. And I think that's the latter is more than likely going to be yeah. the situation here. Good luck, everybody. Do shop ahead on your early bird as well. Um, early birds, I should say. So that's sterling silver heart toggle class and also um, the pearls. Let's do the Amazonite. These are the ones I was... <laughs> Give me that little shake, shake, shake. These are fabulous. Oh, they're so good. I just feed those onto a chain. Or put them on a cord. Yeah, put them on. if you're going to get one of the the carvings, yes, put one of these either side just as a little bit of interest. I think that would look beautiful. Yeah, amazing! You could feed them onto leather, couldn't you? you could Definitely. Feed them onto a macrame or a kumihime yeah. cord. The fact that you are getting twenty five carved amazonite, basically high goos, aren't they? I love amazonite. Me too. One of my absolute favourites. I love it. It's such a, well, it's a very jadeite colour, isn't it? I and I like the jingle jangle of them. So I'm thinking that I would want movement in what yeah. a piece that I did. So I, th I like your idea of putting them on a chain yeah. um, where they will just freely could move about. So even if you just put three on a free chain. And, free, free the donuts. <laughs> I would have this conversation you know, you know. they're not going to let us work together no <laughs> no only our only free the amazonite uh, free the donuts <laughs> I don't, it's only us really that would actually come into that conversation i know i feel yeah um anyway <laughs> yes you could call it that that could be the name of your collection yeah. free donuts free the donuts free the donuts Love that would it. be a talking point wouldn't absolutely it? Twelve ninety nine. How many did you get? You get loads. Twenty five. Oh, that's really good. Twenty five of them. Yeah, I'm thinking too. Yeah, um, head of TV Chloe Jones. You don't see on your screens very often because she's very. For somebody that's in TV, is very camera shy. Um, anyway, but she, I remember she some time ago. I haven't seen her wear it in a while, but like just a sterling silver chain. It's just got this kind of shape in silver, so, so they're not even gemstones. Yeah, really lovely. It's Links mm. of London. This necklace, mm. um, and who knows what that's going to have cost. But you can make a version of that with genuine gemstones. Twelve pounds and ninety-nine pence only. I want to know if people are going to do a free free the donuts necklace. Yeah, yeah, free. Come on, get these and free the donuts. I like it. <laughs> Chaos. See, I know it's not just me that talks to my beads. Like you come here and you go over there, and because people have told me. Yes. So I feel less odd. No, <laughs> I think it's sweet. I think it's very, very sweet. Um, well done, everybody. Congratulations. I will bring you that strand of Amazonite that I teased you with earlier on. These are on the verge of selling out. Well done. Um, amazing. Scoopy, scoopy. I'm not freeing the donuts right now, am I? No. Um, right, oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. Um, this strand's incredible, by the way. You're going to absolutely love this. I just love the shape. They're gorgeous, It lends aren't they? itself to the colour, doesn't it? Lanterns. Oh, I love them. Love them, love them. Look how beautiful that is. Oh, that's gorgeous! I just right love there. that. I think that with your de with your early bird, with that little heart, definitely. How stunning! Oh, I think that's beautiful. Yeah, with the heart in the front. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Super simple, beautiful. really simple to create. Two hundred carats you're getting of Amazonite. When we think of Amazonite, it's this, isn't it? It's this colour. And you're getting that colour in spades in this yeah. one. I mean, it really is vibrant. But fourteen pounds and ninety nine oh, pence. Good. Nine to ten millimetres, uh, nine to ten millimetres with these beautiful kind of like curved facets. I know that's a, a little bit of a... Uh, um, what's Are they like a checkerboard? Like that's Yeah. Like, yeah, like a little bit it's like a, bit a, a checkerboard. It's a contradiction to say curved facets, isn't it? But yeah. you get where I'm coming from. Like a, almost, that, that must be why they're so sparkly, because oh. like a disco ball. Yeah, like a disco ball. Look at that one there. You get, all, of course, the joyous markings that you see within Amazonite. Um, Amazonite has firmly secured itself as one of the most popular gemstones here at Jewelry Maker, and it's easy to understand why. Mm. Again, with those pink pearls that we had a few moments ago, how lovely would that be? Uh, Amazonite and pearls, my absolute favourite. Yeah, same. I, I think they look stunning. Well done, everybody. Speaking of pearls... Oh, here it is. I knew immediately which one you were referring to, Roscoe. 
We're going to do it in one price crash. Um, you have gem set, a gem set Baroque pearls. Within those gems are tourmaline, topaz, peridot, and sapphire which have been set into your pearls you know this is a technique which usually ordinarily commands a significantly high price tag because mm. firstly you need to have the best quality pearls you need it to have a, a fine nacre so that it doesn't sort of crack or shatter during yeah. that drilling process you need to go through the process of actually just selecting your your uh, round brilliant cuts in this case key, uh, wrapping in them in the what, what's described as a rubbed over setting and putting that into the pill you know ordinarily they come with a price point um not today though 79 pounds and 99 pence only well done stay where you are what did you say yes i have sorry roscoe um here it is every time i pick this uh, you know every time i see this bracelet i have to do it up again I swear it gets worn, the studio sample behind the scenes. Um, okay, it's, and I don't blame them though, because it is absolutely beautiful. Now, there's only 16 of these left. Um, it was, yeah, I totally agree. Certainly one of the most, my nails are too long again. Um, certainly one of the most designer. I don't suppose you've got a photo, have you, Adam? Sorry. You want me to do it? Um, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm not getting there. I'm getting there, I'm not getting there. Yes, please. Here we go. So the actual clasp itself is, is part of the design. Um, and again, we've shown you lots of bit of different designers that actually work with the hidden clasp. Uh, designers like Pandora um, have a hidden clasp in one of their necklaces at the moment. It's £125 for that necklace. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, and I think as well, it makes sense to me that Pandora have got this because that could be a charm carrier. There's a big amount of sterling silver within this piece. It's flown. I've only got 15 of them left. Once they're gone, they're gone. You, of course, will endeavour to bring you something similar moving forward, but it is more than likely going to be Christmas now, she says with a turkey on her head. <laughs> <laughs> it's Christmas now, Al. I am, yeah. For the next three days. Next Great week. for presents, though, huh? Absolutely. Mm. Put it away in the present drawer. Mm. Um, I mean, you could go to Sif Jacobs of Copenhagen. There's a bracelet there. Absolutely beautiful. Um, £175. It's lovely. Sterling silver. I really, I've not seen this style before where the actual link is the... Is the clasp. Is the clasp. Yeah. This is really lovely i know which i prefer so for example the one that's on the on your screens right now yeah. it's a lovely bracelet don't get me wrong but the fact that you haven't got the the break in the design yeah I, it makes me lean towards the hidden class i agree it's a bit, little bit special that yeah isn't it? absolutely it doesn't it doesn't in, it's not interrupted um same as this one. i love that one i think this is a really lovely bracelet from pandora it's 70 quid mm. 70 pounds it's lovely don't get me wrong and that's kind of almost a hidden class. Now, at £99.99, pence, we're going to go straight down to it, though. Um, beautiful, beautiful bracelet. These have been so popular, jewellery makers, because they're great gifts. I mean, how many people can you think of in your circle, of family or friends, that would think, yeah, that's, you know, that's their kind of style? Um, you could put one of your pearls mm. on there. I always like these with a Brock pearl. Definitely. Uh, £24.99. And and pence. With all that silver, 2.8 grams of solid sterling silver, um, classic bracelet, 17 centimetres. If you wanted to extend it, then your deal of the day chain would yep. be absolutely perfect absolutely. to do that. There's a lot of you with it in your baskets. Remember, heads up, this is lounge hour, so they will disappear from the website um, in the next couple of minutes. So good luck. I've only got 10 of them left, though. Dawn, Amanda, Lorna, Tracy, Carolyn, Morag, Hello to you, Devon, Lorna, new customer. Um, 2.7 grams of sterling sterling silver uh, make sure you're checking out on those fabulous if you want silver then I've also got your chains coming up as well which is going to be fabulous so you men mentioned your uh, um, present drawer those are oh, your deal yeah. of the day if you want complete chains um, Michael can I trouble you for a couple more busts if that's okay just because I, I, you know, these are all finished necklaces, aren't mm. they, effectively? Mm. You can go on to put your pendants, you could put your designs. For example, we've got pieces like this coming up in today's show. Um, here we go. The jadeite's been sent off to our, our design house and they've framed it in sterling silver. So you need the chains, don't you? You're going to need the chains for that. Um, now, you don't just get the one, though. You get three different designs. Um, three different designs all of the same lengths, 
five and a half grams of sterling silver. So, yeah, I mean, if you are thinking Christmas, which is why we do vents like Christmas in July, because as a crafter, mm. you have to start making nice and early, don't you? You really do. And I left everything too late last year and I, I didn't get to make my wreath. And I think as crafters, part of Christmas is making things for Christmas. Well, it is for me anyway. And yeah. I do a lot with the family. And I just think that I'm definitely, I've, I've made myself a promise that I'm going to start earlier this year because I didn't get around to crafting some of the things that I wanted to. And that is that makes Christmas for me doing those projects. Absolutely. You know, and if you're if at the last minute you are fumbling to find chains for your creations for gifts or whatever, chances are you're going to end up paying a really high price because you need it quickly. You do, and it's a panic buy. Yeah. That's why I always shop at, uh, shop throughout the course of the year. Make sure you're checking out on these. Sixteen ninety nine gets you all three of them. By the way, oh, now good. all three. Yeah, all three sterling silver That's chains. That's super good. I know. Now, your early bird, we're going to bring to you the other side of the break. We've had a couple of technical issues okay. behind the scenes. Don't worry, we can still play it, but we just need a couple of minutes to get that rectified. Everything else, though, these chains, the high goos, the pearls, the bracelets, etc., the donuts, everything that we've brought you so far will be disappearing off the website in the next few seconds so make sure you're checking out on those if you want that beautiful locket tea bar pendant it's coming up the other side of this as are as are the multicolored pearls as well don't go anywhere make sure you check out your baskets that's the first hour of christmas in july we'll see you after this Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, this Saturday's deal of the day, we have been listening. You've been shouting out for all of your essentials, haven't you? You've been messaging into the studio. You've been shouting to us saying, we need our essentials. Well, we listened and at 10 o'clock, we have Ross's stash grab. I have the list, which include your featherweight head pins, your lever bat shepherd hooks, your finding wire end tips, and so much more. So if you're desperate for your essentials, it's this Saturday's deal of the day. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day we offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. 
Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Well done, everybody. Right, it's all sorted. Your early bird is coming up. But just before we duck into your early bird, I'm going to show you Debbie's amazing kits. So if you've been admiring, if you're inspired, which I know you are, uh, by Debbie's amazing jewellery, that's grand right? and sterling silver. It is. Debbie, I've got to say that is probably one of the most high-end pieces of jewellery. I know. Uh, well, I thought I'm going to add some pearls in and I'm just going to add a bead cap. And I, I wanted the Grand Didierite to go as far as possible. And I also wanted to add silver in. So I've oh, um, rosary too. linked. It's and I've stunning. used the hearts as the earring posts, if you can see that. Oh, yes. So, yeah. And then I'll show you how to do that. It's a clever little way. That so you they're can... out of your head pins. That's what you're referring to. And that's yeah. going to be your demo. So you can you can make studs, but you can also make interchangeable um, Fabulous. drops to go on your studs. Fabulous. Now, so here's the kit. You've got, if you want to make that necklace, we've got it in Grand Digerite. And these are large Grand Digerites yeah, too. It's not, a, you know, it's not a small strand with the most perfect colour, I tell you. Um, so there it is. There's your strand of Grand Digerite, and you can see in the background all the sterling silver head pins, but they're not just any old head pins. No, no, no. They're the flat head pins with shapes at the end. And if you love that, but you would rather it maybe in Tanzanite or as well as, we do have that almost that same kit, but with a faceted Tanzanite strand as well. Um, so you can shop ahead on these. They are available on pre-order right now, but not before we talk about your early bird. So this early bird... I think we've all fallen in love with. Yeah. I love the simplicity of it. I love the fact that it's that little bit smaller than maybe a more traditional toggle class. Yeah. So it's got this really, really dainty um, feel to it. Great, uh, not just, you know, bracelets, necklaces. I think it's going to work in all of the above or even turning them into earrings, I think. Oh, yes, that would be so pretty. I love the little pearl setting yeah. there. That kind of makes it for me. I agree. This is so beautiful. But we have 150 of them now. It is brand new. It's never been on your screens previously before, and I don't think it's going to make a second show, to be honest. Um, toggle class, I think it's fair to say, are all the rage um, and have really been traditionally for... Oh, for as long as I can remember anyway. Yeah. You know, Tiffany's and Co, if you remember when they pretty much launched their sterling silver collection, it was all about a heart toggle, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. Um, Still is, really, isn't yeah. it? That's the classic thing you think of. Yeah, if you imagine, like, my, my earliest recollection of a sterling silver Tiffany's piece was that class remember it was like a heart but it kind of caged over yes and lit, lit, yeah you know, like a bit like a lever back yeah. on the top you know that's my first recollection of sterling silver at tiffany's um and it's kind of a nod towards that now in the center features a beautiful cultured pearl i love this and it is a genuine cultured pearl you know you could loop that on where it's a charm where it's a pendant it could actually be your toggle class you can see it's set in 925 sterling silver now we've got 150 of these but i do think they're going to absolutely fly um we can quickly flick through a few of these toggle class now they're not exactly the same but you can see um how the toggle is very much getting the limelight at the moment wolf and badger here we go so you've got a mixture of the smaller necklace can you see pearls on one side chain on the other so match it with your deal of the day for example that necklace you're talking 125 pounds let me ask you this question can you can you make that yeah, I think even I could make that as well um, and save myself the £125 or near, near on. Um, show you another. Again, it's pretty. I prefer this toggle. I do too. It's pretty. Could you make that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. I think you definitely. could make a better... I think you could make a better version. Yeah, that toggle's a bit 
it's okay. It's just a bit plain, I think. Mm. Um, £135 for that necklace. Or how about this? Oh, yeah. I love that. So pretty. Tiffany's. Yeah. Tiffany's and Co. I don't know how much it is, but if it's Tiffany's, I probably can't afford it. <laughs> um, probably. I like how they've used it as a lariat too. Yes, I do. Which I. you could do. How about this? Mulberry, we referenced that earlier on. Now, it's a big statement toggle, but it's at the front, and they featured pearls in there yeah. as well. Like the mixture of the precious metals, too, in that one. Uh, the mixture of the silver and gold. £475. Again, I know it's very different, but it's still the toggle at the front. How about this one? Oh, Very yeah, similar. Love that. Ralph Lauren. Now, that's base metal, by the way. Oh, and they are faux pearls, not genuine pearls. But you're still talking, what is that, £89? Still talking eighty-nine pounds for that for that necklace. I think you could recreate that most definitely, but uh, that's with real material. Definitely, and that's what I meant when I said you could add another little charm or gemstone yeah. actually onto it. it. Would be so pretty. That'd be lovely. Yeah. Like initial or something like that. An initial or a birthstone or a little, oh, nice. another little pearl. Beautiful. Have we got any more? Yeah, Christian Ooh, Dior. That's, nice. that's pretty, isn't it? Yeah. Um, Christian, I don't even, I don't know if that's actually the clasp or whatnot, but anyway, it's pretty, isn't it? Where they've got the Christian Jewel symbol at the front with one little pearl going below. Uh, three hundred and eighty pounds for that one. Here we go. The toggle. This is pretty. Oh, I yeah. like that. Yeah, I, I like that a lot. You've got your knotted pearls, really pretty and initial, going back to what you yep. were suggesting there, Deb. Um, £168 for that. So, as you can see, the toggle is very much not just a function, it's a feature yeah. um, in your jewellery. What about this? The Serenity Pearl Link Chain. Um, one single pearl. You've kind of got a hidden bail, a uh, hidden class within there. It's £100 for that. Mm -hmm. £100. I was looking last night in preparation for today, and I actually thought, you know what, I'm not even going to bother adding because when I was looking at toggles and looking at chains and things like that, there was so much that were like stainless steel. I oh, know. Like they're gold plating and things like that, stainless yeah, steel. Yeah. That's pretty, again, genuine freshwater pearls, the Evelyn necklace. You can get hold of that, which is an, a very affordable £69.90. That That's is. fantastic, yeah. I think. I love that design because it can go down your back, the pearls yeah. or the front. So, yeah. This necklace, I think most of us think, is quite iconic, isn't yeah. it, to, jewelry, uh, to Tiffany's & Co. Um, beautiful. Yeah, Ross said he saw a lady wearing it the other day. Um, it's quite a short necklace as well. Um, £815 oh. for that necklace. £815. So if you love that and you, you can take inspiration from said designer, then I think this is a great alternative. Pandora again, um, £115. I'm not so keen on that one, I've got to be honest. I'm not a big fan of that. It just... Not my style, mm -hmm. not my vibe. Anyway, so we've got 150 of these available with your beautiful cultured pearls. I think we all agree the heart and the toggle just go perfectly hand in hand. These aren't faux pearls. This is a genuine cultured pearls, um, cultured pearl in the centre. Yeah, I would wear that at the front of a necklace or a, a sort of a front and centre on a bracelet, if you like. Now, as soon, the moment that your graphics appear, I do expect there to be a bit of a frenzy on the phone lines and on the web as well. Um, it is a working toggle, but again, you could wear it as a pendant if you wanted to never been on your screens previously before up until now you've got over a gram of solid sterling silver and you've got a beautiful three millimeter genuine cultured pearl not faux not plastic not glass not resin genuine cultured pearl in the center there good luck to you all all i'm going to say if you've got your heart set on owning this <laughs> Sorry, i actually did <laughs> that took me a minute i actually didn't mean that one but um sorry there you go. I want it on a bracelet, on a pearl bracelet. Yeah, that would be lovely. And, you know, if you're making your bridesmaids um, gifts, you know, they can wear it on the day and then keep it. What a lovely gift how to give gorgeous. bridesmaids. Yeah, yeah, how gorgeous. We are going to do this at an amazing jewellery maker price point. Okay. You know that for certain. We've got yeah. 150, so there is quantity there. And straight away, we've got people saying, look, I, I trust the process. I'm making sure I don't miss out on this opportunity. I personally don't think this is going to see another show. I think they're going to sell out today. <laughs> um, and I love your idea, Debbie, putting them on a pearl necklace um, or pearl bracelet, yeah. rather. I think that would be lovely. It'd be beautiful alongside your next kits as well. And there's room on the back there to put an initial yeah. and have it engraved yeah. with something, date isn't there? Or something date, like you that. know, number, whatever. Even here, which is where we're starting at 29 99 how amazing is that? Yeah, it's beautiful. 
Did we see any? We saw one double figure price point, didn't we, in those tra in those mm. bracelets? And and generally, I was trying to find more affordable versions yesterday, last night, and 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 in the end, I actually got really frustrated because it was like, oh, what? that's stainless steel again. It's not silver, so it's actually really difficult to find um, a sterling silver affordable one, one without looking at those brands. Look, I don't all, I don't just immediately gravitate towards Tiffany's and Co. No. It's just when you say, yeah, when you say, see, try and describe a piece like this, it goes to the designer brands, doesn't it? Otherwise, it's stainless steel. Yeah. Um, yeah, good luck. The phone lines have gone nuts. Loads of multi buyers on this, too. Shop ahead on your beautiful natural pearls, too, because I think they would be a wonderful combination. We are starting at £29.99. Mary in Birmingham, you've got four. Angela's got four. Samantha's got two. Nottingham's got two. Michelle and Sue, uh, Yorkshire, Norman, Jacqueline, Via. Tracy, Ayrshire, Angela, new customer, uh, East Lothian, Essex, you're all there. Make sure you're ready to check out your baskets. And those are the names that I can see. Oh, look, we've got festive graphics. Oh, yeah. <gasps> 19.99. 19.99. Ooh. I know. Amazing. Again, I'm trying to think, what was the Ralph Lauren price tag? How much was Ralph Lauren piece? It's like a hundred pound, wasn't it? 80, 89, 89 pounds. And that's not even sterling silver or, or no. genuine pearls. We're talking about faux. Uh, 19.99 only, Donna and Vera and Pam and Carol and Sue and Susan and Wiltshire. Make sure you are checking out those baskets. We had 150 of these available. They are quite literally flying. They will go beautifully alongside your deal of the day. Let's put a clock on your screen. We're not stopping there. Good luck, everybody. We had 150. Oh, the Tiffany necklace has gone up in price. Well, the cost sterling silver's gone up in price. Yeah. It's just it's just little old jewelry maker now who are like seem to be <laughs> not experiencing. Oh, okay, you can get one with diamonds that's more expensive. How many diamonds? Just little tiny ones. Okay, yeah. And it's how much? A thousand pound? Over a thousand. In silver. Pound. In silver. Little melee diamonds in there as well. Uh, we're going even lower, everybody. We had 150. We're not going to have that quantity for very long. Well, look at the core screens already, Deb. So many multipliers. <laughs> it's sweet, isn't it? It is absolutely lovely. And I think as a jewelry maker, you're thinking of so many pieces that you would want to put this onto yeah. that you could make. I want to see what the price drop is because I would definitely say get more than one definitely well people are twos threes fours i've seen Gillian and frederick in my home county of monmouthshire carol and sheila and mary in lancashire and sarah in buckinghamshire and pam in uxbridge sue in somerset susan in highland donna in, in manchester vera in essex jacqueline in dorset oh goodness me 14 pounds and 99 pence only if i get too excited i'll you know the, the it's <laughs> It's what happens when she gets excited. It is. It's involuntary. <laughs> um, um, <laughs> amazing. Well done, everybody. It's beautiful, isn't it? It is so beautiful. Make sure you are checking out those baskets, everybody. Um, yeah, it's flying out the door. And it would go perfectly alongside the deal of the day. Perfect really alongside would. the deal of the day, which is all about the sterling silver chains um, or the pearls that we've just had for a second or Debbie's kits that you've got coming up. Well, here we go, Debbie. You've got that gorgeous tans Ooh, and Oh, look at that. I don't know if you'll be able to see this on the, on the camera, so I'll do my best. Here we go. Just imagine that. Really simple, That's but look how I mean. beautiful that is. Oh, you know that we have got so many beautiful gemstone strands that this would just finish off so beautifully. It does. It finishes it off. Yeah. Amazing. And look at that a tanzanite and sterling silver and pearl piece of jewellery. Yeah. Imagine how much, you know, if you wanted to go and buy one yeah. from, a, from a jeweller's, how much you'd have to fork out well, for that. Well, you know, I, I'm just visualising, seeing that strand, which is amazing, mm -hmm. now imagine it with a bolt ring clasp. Yeah. Which there's nothing wrong with that. No. But which do you think would look prettier? Well, this one just looks more designer. Yeah. It looks more thought out. It, it's very on trend. And I say on trend, but does this design ever go out? No, absolutely not. It doesn't. Not, it's no. that classic design that just keeps being reworked. 
Yeah, amazing. Yeah, I, 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 like I said, there's nothing wrong with like your traditional bolt rings or your traditional lobster claws um, or anything like that, which, we, which, by the way, we've got coming up tomorrow. And there's absolutely a place for those. But if you are looking for that little extra something, then I think this is the class that I would gravitate towards. The phone lines have gone crazy. <laughs> and I'm going to say probably about 80% of you have chosen to multi-buy on this. You know what, though? You know, I've said really confidently, I don't think this is going to see another show. Mm. Do you know why I said that? Not only is it because it's beautiful, it's also because we're not stopping at $14.99. But if we do go to that price tag, then I need to be sort of accurate in my prediction. OK. So we need 35 of you. Um, is, that, is that, what, 35 people on the phone lines and on the, on the web? Just to add it to your basket so we can drop that price. Don't have to confirm as of yet, says uh, says Roscoe. Just we need to see you there physically. So Roscoe's just found this. Claudia Bradby. Okay. Look at this. Okay, that's nice. £275 in silver. So... Do you, is, is it, is, do you think it is an unfair comparison for me to say, how about putting tanzanite on that, on ours? No. And say £275. We've sold pills like that, which are your potato pills, by the way, for what? £29.99? So add the 12... Add the what, sorry? The, the thread, the silk, mm -hmm. the toggle, the fi a few findings... You're going to be able to do it for way less than £50. Absolutely. Yeah, I totally agree. In 60 seconds, we are going to take this beautiful, genuine, cultured pearl, encrusted, sterling silver, heart toggle. I've got 29 of them left within the vault. I genuinely don't think this is going to see another show. I think there's such a beautiful design. Simplistic. Yeah, but sometimes simple is best. Absolutely. If something's too intricate, you can either get sick of it yeah. or it can really go out of yeah. fashion. Not that I'm not a fashion victim, but you can really get dated. Like you can think, oh, yeah, I remember when those were, were in. You know, it kind of it identifies itself with a certain year or a certain era. Yeah. Something like this is timeless. Yeah, totally agree. Totally, totally agree. Yeah, I, I, um, think about like the gate bracelets, for example. Remember those? It, they've never been done again, have no. they? No, they've never been done again. And you just think, you know, how, how 80s are those? Um, so I think sometimes, I mean, I do like a statement piece of jewellery, don't get me wrong, but for stacking, which I also love to do, for everyday wear, for stacking, this would be absolutely perfect for that. Good luck, everybody. We're going even lower. Claire's got nine. Well done. Suzanne, kathy has got two. There's uh, probably 90% of you now choosing to multi-buy. And you're not just getting ones or twos. You're getting sixes, fours, twos, threes, what? nines. That's amazing. Isn't it? 12 99 come on, jewellery maker. Well done. Merry I, Christmas. My only, wish, yeah. <laughs> oh, my only wish is that we had more than the 150. That's my only wish. Um, if there is a little bit of a queue on the phone lines, but don't you worry, our call centre will get you. There's not many left, quick. No, <laughs> please call centre, stay where you are, don't abandon your calls. Um, I've got 20 of them left at the moment, so definitely, definitely worthwhile you checking out your basket sooner rather than later. I can see you there, Valerie. I see you there, Jennifer. I see you there, Maker. I see you there, Norma, who's just been answered. Barbara and Samantha and Sue. Um, well done, Regine in Northamptonshire. Lillian's just got two. Susan in Highland's got five. Wiltshire's just got three. Nancy in Bristol's just got two. Um, there is a ton of you there. Monica's got two. Sue's got two. Sheila's got two. Um, Chandy, you've got two. Well done, everybody. Sue in Gloucestershire, you've just got three. You can still do it, and I think everybody's been answered now. Is that right? On the phone lines? Yorkshire. Oh, I can see you there, Yorkshire. You'll get answered, lovely. Um, just stay where you are and our call centre will be with you. Aren't they? They're up and on it this morning, aren't they, call centre team? And don't. And, and whilst you're there, might be an ideal opportunity for you to shop ahead on those beautiful natural coloured pearls that are coming up yeah. as another back-to-back uh, -back early bird. Um, maybe just after after Debbie's kits. So, yeah, you can shop ahead on those as well. Plus Debbie's awesome kits, which are so high-end, yet without the high-end price tag, yeah, oh, good, which yeah. is fantastic. I don't know what they're going to. So. Oh, well, I'll show you in a second. Okay. It's under there. Okay. Oh. Uh, it's, a great, it's, a, it's a great deal. Twelve ninety nine only. Congratulations to you all. Um, please do stay where you are. This is the quantity that we have left in our vault. Oh, quite a few. 
outcomes. Okay. And when you consider about 90% of you have chosen to multi-buy. If you are watching on um, repeat or on playback and you, you're, you've gone in and it's out of stock. Yeah. Keep looking or put it in your wish list because last week I wanted two things from the show that I was on and they were both sold out when I went after the yep. show to look when I got home. And I wish list them and I've got both of them. There you go. Stop wish playing list with your turkey. Your, wish list is your friend. I can't stop messing. <laughs> with you, so. so wish listing works because it worked for me twice last week. Yeah, absolutely. Is there a better way of wearing the turkey? Don't think so. Hi, Estella. Morning, all. Uh, a jewelry maker. Is the deal of the day sterling silver or base metal, please? Sterling, sterling silver. Sterling silver. Yeah, here they are. Here they are. And by the way, you don't. I've got two deal of the days today, actually. So you've got. One, two, three, yeah, so imagine that as one, and then meet along lengths. But you also have these absolutely beautiful clasps, um, which are brand new, and we've got them in the three different colours. I mean, look at these. Is it, I, I think they're quite, quite Grecian. They're very designer. I really like them. Aren't I've they amazing? I've not seen anything like that. Yeah, a bit Celtic also as well. Look how fabulous they are. We've got those in, in, all, in, <laughs> in all three colours as well. So they're coming up in the 10 o'clock hour. Now, by the way, that is Zircon that's set within there as well. So um, well done, everybody. Congratulations on your early bird. There's still so much to bring you today as well. Uh, Debbie's amazing kits. Here they are. You can shop ahead on these, and I would absolutely encourage you to do that. You've got some very high-end kits here, Debbie. Uh, yeah, I was a lucky girl. And also these head pins with the lovely motifs. You've got hearts and flowers. And then isn't there like a little triangle? Let's have a look. Yes. Yeah, like a little triangle. Um, and they just add that attention to detail to your design. And they're sterling silver, aren't they? Yeah. So you can put them in your ears and, and make them into studs. Absolutely. Or, so, know, so yeah, you've got, so, look at those hearts. I love them. Yeah, these what you turned into stud earrings. Now, just to give you a heads up, the Tanzanite kit, there are only 30 of them. So you get all of these sterling silver. Yeah, very Van Cleef and Arpels. Good point, yes. Um, you get all of these sterling silver uh, head pins, rather, and you get your fasted Tanzanite yeah. in rounds, which is like gold dust to see round fasted mm. Tanzanite. And then on the other kit, you've got Grand Digirite, one of the world's top 10 rarest gemstones, and probably some of the best color I've seen. In a kit. In a kit, <laughs> absolutely. So these are exclusive kits. Shop ahead, secure yours, feet, feet up so you can watch Debbie's amazing demonstration. So those are coming your way. And as, as, as Debbie, you've mentioned it, um, look at that strand. It is genuinely some of the best Grand Digirite I've seen. Do you agree? Do you agree with that? Um, okay, so if I show you this. Ooh. Very affordable, aren't it, they? It's very, um, again, the making something that you wouldn't necessarily be able to afford to buy or would. I definitely wouldn't know. be able to afford that. I love the I love the fact that they've put the Grand Digirai in there yeah. because I never even used to know what that was. And then when I discovered it, it's teal. I know, it's amazing. I mean, and teal. natural. Oh, I love teal. I've got teal in my living room. I just, I'm a bit obsessed with teal. Yeah, and Hannah was, wasn't she? Was she? Hannah Osborne's Yeah, that. you see, teal. It's, it's a lovely, it is a beautiful colour. Um, so you can shop ahead on those. I've got one more auction to bring you. Okay. And oh my goodness me, they would go perfectly with your kits. Okay. So it makes sense to do them first. Now these are natural and I'm going to keep saying that over and over and over. Natural, 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 natural. Now there are a hundred of these available. Ross is saying in my ear, L, they're a guaranteed sellout for sure. I can see why. Firstly, we don't get the button shape very often. Let me just explain. So a pearl doesn't, as we know, doesn't just form in a round, does it? If you're new to, to, to gemstones and pearls in particular, um, I'm when I was sort of, uh, um, I guess, new to the jewellery world, I kind of assumed they were mostly round. Didn't know about keshis, didn't know about no. rock pearls, didn't know about button pearls. And when they're this shape, it's where that basically they are formed closer to the nacre. Well, they're always close, not, to, sorry, to the shell. Um, but a bit like your keshis, um, keshis which are pure nacre, um, they form that flatter shape just because where they're positioned. Right. So these... Have, uh, uh, basically, the coating has happened a lot closer to the mollusk shell itself. Now, there's one, um, okay, they're not rounds, but as we know now, Baroque pearls, fireball pearls, all those Biwa pearls, 
cashew pearls are huge at the moment yeah. where they used to be discarded they used to throw them back into the sea but we don't anymore I've where? Been 20 years tell ago. me where <laughs> <laughs> I've never snorkeled, but I'm going to try. Uh, yeah, you can soon find a way. Um, but the beauty of a pearl actually forming really, really, really close to the actual mollusk shell is that you get huge amounts of luster, huge amounts, and you'll see it within these. They are natural, natural, natural. Make sure you are checking out nice and early. I've got 100 available. What? Ross is saying, look, Elle, there's no, no one on our call screens as of yet. I, do you know why, Ross? I don't think people realise when you say. I don't people have that, know where we're starting with this because you look at that on your screens. They're high-end pearls, so they, people might be thinking they're beyond my budget, maybe. Yeah, and I think you know quite rightly sometimes people yeah. want an indication before yeah. they even get put that. them in their basket. Totally get that. Okay, well let's start giving you an indication then. <laughs> Is that the first price mm -hmm. or the price? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so cool. I totally get it because these are naturally coloured pearls and you get a huge parcel of them as well. They're through drilled, by the way. They're not dyed in any way, shape or form. We're starting at $14.99. It's a parcel of top quality pearls. Debbie, you've got the most beautiful kits coming in a few moments' time. I'm just going to take one head pin. Mm -hmm. I'm going to feed one pearl on. I'm just going to imagine now for a second that I've got my sterling silver essentials that are coming up in tomorrow's show. Or you've and, just bought that bracelet. Or I've just bought that bracelet. Yeah. yeah, perfect. And I'm just going to wrap one of those pearls. Look at how beautiful that is. The quality of this pearl, full of lustre, natural, amazing colour, like I said, with overtones and undertones. How beautiful are these? And to be starting at $14.99, well, we had a hundred of them. This is going to be, well, Ross said, didn't he? Producer Ross said in our ear, guaranteed on-screen sellout for certain. Lots of people multi-buying on this now. They're not dyed pearls. They are natural. That one in the centre, the purple pearl, he's, should be more than that. He's my favourite. He's your favourite, the purple one. Oh, I love that colour. To think, it's mind-blowing that that is natural. Yeah. That's what does it for me, is the fact that these colours and they're all different I mean you've got a few that are slightly kind of along the same shades but I just think that they're so stunning and you know what I was thinking of wrap bracelets when oh. you make a loop and you use the pearl as the glass nice lovely oh and Lorna's saying how amazing rings oh beautiful yeah because they sit beautifully against the yeah, hand aren't they that's a really good 9 99 that gets you all six all six of them or well, the center of flowers if you've got some little pearls to little round ones to go around the outside you've got a daisy ring there haven't yeah you? lovely and other micro faceted gems can go around the outside well three mil anything that we've done today the tanzanite from the kit would be beautiful imagine those as outside and then your pearl as the middle of amazing. your flower like a little daisy wouldn't that be gorgeous yeah absolutely beautiful I, I think like i said with that hidden class bracelet that we had earlier on just one of them wrap loop from oh, there with your head pins in the kits um or using maybe um some of the deal of the day chain just one of them suspended from 9.99 gets you the full pack they are natural they're not dyed which does have a huge influence to the actual valuation um, of pearls um, and like I said because they are that flat surf uh, that, that fl flatter shape I should say um, is that you get a huge amount of lustre mm. um, guaranteed sellout we said seriously Ross that's amazing now what what Debbie's reacting to is Ross has just Sorry. said <laughs> No, 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 it's good. That genuinely this surprised me because this is... We're not even stopping there. Yeah, but 999 is amazing. They're real. I know. 999 each would be pretty good. Let's be honest. Yes. Or jewellery maker price 999 for two. For two? Yeah. You get six. And we're going even lower. Amazing! Amazing. We did say guaranteed <laughs> sellout. The perfect addition to Debbie's beautiful kits that are coming up in a few moments' time. Hopefully you're shopping ahead on those as well. Twos, threes, fours, I don't blame you for getting those kind of quantities. It's a parcel of natural pearls. What's it going to We're going even lower. Oh, look, at, I like the really warm papaya-like colour. You know, the almost corally orangey colour. So do I. And this would be perfect for the necklace that I made myself the other day. I'll try, I'm, I'm in again next Saturday. I'll try and remember to wear it. But I, I was just kind of picking these larger pearls from the bottom of my stash. And 
if you intersperse those amongst the same size pearls, it gives a lovely effect. So yeah, you could gorgeous. definitely, if you bought one of these, you could definitely do that. If you bought two of these for a long line necklace and then rosary links, small one, small one, small one, big one, small one, small one, big one, it would be absolutely gorgeous. Oh no, we're going, we're going to suspense. They're natural pearls, and it's that's why I keep emphasising that natural, 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 not bleached, not dyed. That's about one pound thirty-three per cultured pearl. I'm thinking back to you know that Ralph Lauren necklace, yeah, which was a faux pearl. I know. They were faux pearls, and it was still eighty-nine pounds. We're talking about the real deal. Furthermore, rarer colours. You know, when you start talking your papayas, your purples, your pinks, they are rarer colours which ordinarily command a much higher price tag. And that's usually, not always, it does depend, these are organic gemstones, but that's usually because the, the pearl is formed slightly co uh, closer to the circumference of the mollusk, right. where it has the darkest colour on the lip, if you like. Oh, yeah, I'm with you. Um, but you've also got that button shape, so that's why they're so reflective. That's how many we have left. We did say it was going to be an on-screen sellout, everybody. Congratulations how to many? every single oh. one of you. Yeah, and I've got way more than 18 of you with it in your baskets on the phone lines. Please stay where you are on those calls. Shop ahead on Debbie's beautiful kits as well, because they would look absolutely unbelievable. Look at all of those. Well, you could put one in the centre of your strand, couldn't you? So one in the centre of your grand did you right, one in the centre of Lovely. your tanzanite, whatever. They've Gorgeous. Sold out. What well an amazing done. deal that was. They have sold out. Ross, yeah. you're on fire today. He is on fire. Roscoe, Roscoe, Roscoe. Amazing, amazing. Ross has got all the trimmings today. <laughs> Love it. What's the must to your Christmas dinner plate? Oh, for me, broccoli casserole, because I don't eat meat. Yeah. Broccoli, I know it sounds hideous, but it's a family recipe. <laughs> And they have, tur I have turkey and everything, but it's an accompaniment for everybody else. But like for me and my daughter-in-law, we're both veggies, so that's yeah. our main thing. We have everything else. And I know it sounds gross, it's absolutely gorgeous. Is it like a soup? Mm, no, no. It's like, it's, it's like a casserole, but it's got broccoli, it's got Ritz crackers on the top and cheese. Ooh. And then it's got um, cheese and I'm not giving away my secret recipe in it. But everybody who doesn't eat meat eats it. And if I'm actually dishing, I come back and there's none left. And I'm like, I don't eat the turkey. <laughs> yeah, you've got to say, that's not fair. That's not fair. That happens with the veggie lasagna as well. Ah, uh, I like a vegetable lasagna. Yeah. I love vegetables, to be fair. So do I. Yeah, but yeah, so it. obviously we have, we have the, the turkey, but that, that's the veggie option. We have two meats, usually. I'm not, I'm not normally a sprout person. Mm. However, on Christmas Day, chopped sprouts sautéed with... Goujons, bacon oh. goujons, butter and chestnuts. Oh, that sounds, I hate sprouts. They're about the only vegetable I don't like, but actually that sounds Sauté amazing. Sauté with butter. Yeah. They'd be not obviously miss out the bacon, but sauteed yeah. with butter and salt and pepper, delicious. Ooh. Delicious. Making oh. me hungry. Yeah, sorry, sorry about that. Um, okay, are you ready for Debbie's amazing kits, jewellery makers? I'm going to start with the tanzanite. I'm going to have a sip of tea. You carry on. I, and, and I'm going to say that, look, look, tanzanite, very quickly, without getting too gemmy, tanzanite has an orthrhombic crystal structure. So what that basically means is that um, it likes to have a longer axis. So it's kind of, if you imagine like a, a, a more oval, more elongated. So right. it likes that longer length because that uh, um, enables its color, assists its color intensity, but also um, helps its triacroism. So that's why we more frequently see tanzanite in the longer shapes. Oh, I didn't know that at all. Yeah, it's orthrhombic. So that's why you really see round brilliant cut. I feel orthrhombic, but I think it's my age. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll be. That's an amazing Sometimes word. Sometimes a little bit cubic. Orth orthrhombic. <laughs> orthrhombic, yeah. It's nice, okay. isn't it? Um, but we rarely ever see them in the rounds. And if we do, it can sometimes lose the colour. Not the case here. But not only have you got rounds, you've also got faceted rounds. That which is beautiful. Genuinely how often do we see faceted round tanzanite? Very rarely. Very, 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 very rarely. rarely. Yeah, yeah. Unbelievable. Now, you don't just get this awesome strand, and I'm going to turn them towards you. You also get a selection, and there's 10 of each, and they're long, by the way, 50 millimetres in their length, um, of your essential 
that's going to bother me. My, my inner OCDs, that's going to really bother me if there's one head pinpoint in the opposite direction. <laughs> Here we go. Um, you also get these absolutely beautiful head pins. So if I hold them up, you can see you've got the little triangles just there. You've got the hearts. And you have the very Van Cleef Alhambra designs just here. So in total, you're looking at 30 sterling silver. Shall I put them on the desk? They're long as well. They're long. Yeah. They're not little diddy ones. They're long. No. They're, uh, does it say? 50. Yeah. 50 um, millimetres in their length. So there's all the head pins that you're getting. And they're not base metal. These are 925 sterling silver. So trillion shape, flower shape, and also the heart shape. Look how beautiful they are. I know, I love them. Beautiful. And then here it is, the star of the show. You have your gorgeous tanzanite. It's a look. Can we just assess for a second where we are starting? Mm -hmm. We're at forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Sorry, fifty-nine. Beg your pardon. Fifty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Okay, Ross is like, just because you said it, let's take a tenner off. Sorry, <laughs> my bad. But even there, though, that's that's the the price of. I mean, that would be an amazing price for the tanzanite, wouldn't it? It would. Imagine the pieces of jewellery that, that you can make with that. And, you know, tanzanite aside, you're getting a lot of silver in those headpins. They're not the little diddy ones that you have to fiddle to wrap a loop once you've put a No, they're definitely on. not featherweights, are they? And, and no, and they're long so that you can get a good amount of beads on there or you can, you know, do whatever you want as far as designs go. And any, anything that you cut away is still useful. You can still use it as a finding you can use or it's it still precious find, metal. It's, you can use what you cut away as a post for an earring that you make. You can use it as scrap. You can melt it down in your pot for your sand yeah. casting. Yeah, amazing. So right now, Debbie, we are, say that again, a pound per featherweight. Well, it's not featherweight, are they? A pound per head pin. I know it says featherweight. They're, they're not, not. They're not featherweight. There's more silver in them. A pound per head pin and £20 for the strand of tanzanite, which is unbelievable. You'll don't, you don't agree with me. There's more silver in these. They're, they're definitely not featherweight because when I was using them, I realised that. So that's, that's wrong. But, you know, you're getting more That's silver. a positive you're, wrong, you're, though, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, because they'd be half as thick as this. Yeah. How about we <laughs> said a pound per designer head pin because mm. they're not just ball details they've got trillions mm. flowers and hearts yeah how about we said a pound per head pin and your strand for free oh yes please <laughs> uh, how quickly do we think this kit's going to sell out today we look at the quality of what have we got 30 did you say yeah, there's a limited oh, quantity okay. of them 29 pounds <gasps> and 99 pence only or, if you want to look at it a different way, twenty nine ninety nine for your beautiful vanadium-rich tanzanite in a cut that we rarely ever see, plus with facets, and then you're getting all of that sterling silver. But that's 30. 30. Yeah. 30 three, oh. three zero, absolutely. And they're long. Um, did, yeah, they're not the short ones, which are normally about half that, so half in the gram way. Um, the only way to get hold of these components is within this kit. And did you say there's a limited quantity, Roscoe? Yeah, those 30 were all right. Okay. 30 of them available. Straight away, me says I'll have two. Carol says I'll have two. Mary and Trevor and Kathy and Catherine. Uh, Jane and Margaret. Well done, Sue. Cheshire. New customer, Charmaine. Angela and Heather in London. Make sure you're checking out, everybody. You will need to be quick on this. 30 is a very, very, very limited quantity. Um, for for, for so tan We all love tanzanite, yeah, don't we? it's my birthday. And, you know, if you've just got that little toggle and you're thinking, yeah, I'm going to oh. put the toggle on like Elle did... You know, you've then got 30 sterling silver long head pins as well. Yeah. So we can make that bracelet mm -hmm. for 30 pounds. How much is it? How did the how much did that pearl toggle go to? 12.99. So you're talking about 40 43 pounds for a tanzanite, for a tanzanite. and sterling silver and, and pearl. And you've got all those for free. Yeah. And you've got all your head pins for free. It's pretty amazing, That's isn't it? That's how I would look at it. Yeah, definitely. Um, all the single figures. Make sure you're checking out everybody. Julie, Samantha and Angela, amazing. Make sure you're checking out Somerset Maker, multi-buying Charmaine, amazing. Well done to you. I've got nine left out of the 30 that were ever available. Look, it's not like we're actually offering you lesser grade tanzanite either. This is tanzanite no. with a vanadium rich blue um, and in a cut that we seldom ever, ever, ever see. Now, I'm going to leave the final um, few 
with you just because um, the Grand Digirite kit is flying. I'm not so surprised. we need to bring the graphics to air on that beautiful. one. Beautiful. It is beautiful. And I'm just going to ask, I'm just going to reach across, sorry, excuse me for a second, for Debbie's beautiful necklace because this is so, so amazing, Debbie. And I'll grab those earrings as well. Debbie, wow. You know, obviously I had one strand in the kit, so I thought I'm just going to just do what I would do with it you know if I was at home and I would either make a necklace like this yep. adding pearls and rosary linking so it's bigger or I would make you see the side bits here yeah I would make a bracelet like that so I'd rosary link and then in between the rosary link so I'd put little drops so that it, it, it moved and it was so pretty and I just think that the Grand Digirite and Pearls together are a match made in heaven. Oh, I totally, totally, totally agree. Debbie, this is stunning. And it is very jellyfish-like. It is. I love that. I absolutely love this piece. Now, again, if you need the chain, um, because you've got rosary link and then you've got chain at the, chain back, at the back, make sure you wear this from 10 o'clock because we've got the perfect chain for that. Now, this kit is absolutely flying. If you've got any questions for Debbie yeah. relating to her jewellery or anything, to be honest, within reason. Um, Bro broccoli casserole recipe. Oh, broccoli casserole recipe. <laughs> I, I'm intrigued by that, you know, because I do like my broccoli. Um, then text in. Um, Grand did you write, people? Grand did you write? We all, uh, all regular viewers know that here's a gemstone that uh, kind of erupted on the scenes and we can thank our Wayne for this, really. Yeah. Um, erupted on the scenes and it was a gemstone that I'd heard of, but I'd never entertained seeing it in person because you could go to the Guinness Book of the Records, you go to Forbes, um, New York Times written about it as well, um, that document this gemstone as the world's rarest in the world. The reality is as well, you think about the situation with jadeite. So the jadeite, jadeite the Burmese jadeite mine is now closed, yeah? Mm -hmm. But there's still places around the world that are unearthing jadeite. Still oh, up there okay. in the top ten. However, is that right? Yeah, however... There's nowhere in the world that's unearthing Grand Digirite. Really? Because the, is it Madagascar? Was it Madagascar that they rediscovered this gemstone in 2014? I think it was Madagascar. Yeah. I'm, gonna, I'm refreshing my memory. It's been such a long time since I've spoken about this gemstone. We don't see it a lot. We don't really. see it very often. So, yeah. Um, but that's now mined out. So that's it. There's nowhere in the world. Go to Forbes. And this was when it was being unearthed from the ground. Look at Forbes and the price they say per carat. Look at the stone. As yeah. you'll see, it's not perfectly eye clean. It's beautiful. It's that teal color that Debbie was getting excited about as well. <laughs> now look at ours. I don't hesitate comparing the two. Mm -mm. I totally concur. Ross has just said in our ears, this is one of the nicest strands of Grand right we've ever had. Can I be really honest? I don't normally, normally get... It's not my favourite. I like it, don't get me wrong. Yeah. It's not one of my favourites. However, this is really exciting. Oh, this colour, it's all about the colour. Well, it's as close to being like a paraba. It is. Clarity. It is. Which normally, Grand right is, is an opaque stone. Yeah. Paraba, Indicolite, Olmec, a little bit. It's got those kind of vibes, hasn't it? It is. It's the colour that sells this strand for yeah. me. I mean, I'd never heard of it at first. And then I had it, I was lucky to have it in the calendar, the Christmas calendar, the actual, oh, no, oh. the birthday calendar, not the yeah, Christmas yeah. calendar. Um, and I made with it there. And I just, it's something, again, that I don't have much of in my collection. Well, if I could, if you wouldn't mind, can I just do the write-up, Ross? Here we go. So, granted, you're right. A gem named after French explorer Alfred Grandadier, who studied natural history of Madagascar. Grandidurite was discovered in 1902 in uh, southern Madagascar, and a new Grandidurite de deposit in Madagascar was discovered in 2014. Mm -hmm. That 2014 deposit, and it was very rare then, has now just been mined out. So I don't know. That's enough reason to get it into your there's no, To my knowledge... There's no more anywhere. There's no, nowhere else that's unearthing it. So what Grandidrite is available to the world is in people's collections. That's extra rare then, isn't it? Yeah, it's got to be more than number three, no, or four. I would It's got to be. So. Okay, we're at £99. You also get the three different uh, um, head pins. I think at £99.99 for Grandidrite, seriously? We've just shown you Forbes highlighting mm -hmm. it for 20 grand per carat. 
But we always say in our kits, we bring you the best possible deals. This strand on its own would not be going to the price that you're about to see. You're also going to get the inspiration from our lovely Debbie. You get the, sil you get the silver head pins. £49.99 and pence only for a full strand. And again, genuinely, genuinely, this is some of the best granded I've ever actually seen in person. You're looking at 20, 22 carats of natural textbook granded you right in fact when was the last time we had granded you right on the show uh, no I don't ages, know. ages ago yeah i haven't seen it for absolutely ages all your christmases have come at once i know yeah. and it just you know that i used to want to get this color so badly and i used to get things like um dyed quartz yeah. that was this sort of teal color um, and I remember getting a dyed quartz ring and I was really happy because I was just that color but to actually realize then later on that there's a gemstone that naturally has that mm, color because naturally. I do love it so much um, I, and also you know you're forgetting that you're getting 30 sterling silver head pins with this with, with motifs that, on the bottom well, yeah absolutely you know if again I've got to put this into perspective here folks if I was holding a strand of Brazilian Pareba tourmaline is it going to be 49 <laughs> and the reality is Grand is rarer yeah isn't that it crazy? is rarer yeah. than, 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 than tourmaline yeah. uh, Pareba tourmaline how about okay if I was holding a strand of I don't know Alexandrite mm. in particular Russian Alexandrite would it be 49.99? No, and this is rarer than those gemstones. Now we what? One more price crash. Plus you're getting the sterling silver as well. There's a load of you with it in your baskets. We shouldn't be doing this, but we are going to. It's this, been months since we've had Grand Digirite. This, Close out deal. This is the price on the sheet though. Yeah. Okay, so this is what it should have been. Should have been. Okay. We haven't got many though, have we? Oh, more than I thought. 70 available. But we are going to take it to that closeout deal. Alan and Julie and Samantha and Devon and Carola and Angela and Maker and Meath and Oxfordshire, mm -hmm. Mariska and Janet and Angela and Pauline, Maker, Derbyshire, Tracy, Samantha and Heather. You are an immediate collector if you own Granded Your Eyes. Yeah, you are. Seriously, because there are people with very deep pockets who can only dream of owning this gemstone yeah. and that's not an uh, you know, I'm not exaggerating there you don't have to take my word for it Forbes the reason why it says number three next to it and this is back when it was being unearthed from the ground that's the rarity of the gemstone and the price per carat of the gemstone yeah. so it's in two lists it's in the top 10 most expensive and it's in the top 10 rarest mm. You know, so you can you can you can you can check that. You can absolutely use the wonderful World Wide Web. It'll give you all that information. And it may have changed. It might have gone up. Thirty nine ninety nine. <laughs> that wasn't what it was supposed to be, guys. No. I can vouch for that. I saw the sheet. <laughs> and you get that was brilliant. And you get these. There's a huge amount of silver. And you know, it adds to the story of your jewellery because you'll go, this is Grand Didier, you, right? And do you know that it's one of the rarest gemstones in the world? And la 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 la. And it opens this dialogue to talk about the jewellery, to talk about the gemstones. Named after Alfred Grand Didier. And people are really interested in that. Yeah, they are. You yeah. know, they're really interested in the story. And then they will, you know, if it's a piece that you've given to them or they've bought from you or whatever, they'll go and tell someone else about that. And I love that. It's like I, spreading that story of and the me. gems. And, and, and just, let the, you know, that story, that very brief story that we've just had look it was discovered in 1902 mm -hmm. and it wasn't until 2014 mm -hmm. that another deposit was discovered super rare 100 years do you see where I'm coming from there? Yeah, and it's the sort of thing that I want to wear. And like, like even with my daughter's friends, like the people who follow me on social media have seen that I, I made them the, all their prom jewelry. But I was telling them about the gems. They love gemstones, those girls. And I was, you know, this is the younger generation. I'm telling them about the pearl and how rare this was and where this came from. And they were absolutely fascinated. Yeah. And not being polite, they were genuinely, yeah, genuinely interested. fascinated. Yeah, absolutely. And then you tell them about something like this. Like, yeah. You know what that is, don't you? And that's rare and you can't get it anymore. And they're like, oh, wait, I'm going to write this down. Yeah, it's cool. So cool. And it's lovely to see that enthusiasm. Yeah, absolutely. Flawlessly. Well done, everybody. Make sure you're checking out on those very limited kits now. So, Debbie, uh, your jewellery is stunning. Uh, what are you going to demo? I thought I'd show you how to make these earrings because you can actually take that drop off yeah. and how to turn the head pin into studs, which essentially you just need butterfly Genius. bags. Um, because to actually 
pierce these shapes out. I mean, you can do it with circles if you've got it, or things, like little squares, maybe if you've got the disc cutters. Mm -hmm. But it would be quite a financial outlay to buy a heart disc cutter. Yeah. I don't even know if they do them. They probably do. Um, so you've got ready-made earrings there in those in those head pins that you know usually you would have to pierce out by pierce I mean saw out the heart shape mm -hmm. you'd have to get two exactly the same then you'd have to solder on the wire to make the post here you've got it all ready for you so I'm going to show you how to make these little earrings because the drop comes on and off Perfect. It's on an offable, as you on would say. On an offable, as the tortoise said. I can't take credit for that. <laughs> I know, but you always say it, don't yeah. you? Yeah. Okay. Right, so I'm going to um, grab a couple of these. Lovely. Now, look at that one. That's a little triangle. And that one is lovely because it sits really nicely Very sort nice. of in the middle. So and they're flat, aren't they? They're Sorry. flat. Yeah. So you could use that. If you glued that... Um, just to that, that would be a nice stud, wouldn't it? You yeah. know, something a little bit different. So just to give you an idea of how long these head pins are, because I don't know about you, but unless I get my ruler out, when I see a description, I can't see it in my head. Yeah. So, you know, like sometimes you'll get these sterling silver head pins. I've got loads of them at home and they're like that long, aren't they? Yeah. So once you put a bead in a space of bead, you know, sometimes you can't even do a wrap loop because there's not enough pin left. But they're that long. So never, never throw these away because you can even trade them in for for scrap if you keep them in a, a little scrap pot so never never throw away any of your precious metal odds and ends but of course that is wire in a sense in essence so if you're going to clip that off you know you've got sterling silver wire there so that was the um, little triangle one and I've used the little triangle ones there for the uh, for the drops and then for the actual stud that goes through your ear I've used the little heart and I have to say that these are my absolute favorite these little hearts they're so so pretty and you know we did the show a while ago of the easy channel setting where you just made the little indentation and you, you actually glued on um, a flat back gemstone you could glue on a flat back gemstone to that as well if you wanted to couldn't you that would be really pretty now the main thing to do is to, to first of all turn your um, pins into studs now the easiest way to do this is get a pair of your existing stud earrings that are comfortable so that because everybody I think is earlobe and where the holes are in their ears are different so if you find a pair of stud earrings that you um, are comfortable with and then just measure them against this that's the best way to, to measure them so I just went and got some of my studs that I was happy with so I'm just going to eyeball this one and then you want to cut off if you've got flush cutters that would be the ideal but any cutters because we're going to tidy it up your pin where you want it to be now look how much is left over there so do, you know definitely don't throw that away now what you are going to be left with is a little um sharpness on the back now if you have got metal smithing tools you can actually get a needle file which we sell here at jm and you, all you're going to do is take off any sharp edges. But if you've never worked with metal before, we're always saying about these, it's like a trick of the trade. These four sided nail buffer blocks are absolutely fantastic or a nail file would do it. And you can just bring it so that you're getting a sort of a nice rounded edge there on your pin so that if you have a look at any of your stud earrings, you'll see that this bit's lovely and rounded off. So now that I'm taking my finger around there, I'm not getting any sharp edges because that's the, the bit you're gonna put in your ear. Now, before I demoed this, I got, because I've got a lot of sterling silver butterfly backs um, on their own just from, from doing my silversmithing and you can buy them, you can buy them on their own. I wanted to make sure that this actually fit on before I demoed it because it would be pointless. So this is just your generic um, oh. butterfly back and that fits on perfectly. Now with the earrings that I made, I decided that it might be nice to have something that you could take off. And this is based actually on a design that I did for one of the prom jewelry um, uh, inspiration that she gave me, is to actually pop your drop onto your stud and then you can have essentially two pairs of rings. You might not always want the drop on. So what I've done, I've chosen a different pin because you get your three different this is the triangle. Then you get the, like the little um, Van Cleef looking flower. Mm -hmm. And then obviously you get your heart. But of course you could, if you wanted it, your drop to match your stud, you could put your heart on the bottom there. So I've got my grandid ear right, but I've teamed it with pearls and some sterling silver spacers just because that was my taste. But you know, you know what you want to do. And I'm just going to wrap loop that. 
So if you haven't made jewellery before, using the bottom of your pliers will enable you to make a smaller loop. And as you go up, you make larger ones. Now, in this case of earrings, you would want the two to be the same so that you didn't look lopsided, unless that was the look you're going for. I think that's a bit trendy at the moment. So I'm just going to take this pin across the top and the beauty of sterling silver, um, any finding is they're so malleable. So I'm going to take that over the top. I don't want my... Um, little loop to be too big because I don't want it to show and there's so many different ways of doing wrap loops just how I do it and then I'm going to hold on to the loop and then I'm just going to take the pin across now you will find it's a bit skew if at this point so then I just straighten it up and I'm going to get another pair of pliers and I'm going to wrap that around now again look how much pin I've got left over after doing that and then I'm going to just cut that off and if you've got any pin protruding um, from here, then you can just squish it in. Have a squish. Squeeze. That's that's your technical term. Squish it in with your with your pliers. So what you're left with essentially is like a little drop, and then you've got your um, stud. So all you have to do when you're wearing them is before you put the earring on, you pop the little loop on the stud there, and pop it through your ear and then put your back on. So you can either have that sitting behind your stud in the front of your ear, or what the girls did that I made the prom jewelry for is they put the stud through the ear. Mm -hmm. So it was just the stud in the ear. So it sat really close to their ear. Then they put the loop on, the little um, drop. I yeah. think one of them had a chain on hers. And then you put the butterfly back. So then the little um, drop sits behind your ear. So it's completely up to you. If you put it, um, so that you put it uh, um, in front of your ear, then obviously your little heart will sit um, out from your ear a little bit. If you want that heart to sit really close to your ear, then just put the heart on and then add the drop to the back Amazing. of the ear. So that's not hard, is it? And you can do that with any of your pins. You can turn them into little, little um, earrings and little studs. It just gives that interest at the top, doesn't it? They're beautiful and what a genius idea. And then, you know, if you wanted, you can make some other little drops that you could have with those. And you, maybe you don't always want them, sometimes you just want the studs. Yeah. You know, with for the girls, for the prom, I did a chain that came from the back to the front mm -hmm. that they wanted. And um, I thought, oh, I'm going to run with that idea because it's what the youngsters are doing. Well, that's what the youth. And also, you know, not everybody can afford loads of earrings, especially earrings like this. Uh, sterling silver earrings. Yeah. So if you can kind of interchange, then why not? Yeah. You know, get the most out of everything in the kit. Yeah, absolutely. And it's easy. It's as easy as that. <sighs> Love, so, absolutely <laughs> love that. Does that get a... a <laughs> absolutely it does. <laughs> <laughs> um, can we just for a second, I, it, it just dawned on me, I can get both of those kits, two, right. one one locational gemstone, which we know will be mined out in the foreseeable, one which is already there, and all that sterling silver for less than £100. Oh, wow. £70. £70. Pounds. You know, and uh, you know what? If you add in that pearl toggle class and the pearls, you'd still less than a hundred pounds for all That's of those. That's my kind of kit. Just Absolutely. bring it. Bring it, Mister DPD. Bring it. Yeah. What does that think of the jewelry that you're making? Yeah. Those? Amazing. Thank you, Debbie. As always, absolutely beautiful jewelry. Just easy to wear, and you know, kits like this, you don't have to do much. Do no, you? I mean, no. beautiful. Wow. Well, you know, amazing. But I love that idea. Now. Coming up tomorrow at nine o'clock, I want to give you a little bit of a heads up. <gasps> oh, that's lovely. Oh my goodness me. Is this a bundle of two and three millimeter topaz? I see that very much. When we say that you get a better deal in a bundle, this is proving that. Nine Can I also say how perfect this would be? Oh, yeah. With Debbie's Tanzanite. That would be stunning. Yeah. We are going to do a massive, massive closeout deal at nine o'clock tomorrow. So set your alarms, your reminders. Major, major closeout deal on genuine, flawless topaz tomorrow. So make sure you're with me. Like we said at the beginning of the show, Christmas in July, 
um, we always say we buy specifically for it. It's yeah. a huge event here at Jewelry Maker. Um, Russ has just said, I'm thinking tassels. I'm thinking your cap capriccio. Capriccio, what size are they? They're, you get two mil and three mil. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you'd have to just um, change the number of your um, netting beads yeah. or add a seed bead either side. So maybe add a 11 instead of a 15 either side. But yes, you most definitely could. Oh my goodness me, nine o'clock tomorrow. Make sure you're with me folks because that's going to be absolutely incredible. Now, it is that time, wonderful jewelry makers. Um, for the next five minutes, we're going to put these on pre-order. Let me show you. So it's actually a double deal of the day because you've got, we're going to start with the chains. Now this is a meter long length of uh, an open link chain, which is great because <laughs> if you don't solder, then um, this doesn't exclude you. Yeah, exactly. I'm not a solder either. Um, you can just directly wrap loop onto these or you can jump ring onto yeah. these as well and you can customize your creations. We really ever see these by the way, really, really ever. And I'm going to tell you they're limited. There's only a 50 of them available. I've got a big quantity of the silver. It's a meter long length. And then you've got these beautiful clasps coming up. You can shop ahead and pre-order over the next few minutes. And it's happening after this break. Don't go anywhere. <laughs> Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, this Saturday's deal of the day, we have been listening. You've been shouting out for all of your essentials, haven't you? You've been messaging into the studio. You've been shouting to us saying, we need our essentials. Well, we listened and at 10 o'clock, we have Ross's stash grab. I have the list, which include your featherweight head pins, your lever bat shepherd hooks, your finding wire end tips, and so much more. So if you're desperate for your essentials, it's this Saturday's deal of the day. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day we offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help.
Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Welcome back, everybody. I've just been decorating the tree. I'm having a great time. I know. Where's the sherry? Where's the sherry? Oh. <laughs> That's what my it's granddad used to say. Would you like a sherry? <laughs> oh, my granddad. It's the most Christmas drink ever, isn't it? Yeah. Do you reckon oh. that? Sherry? Maybe? What's that yellow stuff that my oh, mum snowballs. used to drink? Yeah, my mum used to drink that. Our, 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 what was it called? Oh, what was it called? What was it called? Next in, what was it called? That, that yellow, yellow drink. stuff that you make snowballs out of. Avocar. Av oh, that's it. I've never had that. I've never tried it. And Baby Sham. Baby Sham? Do you remember the advert? Yeah, the Ooh. little... Did she used to say that? I think I'll have a Baby Sham. And then I used to think, like, if you put a cherry in it, it's so Christmas. You know, <laughs> at Christmas Eve, should we get the Baby Sham out? Again, I don't think I've tried Baby Sham. It's too sweet for me now. Do they even do it now? Do they do I it now? I don't know. Not sure. But it was, it, that was probably the, the beginning of my love of sparkling wine. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. I like a sparkling wine. Well, we're talking all things Christmas because it's Christmas in July here at Jewelry Maker. I don't stick a turkey on my head for nothing. <laughs> um, yeah. Amazing. And it's, it's been deals galore and we've still got so much to bring you. Um, and like I said, you know, as your birthday, we always, uh, here at Jewelry Maker, we always buy specifically throughout the course of the year for the birthday, as do we for Christmas in July. It's a pretty big occasion because, and, and somebody that's not from the crafting world and, and does not understand what Christmas in July is all about, I try, every year I have to explain it to my husband and I'm like, look, I say it to you all the time. It's because, you know, halfway through the year, people start thinking, especially if you've got a business or if you gift, if you create to gift, yes. you have to start making them, yeah, yeah. don't you? Because it doesn't just happen overnight. Oh, there's a gap in the Christmas tree. Carry on. You carry on, I know. I can't cope with the gap. It's going to do my head in. No, fair enough. Right, you, arrange, you rearrange those balls. Carry on. Yeah, we'll talk amongst ourselves. La, um, la, so, la, and over la, this weekend, la. you have got your essentials, you've got sterling silver, you've got amazing gemstone launch, you've got beautiful kits coming up as well. Um, and, but your fir the first day of Christmas of July, deal of the day, knowing that this is going to be, this is the biggest auction of the day, you know that it's going to be a pretty special one. Now, everything is available on pre-order as we speak. Now, if you're thinking, how do I do that? All the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Um, if you click lock, watch live and then you scroll down, see on the right hand side it says coming up on today's show. You can shop ahead on all of these. So we've got them in the three different colours, you meet along lengths of your long link chain, and you've also got that screw clasp set with Zircon. So you can shop ahead on each of those. Look at where they're starting from. And most popular normally is the silver. Actually, now gold is overtaking. I'm not right surprised. Now. Gold is Have massive. You noticed at the yeah, it yeah, is, isn't massive. it? Massive. Huge, huge, huge. Um, and actually, at one point here at Jewelry Maker, we were sort of uh, um, slowing down our gold purchases, the gold colours purchases, because yeah. it wasn't as popular and it was like ended up being what we call sticky stock. Not the case anymore. No, Definitely not the case is, anymore. Is, in some designers, don't even do silver or anything, do no, they? No, true. So these are precious metal. We're not talking base metals. And when I was researching last night, um, you know, Ross, I didn't send you anything, did I, last night? No, um, because, and the reason why I didn't send it is because every time I tried to find a link that was similar, mm. that could compare gram weight and size-wise, for okay. example, we're actually stainless steel. Yeah. So, um, yeah, it's really difficult to find a comparison on these. Um, as we said earlier on in the show, the largest quantity auction I've ever done here at Jewelry Maker was 2,000, as in uh, 2,000 items available, mm. um, that sold out, and it was on the meter long length of chain. As a, as a Jewelry Maker, Debbie, you know, buying meat lengths of chain like this as opposed to maybe in the in the complete necklaces which definitely have their place don't get me yeah, wrong yeah yeah there's a reason why people will buy the lengths won't they definitely and again i'm harking back to the prom jewelry but um one of the girls wanted a very chain heavy 
uh, necklace. And it was sort of, you know, the design where you kind of, you have a bit of chain and then you have ch a chain hanging down and something hanging off it and then another bit of chain. And that's where this really comes into its own because mm. you don't want to be cutting up finished chains because you need those for your pendants and bits and pieces, your single pearls, whatever. But when you want to do designs, you want to be as economic as possible, especially with sterling silver. Yeah. So you can measure somebody's wrist. You can actually hold the chain up and cut it exactly where you want it. There's no waste. And chain is what I run out of the most. Lengths of chain like this. Oh, yeah. I just, Absolutely, oh. because you can, if you go, if you step into a you know, a professional jewellery workshop. Mm. They don't, you know, if they're making for somebody, they tend to use it off a spool like yeah, this. Yeah. It's on a constant spool because that's the way, it's more cost effective. Yeah. You don't lose as much of Definitely. the sterling silver. You're not throw it discarding precious metal. You know, if you imagine you're cutting up maybe a chain, a, a I don't know, whatever length it is, mm. you're going to be left with these sort of short, uh, short lengths, which I'm not saying are, aren't usable. You could figure a way, but ideally you don't want to be left with lots and lots and lots of those Especially little Especially not when it's um, sterling silver. Yeah. And when it's sterling silver that's plated with rose gold or gold, which honestly is so hard to get affordable yeah. chain in that gold plate uh, it's very difficult yeah absolutely. And i don't often see links of this size no it's usually the little tiny ones that you need the feather weight although 0.4 to get through the links absolutely i mean this op opens opportunities for extender chains if you if you wanted it to be yep. and they're perfect things like your bubble styles your alhambra inspirations you've got those sort of larger like links um uh, to actually sort of attach or directly onto you don't even need to solder that's why i said no. earlier on you don't need to be a silversmith to work with this now there is two grams of solid sterling silver it's gold plated 925 sterling silver and you can see, look at the quality you can see that quality and like i said i really struggled to a point i actually gave up in the end last night i was like okay well i can't, I can't. it's not the same everything that i was looking at wasn't the same yeah and i'm not saying it's not available anywhere but i couldn't find it last night um and i know that here at jewelry maker we bring you the best possible deals i have been to our chain well it's not ours but the chain manufacturers that supplies our chains mm. they are italian made italian made machinery yes and it's basically knitted it's absolutely beautiful wow. sort of a, a process the machinery almost knits it together and they come on these kind of massive long lengths effectively and that's how you buy it yeah but the craftsmanship and, and the quality of the chains that we bring here at jewelry maker are second to none and furthermore the price tag so as part of your christmas in july weekend starting the christmas in july uh, uh, event your first deal of the day it had to be an absolute cracker <laughs> <I've heard. laughs> sorry if you if you've just tuned in i'm not being bar humbug i've got christmas earrings it's all i could find it is july you'll be forgiven and i am for that. just so jealous of the turkey hat because you know i would be wearing one of them yeah absolutely you can borrow this Thank you. Just because I'm not as organised as you. Should I, I just to... drive home with that on and see who looks at me as yeah. I'm driving all the way up to, yes. up to the north? <laughs> Good luck, everybody. It's a metre. We aren't talking base metals here. We are talking about solid 925 sterling silver with your buttery yellow gold plating not closing at 99 pounds. Well done to those of you that have shopped ahead. Folks, I've got 50 of these. It's not nearly enough. Yo, ho, ho. I've got 50 of these available. Um, Santa and the turkey. I'm so um, happy now. Samantha Thank and Lunda and Elaine and Judith and Lynn. Massive price crash. The thing is that with opportunities like this, and we're very fortunate, Debbie, to be here on a regular basis, aren't we? How often do we see these? Well, I, d I don't think I've ever seen a gold-plated one. No. So it's one of those, if we don't get it when we do, then what happens? Yeah, I, well, I've look, I know because I've looked for gold plated yeah. and I just couldn't get it anywhere. No. You can get, um, well, if someone's going to gold plate steel, how good's the gold plate going to be? I mean, I'm not saying everywhere, I don't know. And but by the way, they were expensive, yeah. the gold plated steel ones. We've got a metre long length, precious metal on precious metal, two 18 inch chains with surplus. Haven't you? You've got matching ear you've got earrings as well. And we're not even stopping at £39.99. We are going lower. I've got 50. I wish I had 150. 
I wish I had 250 with the popularity of yellow gold plated 925. Well, I'm not saying you can't get it, but I found it, I'm sure, you know. It's difficult. It is in this country. Yeah. And then if you're going to get it from abroad, you might have to pay shipping, um, shipping and um, import tax. Yeah, true. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it's so now. expensive now. Yeah. And then you think, oh, no, I thought I was... Um, you know, getting a discount here, and then you end up just paying more because you don't, can't get it until you pay that import yeah, tax. Yeah, absolutely. That's a really good point, mm. actually. Really, really good point. Yeah, well, I had a similar situation when I was trying to get hold of a class, a gold class, mm. um, and the only place I could actually find one which I really liked was from Italy, and I was like, <laughs> okay, I'm priced out now. It's really expensive. Uh. $39.99? It's not what you're paying as your deal of the day. Shop ahead on the rose gold, shop ahead on the silver with those lovely statement, quite open links, but still really elegant. I think you've got that lovely sort of fluidity. They're not chunky, are they? To a point Whoa. where it's quite clumpy. £24.99 pence only for a metre length. If you do the maths... That's a metre? Yeah. How many bracelets can you make out, out, out you know, I know you've got to add your clasps in there, but how many bracelets? Let's say That's seven because you've got to add the clasp as well. Yes. So say seven inches, so you can get five point six bracelets out oh. for twenty four pounds and ninety nine pence. And they are gold plated sterling silver. Yeah, not steel. That's so at that price, per bracelet is working out at about four pound forty six per bracelet. How amazing is that? This is why, like I said, jewelry workshops usually buy it by on a spool or, or, or by the length like this because it's much more cost effective and they do because chain takes ages to make it's, yeah and especially if you need a lot of chain factoring in your time and if you can buy it on spools at an affordable most jewelers will do that unless you're making like a big chunky statement chain. Yep. but any sort of chain like this which is the bread and butter of all of your jewelry making usually will be bought well Again, this is something I've said so many times on air, and I'm sorry to sound like a broken record. Say, Debbie and I, Debbie, we're, going on, we're on a shopping trip. Be nice, wouldn't it? Oh, yeah. Little girly shopping mm. trip. Wander down to in our local shopping mall, whichever you see, a Samuels. Most, most high streets have yes. got Samuels, haven't they? And if you're anything like me, I always have a little look. Always press my nose at the window so and have I. a little look. Uh, but you can find a fit, you can find a generic chain in Samuels, just your standard 18 inch curb chain. Mm. I don't even know if it's gold plated, uh, more than what's on your screens right now. You can. It's not cheap anymore to go into the, you know, we used to be the inexpensive jewellers. I went in with my son, I've said this before, and he was after sterling silver something or other. and. I was gobsmacked at the yeah. amount. Like silver's not a cheap alternative anymore. No, I mean, not at the all. The price of metals has shot through the roof. Yeah. So you know, but I think people who do work with metal will know that, and they'll know what a good deal this is. Mm -hmm. But if you don't, we're telling you. Well, it's just <laughs> over four pound per bracelet. You ain't going to find that on the high street, are no. you? Uh, Twenty-four pounds and ninety-nine pence. Lots of multi buyers. We had fifty. I've got ten. Oh, okay. Um, how unbelievable is that? What were, you, what were you eating on our shopping trip? What do you fancy? Do you know, when, when I normally go shopping, which is rare, I can't remember the last time I actually went shopping, um, without children in terms no, of some too. kind of meltdown. Um, but if I was to imagine it, say we were going shopping, I'm imagining it as sushi. Oh, okay, not sushi. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I could dig Adam for the sushi. What would I'll you prefer, sit with then? you in the sushi bar and have wine. No. Oh, no. I what would you prefer, then? Tapas? Italian, Italian. Or Greek. Okay, well, I'm down with that. Nice salad. Um, yeah, any, anything like that. But obviously, like... Not sushi. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, Adam's just... Well, I'll, I'll, have, I'll have my starter with Elle, and then I'll meet you, for, Debbie, for the main. Excellent. Amazing. Then we'll go to the champagne um, bar. There, yeah, oh, there, I am there. Let's now do the rose gold. Look how beautiful this tea bar is, seriously. The quality of this chain is absolutely stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Your soft blush rose gold 925 sterling silver by the meter. Look how beautiful that is. Can you imagine like a Cartier inspired, inspired sort of trilogy pair of earrings, just three lengths, maybe like an inch, yes. inch and a quarter, inch and a half across the three different colors. 
from one of your head pins. That would be gorgeous. That would be so gorgeous. And I, I love mixing metals anyway, because I think, you know, and it, it, people never used to do that. And now it's really sort of become a thing, hasn't yeah. it? Mixing metals that you will get the three different colored metals. Usually, though, it's base metal. It's not you know, sterling silver properly plated. Proper 925, yeah. which this is. I've got a similar limited quantity on these as well. There is only 50 available. 60 seconds on your screens. I think some of you already know where it's going to, so I'll say it out loud. If you are a, a lover of the blush warm, very romantic rose gold, it really works. I think right with pink pearls, it looks amazing. Yeah, definitely. You know, different precious metal colours complement different gemstones, I think. And skin tones. And skin tones, yeah, really good point, actually. Mm. Um, we're going to match the price, everybody. I've only got 50 of them. Make sure you're shopping ahead on your silver um, lengths of chain. They're always so popular, lengths of chain like this, because, like I said, A, you need chain. Mm -hmm. And if you haven't got, if you run out of, say, your pre-made uh, sort of 18 or 20 inches, then you, you've got something to, to, to sort of reach for. By the way, these have sold out. This one's sold out, so you can get hold of the rose gold, you can still get hold of the silver, but this is going to follow suit, I'm fairly sure. Um, it's a, it's a tiniest amount of copper that they put within rose gold that mm. gives it that lovely blush colour tone. You mentioned in skin tones, I, th I always think that rose gold, this is only my personal opinion, but I always think rose gold is complementary of every skin tone yeah rose, isn't it? rose gold really is and if you think about you know how much rose gold has, has gone absolutely massive yeah. in the last sort of five years yeah if you wanted something in rose gold a while ago you'd find it hard it would be here and there and then it just went absolutely popular nuts, did, nuts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. um but to be able to get and also as an artisan maker if someone comes to you and says, I want this on a chain, and you don't just go, oh, would you want 16 or 20 or whatever, 18, you can actually bespoke it to them. Yeah. So you can hold it up and go, where do you want it to sit? Yeah, absolutely. And you can cut it at, at you know, 15 or not, whatever. And it, that is so important, I think, because it's so frustrating. For example, my daughter, who's six, bless mm. her, she loves jewellery mm. very much takes after mummy in that loves 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 jewellery and i really struggle to get her chains yeah. because she's so tiny exactly obviously. really struggle to and i still want to give her you know if it's not going to break the bank i'd still like to be able to give her precious metal or someone might have something that they wear all the time that they want to layer yeah and you know the tw 20 inch is just slightly too short yeah and the next one down is too long yeah. and you can then it just bespoke it to exactly it might just be you that you make for yeah you can bespoke it to exactly the length that you want to layer that jewelry yeah absolutely totally agree we've got 14 of them left we've matched that price point make sure you get them whilst you have the opportunity because we seldom see the one i'm not saying never but we rarely get the one meter lengths and when we do they always fly um i'm straight down into the single figures hello to jay marie lorna and julian catherine and virginia and patricia and morag and devon and Anne, Teresa and nottinghamshire hello to you pearl maker and sharon virginia and karen and london and lynn and i'm on my way down to your county next weekend i'm very excited off to beautiful pembrokeshire are you going camping? We're in the tent. Oh, I like camping. Yeah, me too. Excited about that. So, um, amazing. Make sure you're checking out those baskets, everybody. You get them when you see them because they're not on our shows on a regular basis. And they're always incredibly popular. Right. Over the 13 years that we've been broadcasting, we all know that silver is generally the most popular. Mm -mm. And it makes sense because silver goes with silver. Silver goes with white gold. Silver goes with platinum. So that makes sense. Yeah, it does. Silver used to be also the most affordable of all of those ones mentioned, but as you just said, <laughs> it's also very expensive now. The price of yeah, silver has gone right up, 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 up. We have a big quantity opportunity for you folks. A metre long length. We know to buy bigger when it comes to 925 silver. Yeah. Um, and people won't just get ones or twos of these. Um, again, can I just retrace my step? Historically, and that's the best thing for us to go from here at Jewelry Maker, is historically, the biggest auction in terms of quantity that I've ever done on our screens was a metre-long length of sterling silver chain. But I don't have the 2,000 that I had on that occasion. I've got 200. 
and a quarter of the stock is already gone. So be quick. Don't wait. The clasps, the gold, rose, and yellow, also almost half the quantity has gone on those in pre-order. So yeah. they are coming up to... You could literally just attach those directly to this chain. You could. I mean, you could use it as a lariat, couldn't you? That if you wanted lovely. to, that would yeah. be so pretty. Absolutely gorgeous. There are 200 of these available. Think of all the different opportunities when you've wanted to create a piece of jewellery and you haven't had the, not just chain, you haven't had the right chain hmm. to go with it. Because this is the thing, and this is why our stashes grow, let's be honest, because there's always something like, oh, I wish I had that right now. Yeah. You know, if I want to make an anklet, I probably couldn't do that out of a Very true. chain. Very true. And also, you would want to measure. I always have trouble with anklets. Me They're too. either massive and they sit right down on my foot, or they're too small. And I, I know how I like them. Yeah, you same. Know, to be comfortable. Same. And so, again, you can do that with this because you can measure it. And we're in summer. I'm in the height of summer right now. I mean, how popular are anklets? Yeah. Also, some people have got larger wrists, smaller wrists. Yeah. They're not all built the same size. You can actually customise these. If you want to do the waterfall inspiration, yes. if you want to do bubble style inspiration, if you want to create this lovely little jellyfish um, that our Debbie has created in the last hour, you could do it with these chains. Um, at, the, at the back of this necklace, you know, you haven't used the Grand DJI all the way around because let's be honest, that would be a bit wasteful, yeah, wouldn't absolutely. it? Yeah, absolutely. You've got chain at the back. It, you know, it, it, it's maximising, maximising on your gems and your precious components. You're getting a metre length. So that's what, five and a half bracelets if you want. Mm -hmm. Two 18-inch necklaces plus a bracelet or earrings. Multiple pairs of earrings. Extender chains. We're open this auction in three, two, one. One, and we give it the countdown, obviously not just to count you guys in, because we know you're ready, you're poised waiting to, to secure yours. We know it will go for, it'll go crazy on the phone lines and on the web, but also to make sure our call centre team are ready, because we are about to bombard them. Historically, and that's the greatest gauge for us here at Jewellery Maker, you know, what are the fastest selling auctions, for example, and it is, it is chains, length of chain by the metre. Um, your complete chains always, are always extremely popular especially yeah. at our prices they're yeah. unbelievable but sometimes actually being able to customize them actually being able to do that it's it's important and it, that's why you tend to run out especially i do of silver chain because that's the what i would be asked most for is silver yeah um you know and it just it goes there's also actually i'm thinking about it now but there's none left now of the gold but there's a lady that has a pottery studio around the corner from us and she buys chain like this and she makes little pottery pendants oh beautiful you know so there again you know to be able to say well what length do you want and cut it just looks so much more professional doesn't yeah, it and it also does. you know you're not wasting it no absolutely that's it i mean there's a lot of sterling silver we've got yeah, there. there is they're draped good, across good the back size, of my hands yeah, two grams in, in total. The first, loads of multi-buyers on this opportunity. You know, we know that silver is the most popular colour. Not just on our screens, probably internationally. Yeah, definitely. It is the most popular colour. And we know with these slightly more um, open links, you've got opportunities as jewellery makers, especially if you're not a solderer. I'm not a solderer. Um, you know, I, I, I don't have the time. I don't have the equipment, yeah. frankly. But, you know, I can still do a little cheeky wrap loop or I can open and yes. close a jump ring directly yes. on there. Um, you know also that we are not stopping at £99.99, and pence, but we are basically kind of managing this auction, even though there's 200, even though I'd like to add a zero to the end of that <laughs> quantity, I really would. Um, there's 200 available for you today as part of the launch of your Christmas in July deal of the days. You've seen where, what happened with the yellow gold. You're about to see what happens with the rose gold as there's five of them left. Oh, sorry, less than that now. Um, so that's going to be a sellout. And they sold, or potentially sold out, at this. A hundred of these, or just shy, have already gone. We are not done. Oh. My only, my only issue is I'd like to add a zero to the end of that 200. Wouldn't it have been good if we had 2,000 of these? It would, because it's a staple. Yeah, it's a must. And we've got an essentials hour tomorrow, haven't we, Roscoe? Roscoe's stash grab, that's it. Um, 
brand new oh, essentials. Oh, really? Oh, I'm going to watch that then. This could absolutely have been included within that hour, couldn't it? Bundles of sterling silver, clasps, toggles. We've got clasps, a very high-end clasp coming up in a few moments' time. We're at $24.99, where the rose gold and the yellow have, have pretty much sold out, if not entirely. We're taking this even lower. Stock up while you get the opportunity. This is what we always say, you know, if you run out, say you've got something in your mind, you're doing commissions or whichever mm -hmm. it might be. You think, okay, I need that style of link and you haven't got it. You, you know, we don't have it on demand no do no, we? no 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 now we are into double figure quantities two solid grams of sterling silver and we are taking it even lower than the yellow gold and also the rose gold a meter long length Whoa. 22 pounds and 99 pence oh. why is the clock still moving we're not done going even lower Wow, I, I know we I knew we had to manage this auction. We don't just go straight down to it because we'll melt the web, um, we'll melt the phone lines and the app. Everything goes into mayhem, and everyone's look the t the, the, the the call centres um, cross with us. Um, the web yeah IT guys are cross with us because we've basically just broken everything. <laughs> so we have to we have to stagger the auction, and also it's frustrating for you guys. Mm. So we yeah chip our way down. We are not stopping here. So in 22 seconds, we are going even lower. We had 200 of them. So That's many. not enough, to be honest. Multi-buyers, look, yeah. crazy. Because you, I think you've said it perfectly. These are a must. They're a staple. And we can't always get them. It's not like we can get them every week on JM. No. Not, not in meter length no. like this. And not with these links. No. Which you can use for so many things. You know, not dealing with a fine chain here where you're going to have to try and force a 0.4 wire through or a featherweight. You can use this for most things. And Absolutely. our jewelry makers know that. Exactly. That's why the core screens look the way they mm -hmm. do. They know. 19 pounds and 99 pence only for a meter. So can we just do the maths on this? Because I'm terrible. So um, if you can get approximately 5.6 bracelets out of one length, you can make a bracelet for a 925 sterling silver bracelet for about £3.56. You can't, that is cheaper than base metal. I totally agree. And again, when I was doing my research last night, I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll say it as it is. I did throw my dollies out my pram a little. Maybe my head wasn't right last <laughs> night. I don't know, but did throw my dollies out my pram a little bit last night because everything, I, just when I thought I'd found the same style of chain as this, and measurements, that's what mm -hmm. I, I found it really difficult. I re established that it was it was base metal. That it's not easy to get or, hold of. Or st or not like steel. this. No. Hi, Michelle. Uh, at that price, uh, uses closed jump rings. Great idea. Yeah, you could. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. Couldn't you? Yeah. Really good point. Up there for thinking, down there for dancing. My goodness me. And if you wanted to solder, obviously you can solder directly oh, yeah. onto yeah, this. Yeah. You can solder a jump ring or a clasp. But the point is you don't have to because you've got, you know, a, a curb chain, for example, you're, you're going to find it pretty tricky to push. It's not impossible, no. but it's harder. It's harder. Um, you can always crimp it. But again, those sort of sterling silver chain crimps are quite hard to get hold of. And yep. then you'll get one and think, oh, it's too big or it's too small. So this is just perfect. You just pop on a jump ring, which of course you can solder the jump ring, as you said, yeah. if, if you do do that. But you know, not everyone's got the equipment, have they? No, absolutely. Stock up on these. And I think, again, we don't have them constantly in stock. Now I've got 66 of these left. There's a whole heap of you in the process. <gasps> really? Let's do it. It's Christmas in July. We've got a turkey on our head and Debbie's looking like, like Mrs. Claus. I'm happy now. You look beautiful as Mrs. Claus. I've got a, I've got a hat on yeah, now. I'm happy. Festive hat. Love that. Shall we do it? Shall we do? A true Christmas in July deal. La, 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 la. Brand new premiere. It's going to be a one show wonder, isn't it? I think Class so. Class are coming up. Uh, no, these aren't base metal. They're not, they're not stainless steel. These are solid 925 and two grams of it as well. Let's bring you an even bigger deal. I've got 59 of them left. Sandra, you were the first person to make your confirmation lovely. Well done. Like a Cheshire cat you are right now. 
We're going even lower. Good luck, everybody. Those of you who haven't yet checked out your baskets, first come, first serve. We can't say any fairer than that. Look, at the end of the day, 59 is like about, about 30 people getting two. Isn't it? Yes. It, it, that quantity yes. can go very, very, very quickly. And we've not got just twos. There's threes, fours, and fives on um, on our call screens right now as well. We're at 19 99 just over £3.50 per sterling silver bracelet, if that's what you turn them into. It's so cost effective to buy them by the lengths like this. Yes, yeah, definitely. And if you do customise it, then you're not throwing anything away. Nothing's going into the little pot. Exactly. And also, you know, clasps are different sizes. Yeah. So, you know, you, you take into consideration the size of your clasp when you make your bracelet and you can cut it just right. Yeah, just so. Just right. Good luck, everyone. This is going to be an on-screen sellout. I think you can just about get hold of the rose gold. Is that right? Is there any of the rose gold left? Still just yellow gold sold out. Silver is about to follow suit. Good luck, everybody. Lorna says, I'll have three. Jan says, I'll have two. Tracy's got two. Michelle's got two. Roz has got two. Karen and John's got two. I'm under, one, uh, under 50 in terms of their quantity. Malcolm and Karen have got four. Anne's got three. <laughs> Kathy, oh, my goodness, that's amazing. <laughs> that's a fantastic price point. Again, Annie, it's that moment of realisation where you think, um, hi, Roz, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you lot. We love you too, It's amazing, Roz. that price, isn't it, Roz? You could go on, let's go back to our shopping trip. Yeah, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hello, hello Samuels. Uh, yeah, I'm still eating as Oh, you're well. still eating? Yeah, All right, I'm, I'm in the... But you actually, the sushi. I, I might just get it the rest to go and go to the jewellers, because I do like looking in the jewellers. Absolutely, because then you can do that smug face, can't you? Do you want to okay. see? <sighs> smug face, like, it's how much for... How, it's how much for that sterling silver chain? You know, just a standard curve. Do the head thing. Yeah. Mm -mm. Okay. Oh, I look like one of those things you put in the car. <laughs> <laughs> you go that way, I'll go this way. We're going to the jewellers, right? We've got our takeaway food and our champagne, which is probably why we've got these hats on. Yeah, absolutely. And we do this because we're smug. Can you imagine us just sat in July? Yes, with, uh, I can. That is the truth. That's true. And we wouldn't care either, would no, we? No, not even remotely. As long as we had a few pearls on, yeah, we'd be right. not even remotely. Uh, Seventeen <laughs> ninety nine, everybody. Well done. The phone lines, the website has gone crazy. Fours, threes, twos. It's always worthwhile stocking up on these if you see them because they're never, they're never. You know, we we always. I remember a conversation being had that was like, right, we must always have a constant supply of our essentials. Mm. That's really difficult to do, to yeah. be honest, yeah. because we do deals like this and then they're gone and we're back to square one again, aren't we? And so, it doesn't take five minutes to get them all back in again. Yeah. It doesn't. It's a big process. Yeah. So that's why you need to get them when you see them, really. Things like this, I think you do. Amazing. Well done, everybody. Uh, 17 99 Goodness me, that's incredible, <laughs> isn't it? Again, less than £100, you've got three metres of chain. Do you know, that's... Just the, the best. Biggest bit of excitement I've had in ages. <laughs> <laughs> I really need to get out more, don't oh. I? Oh. No, I don't know. I'd agree. That's a pretty good deal. That's isn't an it? amazing, That's amazing deal. deal. Yeah, I'm so impressed with that deal. Um, Roz has come back and she's got more. No, I can surprised. see you there, Roz. Well done. Getting three. And Sarah and Cornwall getting two. And Maggie multiplying. And Isabel multiplying. And Angela and Susan. And Janet and Lisa and Sandra and Florence. And Edith and Karen and John and Jay Marie. And Malcolm and Karen and Judith. And Amanda and Janice and Sandy and London. I can't keep up with you. You've got I've got four full rows of names, everybody. We're closing this auction and the quantity is going to disappear as well. Well done to to each and every single one of you. Do you know what I think that this that you know that um sorry, I'll get my words out in a second. Do you think do you know what I think that warrants? What? Ready? Just <laughs> <laughs> there's an echo in here, there's a definite echo. And that turkey keeps bringing me cups of tea. I know, he's a very good Christmas turkey. He's a very, he? very good. Yeah, very good. He's <laughs> lovely, that turkey. <laughs> Thank you for the Christmas cup, Michael. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. I think they've pretty much sold out or very, 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 very close to. Um, if you have just tuned in, tomorrow at 9 o'clock, you need to set a reminder or an alarm um, or write it on, I don't know, stick it on a post-it by the kettle where you're not going to forget. Put the alarm We're, on your phone. Yes, that always works. Look, this is a big Christmas summer blowout. 
<laughs> yeah, big summer blowout. Look at the quality. If you're looking at genuine, flawless topaz, we're going to do it in a closeout deal tomorrow at nine o'clock. Don't miss out. They are utterly, utterly exquisite. So nine o'clock tomorrow. And fruit was something of this grade. On the back of the beautiful sterling silver deal of the days. On the back of the grand did you write and the tans night and the, and the jadeite that you've got coming up. You're going to need a high-end class, aren't you? Well, we're stepping into your high-end class, very designer-inspired class in a few moments' time, but not before I show you your 11 o'clock hour. Now, so speaking to the powers that be, the idea and the concept behind this little, little collection, and it is a collection, was that we would take some of our favourite type A jadeite carvings, mm -hmm. And we would take them to our uh, jewellery workshop um, and have them set them. So have them framed, have them mounted. So all you need to do is put them on a chain or a cord, whichever you wish. And you've got cords coming up with mm -hmm. Debbie in the 12 o'clock hour as well. So these have been professionally mounted i know lots of you can do uh, the mounts yourselves and we that's why we bring them to you on their own but there is also people that maybe don't like myself yeah so you know um all you need is just to pop them directly onto a chain i've got to Definitely. be on i'm shopping during this hour well i've had a really good close look at every single one of these and they are blooming gorgeous aren't they? i know i mean they are so wearable and, you know, if you want to make them a little bit different, mm -hmm. you can add things to them and yeah. onto, you know, whatever you're going to put them on. Oh, you could pearl knot onto that. You could pearl knot onto that. You could definitely. I mean, I'm going to be putting them onto cords and showing you a couple of different ways um, that you can do that. But you could add a drop, like a large pearl, and then this on the bottom of it. Or, mm -hmm. you know, as jewellery makers, we get the luxury of, of taking it even further. Or yeah. just put it on a chain or a piece of cord, and it's super, beautiful. Super, super, super simple. Yeah. So these are coming up in the 11 o'clock hour as well, jewellery makers. So I told you it was going to be an absolutely stunner. A st oh, look at that. I love that one. A stunner of a Friday. Now, oh, yeah, great idea, Roscoe. Roscoe says his mum turned 60 um, and he might get her one of these. Yeah, oh, oh that's beautiful that. too. That's a lovely gift, Ross. That'd be a really lovely gift. Yeah, I've got... Um, it, 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 <laughs> it's... It's... <laughs> <laughs> he goes back to Ross, is like, you have a moment of generosity and then you're like, hang on a minute, no, she's not getting a gift, she's having a baby. She's getting a... She's not having a, a baby. grandchild. Yeah, a grandchild. Um, that is the best gift in the world, I have to say. <laughs> it is, but you've still got to give her a gift on her 60th. Yeah, but I definitely would want jewellery as well. Yeah, that's as well as... I'll take the grandchild and the jewellery. And the jewellery, Ross. And the Ross. pendant, please. And the jewellery. 60 is a big deal. Yeah, and you want something to remember, you know, yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, absolutely. Right then, are we ready? Are we ready for your second deal of the day? Yep. We'll do it in exactly the same order. We've. I. Th I look at these and I think, gosh, they're quite Grecian. Yeah, they are. Do you think that? Yeah, there's something very unusual and designer. Very. Um, Artisan, yeah, very you know, like much so. artisanal, like somebody has made this, yeah. um, and they are an artist, and they have put this on it. Absolutely. Do you know what else I'm noticing? And I'm going to try my my absolute hardest to show you. Look, you know these are these are textured, so mm -hmm. you've they've got they've got that lovely almost like beaded texture yep. to the surface. Something very Van Cleef and Arpels. Very. And then these, by the way, are zircons. Yes, I noticed that. Are that. set inside. But can I just pivot it round and really, really, really absorb every single millimeter of these? They're so lovely. This, it's not just decorated on one side, it's decorated oh, throughout. all the way around. Yeah. And they basically screw in. Yeah, they do. The finest quality, if you think about big diamond earrings, you know, in my old job, we used to, I used to see a lot of diamond earrings yeah. solitaires. Yeah. And when they, again, something I would never afford, but the bigger the diamonds, generally speaking, You'd get screw in class, screw in butterfly backs as opposed to the ones that just push in. Oh, yeah, because you don't want to lose them. No, oh, can you imagine? You do not want to lose those. Look at these. And if you think about the um, 
Is it sh not Chanel? Uh, the bracelet, the love bracelet, the one when you get with the screwdriver. Oh, the Cartier. Cartier. Yeah. The Cartier. Um, love bangle. Love bangle. That's it. And you have, get a little screwdriver because mm -hmm. you don't t take it off nope. once you've put it on. No. So you could put these onto things that you left on all the time. Absolutely. You? Because you've screwed that in. Um, it adds a beautiful feature. Oh, it's a lovely story about the yeah. love bangle. Yeah, absolutely. So it takes two people to put them on. Yeah. It's really nice. They come. Yeah. Such a huge amount of sterling silver within these. Now. Um, these are so substantial, I'm going to say that there's more silver in the clasp than there is in that metre long length. Yeah, yeah so I can see that. So these are big pieces. And it's unusual, and I like unusual things in my jewellery that I'm not going to see other makers. So I asked you this question earlier on. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Not many people are going to be wearing mm. these. I asked you earlier on, how do I work this then? Do you bead directly onto or loop your chains, whatever it is? All of that. All of that? Any of that. You can... Um, you could even use it as you know if you've got your little microfaceted beads you could take the whole strand through and then back through your beading medium and knot or crimp so that you could take yeah just like that hang on so that also i thought while i was sitting looking at them as well that it'd be lovely for lariat yes that would be beautiful so you know think about when you're seed beading and you add on a clasp when you use your seed beads as a loop yeah think of it that way but with you know, something like this, these gorgeous strands here. Um, I'd want to use this, and also for bracelet, I'm thinking as well, you could use multi strands on it, couldn't you? You could do like, look at that, look at that, there it is. Oh my <gasps> goodness. And imagine. And then do the same on the other side. Do the same on the other side. Oh. Or if you're doing one of those very trendy ones where you have chain on one side and, yeah. you know, on the other, you know, it's completely up to you, but, or you could do it the other way. Like, yeah, you could do it. So, yes, yeah, so that it's it goes down like a horseshoe. Yeah, like that. Yes. How amazing are so these? So there's lots of different options with these, isn't yeah, there? Yeah, you there's can loop so onto much. a jump ring if you wanted to. If you look at the little screw thing there, there's a hole in it. Yeah. So you could attach um, I'm doing that your strand there. to the little hole as well that's yeah. in the little screw setting so that it's sat below your strand does yeah. that make sense there's so many different look options at the, look, look at the craftsmanship of that it's, it's like a, it's like a key isn't it i'm definitely getting one of these if there's any left I'm absolutely sure. gorgeous and they literally screw you can see me doing it there they screw undone you see how it's loose mm -hmm. at the top there so they're really 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 secure um, really secure class. Look at the investment of sterling silver that you've got within here. Yeah, and I love your idea of it almost being like a twist on the Cartier love bangle. Yeah, I like that. I'm not saying exactly the same, obviously, but um, but the fact that it does, you, you're probably going to need, if you're wearing it as a bracelet, you're probably going to need two people to do it. Not necessarily much in a necklace, but look at that. That is stunningly beautiful. I agree with you. I think I'm going to be getting some of these as well. Plus, you've got Cambodian Zircon set within. If you like the idea of using it with the topaz, these are coming up tomorrow. We're under £20, even though there's probably more. I don't know. If, I'm not Like I said, I, was, I wasn't there at the time. But I would imagine these are as involved in terms of their creation as the chain is yeah because you've got to make that really complicated little screw setting yeah so that screw you know with any screw that you use for anything it's got to go in and if it cross threads yeah it's no good no good so you know to be able to actually craft that from scratch love these. is a long long process absolutely love these now one thing i haven't asked how many have we got of each Ooh. 50 of the gold uh, and the rose gold, and then 200 of the silver. So we've got, oh, you could do multiple length chains, couldn't you, from these? Yeah, you could. I, would, I think I, I would use it as um, a lariat, or in some way I'd have it in the front of my bracelet or my necklace for sure. Can you pass me one of your masterclass boxes? I can. Can you reach it? There you go. Just because I also think leather would really work with this. Yeah, definitely. That would look so cool. It's that kind of um, high end. Yeah. Quite edgy. Cord jewellery, which you'll see people layer that with their, you know, their love bangles and their five gram bracelets and they will leather, they will actually do it as a bracelet stack as an arm party because it's a completely different look. But they'll do it with a lovely clasp or, you know, diamonds or zircons or, you know. Amazing. Whatever it may be. And then they... You know, because I'm I've, I've, my Pinterest board, I've got a Pinterest arm party board. So I love seeing people's stacks of what they put together. And quite a lot of people do that. Look, I mean, you might not agree with this, but 
I don't know. No, I like that. Just using it on a lark said not piece of leather. And then you could get, you know, we do the gemstones with the two millimetre holes and like the pearls. Yeah. You could then put the pearls on there and maybe a knot and another pearl and a knot. And look how high end that looks. That's so cool, isn't Even it? Even on its own. Yeah. Like without that. any other yeah. without any other So layer that with your, your bracelet stack or having it on its own and it's making a statement all Absolutely. On its own. Yeah. And these leather cords are coming up in the twelve o'clock hour as well, jewelry makers. These are flying. I'm holding the rose gold right now, but this on the screens is the gold. But again, it's gonna look absolutely beautiful. Imagine that on a bracelet. Yeah, it's gorgeous. I really think, yeah, cool. Because I'd want to look at it. Yeah, same. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Again, lots of you there. We're at fourteen pounds and ninety nine pence. We only had what, 50 of them, um, flying, absolutely flying out the door. If you want the leather, it's coming up in the in the 12 o'clock hours, so not too long to wait for those. And they do come with additional findings as well. Margaret and Jeanette, Catherine, Angela getting three, Rosita, Cynthia, um, amazing, well done to you. I've got Carol and London and Catherine, congratulations, Rosita, Patricia and London and Middlesex, all that glitters, Angela, Maker, Aisha. Uh, so many of you getting involved. I I love these clasps. I do. I, they're so unusual. I think as jewellery makers, we see a lot of the same things and different variations, and we rarely see something completely new or completely different that yep. we haven't seen anywhere else, and that's what we've got here. Totally. And the fact that it's beaded everywhere. Yes, yeah, beautiful. It's really uh, Completely beaded on the inside and on what could be the back. Okay, let's do the rose gold next. So if you like that look earlier on, I'll put that one there. So much potential in these. I like all of them. I can't pick a favourite. I really like all of them. That's good because they might have to pick us, you know, Debbie, because I think they will sell out. Yeah, I don't know if there'll be any. Wish list. Wish list it. You it never works. Know. Yeah. Absolutely. I used the wish list the other day on the uh, Mellow. You know, that Mellow ring. So did I. Did you get the ring? Yeah. So did I. Yes! <laughs> and it said sold out at first, I didn't know. it? Yeah, I got it too. I was Isn't it gorgeous? So, so is pretty. I. So pretty. <laughs> yeah, wish list works because people change their mind, maybe, or I don't know, payments don't go through, so our call centre can give you a call. Um, rose gold plated, 925 sterling silver. The detailing of this is absolutely exquisite. It's set with not just, you know, this set with zircon, not cubic zirconia, yeah. but even more than that, this is Cambodian zircon. Look at the quality of them. It looks like diamonds. Really does. We've got 50 available. You know where we're taking this to. No surprises here. People multi-buying as well. Lynn, Meath getting three. Sarah, well done in Buckinghamshire. Nottinghamshire's getting three. Mary, another Nottinghamshire. Hiya, Mary. Devon's multi-buying. Anne in Pembrokeshire. Renfusha and Susan and Lynn and Cheshire and Samantha and London. New customer and new customer. Lots of new customers getting involved on this as well. Yeah, I'm not surprised. What about, what about... Because you said about lariats, hmm. you could almost use these to kind of shorten the length of your necklace, couldn't you? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, because you could... Um, like a hook. Yeah, and you know that where you take it through the front? Yeah. Like you could do that if you had like a larger... And if you think that this could take a strand of gems to the next level, just yeah. a strand of gems. Yeah, totally agree. Because what you did there with the zircon, is it zircon that yeah. you did it with? Yeah, uh, topaz. Topaz, rather. Um, look at how amazing that looked all of a sudden. Yeah. And it's, it, it goes back to what we were saying about your tanzanite earlier on. Mm. You know, there's nothing wrong with that tanzanite on a bolt ring class. No. However, tanzanite on one of these. Next level. Is a different level. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Okay. Out of the 200, 77 have already confirmed okay. on pre-order. So, well done. Don't wait. You know, um, dial through as quickly as you possibly can. We're not going to dilly-dally either because we know you want, you want them. We've got 200 of these as well. I love the fact that Debbie has kind of likened it to the Cartier Love Bangle because it has got that kind of screw-like mechanism. If I turn it, there we go. If I turn it in that direction, you can actually see. So, yeah, can you see how you screw it to... That's tightening, I think. Yeah, so yeah. I've just tightened it up there. And righty-tighty, lefty-loosey. Here we go. And that's loosening, loosening it just there. And you've got such a good amount of space there in that gap yeah. that you could actually, like we said before, have a circle of gemstones uh, instead of a jump ring and you'd get it in there, whereas usually you couldn't because you wouldn't have a large enough gap. Does no. that make sense? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. absolutely. Mm. Yeah, with a normal like sort of bolt ring or something like that, there's no in there's here no enough way. space. No. Um, I absolutely adore these. I think they're stunning. 
So good luck, everybody, at £14.99. That's where we've closed the... And there is more silver in this than there is in, um, than there is in the chains that we had a few moments ago. 2.32 grams of solid That's, sterling silver. It is, it's a weighty piece, isn't it? And the zircon, let's yeah. not forget that. Um, we are not even stopping there. We are loving these clasps. I think they're absolutely beautiful. 200 available. Almost 100 have just confirmed, so well done. And that's because I'm looking at the call screen seeing twos, threes, fours and fives. We are going lower on this occasion. So it is, uh, again, it's one of those that you, there's nothing wrong with your more traditional class, you no. know, sort of your fairly generic toggles or bolt rings or lobster claws or triggers. No, nope. do you remember them? Trigger class. Yeah, yeah, I still, do. Um, I still use those. But when you are looking for that something special, Something different, and I say, you know, a lot of our jewelry makers' audience are very loyal. They've been with this for years, yeah. And you know, we've seen what we've seen. It doesn't mean we don't like it. We love it, but then we see something different, and we're like, yeah. "Wow, I've not seen that anywhere else." It's not like I've seen that somewhere else, and now we've got it. I've not seen this anywhere. No, else. no, I haven't either. And it takes me back to the toggle class conversation that we had earlier on this morning. You know, this is the kind of class that I would wear as a feature. Yes, I would have it on view. Hundred percent. You know, like the Mulberries, Christian Dior's, etc. Exactly. This would be at the front, wouldn't it? It'd be Definitely. the centerpiece. Yeah, loving that. Can you imagine, almost like with toggle class vibe? Vibes. Mm. I know it won't. It's not a toggle, mm. so it's still using the pin. But can you imagine a necklace? Like if I hold it like this. So imagine you've got. Um, no, hold it that way. So imagine you've got big Baroque pearls or something. Uh, like oh that, yeah, I was just thinking pearls. that myself. And one big yeah. fireball pearl yeah. that you actually anchor onto. Yeah, and that's that the class. How amazing would that be? And then also, when if you do that, then you can do it up where you want. Yes. Between the pearls. So you might want to have like a choker and then them hanging down, or you might want that, you know. So, yes, that's no the other, opportunity. No other bit of sterling silver on the end. No. You could almost complete it with a knot, couldn't you? Exactly. Um, or a little little topaz or something Or you could like have that. a charm or a, yeah. a, a waterfall But you design. just anchor that onto the end yeah, pearl. Absolutely or not, stunning. if you want it longer. Yeah. How beautiful would that be? I'm loving I that want idea. some of these now all the more now. We're at £11.99. 107 of these have already gone. Loads of you on the phone lines. We did have a bigger quantity of these, though. Oh, let's do it. In for a penny, in for a pound. It's Christmas yeah, let's in July. Do it. Let's I've got a turkey it. on my head. Why not? <laughs> in a minute, we're going to take it under £10. We want you to capitalise and make the most of it. Because this is so giftable for Christmas, isn't it? Oh, and I know the, the makes that you're going to make. Oh. I mean, oh, I just... I want to make joy for myself with these. Yeah. Well, your Christmas is a present to yourself. Do you gift it to yourself? You know what I do sometimes is, well, you know, we used to do the mystery bags. I'd get a mystery bag for myself and put it under the tree. Nice. Um, I would more likely make something for myself, like make a piece of jewellery for myself. Yeah. Um, yeah, but I do that all the time because I, people go, well, you don't want jewellery, but I do, I love jewellery. Yeah, why do they do that? My husband does that too. Oh, well, you won't want jewellery. Well, the last thing you... I'm going to buy you is jewellery. No. Well, no. That, that should be the first thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, my husband says that to me as well. My bottom lip will come out. I get the challenge for them, though. They think it's we're harder to buy. For Absolutely, them. but I, I love jewellery. That's why I make it. Yes, so it doesn't stop me wanting to buy it or have it bought for me. Absolutely. Well, I tell you what, if you are thinking Christmas birthdays and for yourself, of course, we're going <laughs> under £10. This is unplanned, completely unplanned. We should have held this at the same price as the previous ones either as well. Just beautiful craftsmanship within this. And like I said, there's nothing wrong with your traditional get two. at all. <laughs> yes. I would definitely, if I was going to get one, I would get two now. People are getting fives. I'm not surprised. People going back in and getting more. Yeah. I don't blame you at all because there's just when you're looking for that something extra special, like again, going back to the mulberry design mm. that we saw earlier on. And I know that was a toggle. Mm. I know it was, but you know, it was, that was the main star, wasn't it? It was. The star of the show was actually the clasp. It wasn't necessarily, because it was like a fairly chunky chain that sort of drew our eye towards a the real, pearl. Yeah, a real kind of. Uh, you know, when you say you do a design and it draws your eye. Yeah. Well, this clasp is going to draw your eye. Totally. Totally agree. We're at £9.99. Nottingham's got four. Virginia's got three. Virgi another. Susan's got three. Sorry. Ray's got two. Patricia's got two. Pat's got two. Paula's got three. Maker in Sussex got two. Christine's got two. Deborah in Shropshire's got three. Staffordshire's got two. We've got five's been purchased. You've disappeared off the bottom of the screen as well. Rosita's just got two. Merseyside, well done to you. Pauline, Pat, Donna... 
well done to you, Belinda and Ray and Susan and Helen and Patricia uh, and Deborah and Staffordshire and Jeanette. I can't keep up with you, Sussex and Cheryl and Paula and Jackie and Catherine and Andrew and Pearl and Maker and Anne. There's loads of you there. We're on four rows of names. We had 200. We're going to put a 60 second clock on your screen and that's to close this auction and ultimately this hour. Make sure you are checking out your baskets because, um, yeah, they're limited now. Um, have a little look. You can always wish list items. You can add the chain in silver. There's just a couple of those left if you are okay. thinking about the long line necklaces or multi-strand necklaces. That will work. Um, the gold still sold out. I think there's just a couple of the rose gold. Um, so you can do that. Um, I don't know about these clasps, but they've absolutely flown out the door. So there's the length of the chain that we brought you as your deal of the day. Seriously, you can get the one meter length of chain and the matching clasp, which is encrusted with zircon. Mm -hmm for less than 30 pounds. That is an amazing deal. Yeah, really What a gorgeous is. piece of jewelry. All that silver, four grams. Oh, four and then grams. get those, um, I keep saying zircons. Are they zircons? Topaz. Topaz. Get the topaz tomorrow and then just hang the topaz off the chain. Oh, oh wow, so beautiful. Hello. <laughs> yeah, yes please. Um, make sure you check it out everybody. Congratulations to you all. Stay where you are on those phone lines everybody and good luck. Now, still to come, we have got the most amazing jadeite pieces. Now, if you've always admired the master carvings, but maybe you've not made that purchase because you're thinking, well, I don't know how to wire work. I don't know how to do gallery wire. Um, or like maybe you've watched before, but you're just not inclined yeah. to work with sterling silver. Then we've basically set a small amount of each of these into beautiful precious metal. So all you need to do is literally suspend them from a chain or a cord, whatever you wish. These are sheer perfection. They're gorgeous. And I'm shopping along with you in the next hour as well. Don't go anywhere. Still got Debbie's masterclass to come as well. We'll be back after this. <laughs> Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, this Saturday's deal of the day, we have been listening. You've been shouting out for all of your essentials, haven't you? You've been messaging into the studio. You've been shouting to us saying, we need our essentials. Well, we listened and at 10 o'clock, we have Ross's stash grab. I have the list, which include your featherweight head pins, your lever bat shepherd hooks, your finding wire end tips, and so much more. So if you're desperate for your essentials, it's this Saturday's deal of the day. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street, and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. 
Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Oh, I just went to the toilet in the break. Not that you need to know that, but what you do need to know is that when you walk out of the cubicle like this and everyone in the loo looks at you like, Okay, but doesn't make reference to it, just smiles. <laughs> just nods. Just nods. It's just Debbie, jewellery maker. Just Debbie with a know. Christmas hat and Christmas earrings on. Yeah, yeah, it's okay. Um, <laughs> it does make me <laughs> chuckle, actually, and I also think, God, how wonderful, though, that... Because one of the things that I used to hate about the jewellers that I worked at when I first oh. started, and bearing in mind I'm, I'm in my early 20s, mm. was just how intimidating it was. I still won't go into those ones with the yeah. security. My mum used to love to go in. She didn't care. And she'd ask to try everything on. You know, 20 grand I'm read, I'll try that on. She'd go into Harrods to the department yeah. and just... She, it didn't phase her. But me, I feel like, oh... It, it, no, know. I never felt like I belonged, No, to me be too. Honest. I yeah, don't feel like... I felt like I belonged there because it was. It was very intimidating. And also... Saying all, but I can remember like a, there were some very imposing characters yeah. that used to kind of go like, yeah, well, you know, you're never gonna, you're never gonna afford something like that. And in my head, I thought the same. So, mm. um, anyway, it just it, that's what I really love about Jewelry Maker is we take that level of luxury, but we take the stuffiness out of it. <laughs> yeah, we do. We certainly do. You know, you out of <laughs> can, can, can I, uh, the stuffing, yeah. Can you, um, I, I, I think back and I'm chuckling to myself right now. If I'd have turned up to work, stood behind Cartier uh, uh, and, and had your Bulgaris and everything with a turkey on my head. I think you'd have sold more. Probably, <laughs> probably would have done. They just needed to chill out a little bit. Anyway, so I love that about Jewelry Maker. We can make that level of luxury accessible. Um, we can. And I hope that never, never changes. Um, now... Taipei Jade, as you know, we have members of the team in China as we speak who are meeting with one of the most influential individuals in the Jadeite world, Mr. Liu. And you know that we were bringing some close out deals so that that team can, uh, Dave in particular, uh, can go and hopefully buy more. Now, we haven't heard back yet directly about, well, you might have done if you've been following our social media. Um, but I don't think we've had anything concrete okay. about what what has been purchased are they there now they are there now oh exciting coming to the end of the trip now okay. though as well um so what they have actually purchased but we took they took money over in the hope now if you remember in the those of you that are regular to jewelry maker will have seen that what we refer to as the million dollar window of jade so in, in hong kong on another trip that dave took he saw a window uh high-end jewelers that exclusively sold jade, and it was millions upon millions of dollars across. There was carvings, there was pendants, there was necklaces, but yeah, millions of pounds. I think genuinely what Debbie you have created here would not look out of place in amongst those pieces. Well, I, you know, I've put them all on, um, on cord, 
But also, I think with something like this, I would definitely put it on my strand of pearls. Pearls, absolutely. Rosary link. Chain. Chain. You know, you can do anything. I mean, they're just gorgeous. Well, uh, you know, I've bought some of these along the journey as well. I've bought some of the carvings as well. Yeah, I've got too. some of them, I'll be honest, that are, are, in, are in a drawer mm. set for safekeeping. Mm. Um, because I don't feel confident that I would be able to create something like this. I know even if I tried, it wouldn't end up, up looking like this. Yes. So that w that's probably my hesitation. Um, but if you're one of those people like me that doesn't know quite know what to do with these master carvings, you can knock directly onto it if you wanted to, but you will feel like they should be framed like a work of art in a gallery. Then we've taken a small collection of our favorite type A jadeite carvings that have been on air, by the way. So okay. these carvings have actually physically been on air. We've taken a small collection and actually take it and sent it to our jewelry workshop for them to set them for you. So if you are thinking, Oh, OK, OK, that's a game changer for me because I can just feed them directly onto a sterling silver chain. I prefer th them like this. Me too. And also the different styles, I've had a really close look at them. There's something for everyone, like the one we're looking at now. It's got this lovely minimalist like vine effect like yeah, it's great beautiful. it's like an extension of the design that's cut gonna, into the do you the notice jade. how they've taken the design how and they've actually clever. looked at that yeah they've looked at that so um because they are all very limited and the designs are very very different what we're going to do is put each of those designs on pre-order oh, and if yeah. there's one you want me to bring to air then drop us a message into the studio and we'll do that we'll do it at, yeah at and then time. you can have a really good look then can't you yeah so if you have a look at this in color magazine in color magazine talking oh, about you know they're showing their the, the, a, a carving of a beautiful um buddha and obviously that's imperial green obviously. i don't like that as much as ours no it's a bit yeah it's very bright, isn't it? It's very, very, very bright. And that's scary. probably photoshopped beyond all yeah, imagination true. as well. Um, but I don't know that for sure. But it's in a mount, isn't it? Yeah. It's not just the carving. No, no. Like that one that we saw back in 2021, I think it yeah. was, maybe, when we went to Tucson and I, we saw the Buddha carving, which sold and then got mounted, didn't it? So oh, right. There it was individually. Oh, I see. Yep. And then a jeweller obviously purchased it and mounted it into the 18 karat gold. You don't often see them without the frame. Uh, you don't go into an art gallery and look at, name a work of art. What's your favourite work of art? Uh, anything by Monet. Monet, okay. You don't see a Monet painting without a frame. No, you don't. It's the same as works of art and gemstones. And, you know, they're not all the same. Like, they haven't all got sort of copious amounts of, of gemstones set into them. Some have, some haven't. What I like about this is that there's something for everybody's taste. So if you like just a little bit of precious metal around the outside, there's something for you. If you like something a little bit more glamorous, there's something for you. 100%. It's not, they're not all the same, but in just different shapes. Shall we, shall we take a moment to look at each and every single one of these? Because they are limited, super limited. And that also tells me that very, very, very few people will have the same piece as you. So you can almost choose if they if you need to make a choice between them um which is your favorite so this is one of the large spherical uh ones you can see with the um and these are all hand carved these have actually been on our screens previously before but a small proportion we took out to actually go to our workshop um to actually have them set uh then you've got this one with that lovely marquee oh, I adore love that. that it's lovely yeah that drop shape is so flattering yeah Got, imagine those in earrings. Earrings, if you want to elongate your neck. Yeah. You know, this is just a beautiful design. And, and Debbie, you've put them on the leather cord that's coming up in the master class. So, but you, I've also got a length, uh, a chain here to show you them on the chain. Look at that. That's absolutely beautiful. And they're all so different, aren't they? And so clever how the design has not, uh, the mount has not overpowered the design, yeah. in my opinion. Yeah. Um, so you've got that lovely little bit of sparkle there, but you can still perfectly see that amazing carving actually on the jade itself. Yeah, and it is framing, isn't it? Like the, oh, the work gorgeous. of art that it is. Um, moving on to, oh, that, oh my goodness, first time we're seeing that one. That one's lovely. I mean, if you pop along to somewhere like, I don't know where, GIA, Jadeite, large, carved pendant it's unavailable 
Five, over £5,000, meaning it's sold. But look how simple that, that setting is. Really simple. Mm. Again. I like that. I like that one. £9,000. Yeah, they're lovely, aren't they? £9,000. The fact is they're framed. They're in amount, aren't they? Yeah, and it makes it makes the jade pop. Yeah, it does. It? I love the fact you've got little diamonds set within the piercings mm. of the jade as well. Oh, that's lovely. Uh, wow. Oh, yeah. Incredible. Look at the price, though. £14,000. Again, framed, set. Yeah, you can get jade, obviously, cord, with cord, but... Often they'll have the precious metal there as well, won't they? Yes, definitely. Often they will. That's incredible. And actually very... I know it's a different colour, but um, very similar to the designs that we're actually bringing you right now. It really now. is. And I think if you put it on cord, it gives you more contemporary feel yeah. uh, rather than a luxurious feel. So that if you put it on cord, you can really give something a bit different. But if you want one of the more luxurious ones... Pop it on a lovely chain, pop it on a string of pearls, on a Beautiful. string of anything, really. Jade, a string yeah. of jade. Um, I'm going to ask Roscoe, Ross, how many do we have of each of these approximately? Ooh. Less than 20 of each. And in fact, the first one, there's less than 10. So you will need to be quick if you are. Oh, that's beautiful. Uh, like if, if you see what you love and it's pulled on those heartstrings, they're available on pre-order, but you will need to be quick. Um, whether you feed them onto leather, which is very traditional, whether you feed it onto chain, whichever it is, whichever you prefer, but these are framed beautifully. Now I'm going to start with potentially the biggest that we have. Um, and I tell you what I'm going to do, if I can... If I can, typically, I've picked up a chain with the largest drop on the bottom. OK. Um, I'm going to demo with this one because it's you? got a really interesting bale. Yeah, it's got... Well, look at that. That you can um, do... So I've got a few ideas about how you could you could hang that. Look at that. Look at it. Whoa. Also, look how gemmy... If I move my hand away, look how gemmy that jade is. If I, can you see? Look at that beautiful translucency. A big gram weight. I'll show you all the way around. Big gram weight of solid sterling silver. This wonderful case. There's loads of silver in that. Yeah, and it's going to sit that far off the decolletage. Yeah, it's going to let the light in. Let the light in, yeah. absolutely. That's why you often see this kind of almost window within the sterling silver. Again, um, it, uh, encrusted. You've got a beautiful amount of sterling silver. That's topaz, by the way. Obviously, we're not using cubic zirconia no. with something as rare as type A jade. I, um, again, if, if like if like me, if like me, you have you, you've always thought I love these, but I don't feel like I could do the gallery wire or the bezel setting or the bead bezeling, whichever it might be. And maybe they've just gone into a drawer um, and not seen the light of day. But they're they're there and they're precious and they're absolutely True. still incredibly incredibly valuable. But if you want to be able to wear them, then here is your chance. It's very much like a spinachy, or they refer to it as oil green um, in the jadeite world. There's less than 10 of these available. In fact, there's eight. And here, our first price, £1,999. I don't think any of us would think that's unrealistic. Look at it up at the neckline. I mean, come it's on. It's a huge. Stunning. Yeah, it's a statement piece. It's beautiful. Look at the quality. It, 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 dare I say this, but it looks better than some of those that you just showed. On bottoms. That were like 15 grand yeah, or whatever. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, agree. would you know the difference? No. I mean, it, it's just Wow. I've seen pieces on Christie's and Bottoms, Sotheby's, First Dibs, etc., without so much as a, an ounce of, of, of precious metal or any accenting gemstones for considerably more than what's on our screens right now. Mm. Straight away, one of these have gone. Congratulations to you, Anne. They are absolutely exquisite. Michael, can, can I get one of the different chains? Because that one I didn't realise has got a big drop on the bottom. Um, so, yeah, because I, I, Debbie's shown you with the leather. They look absolutely amazing with the leather, but they'll also look incredible on the precious metal also. You know, pop along to Aspreys. Here we go. Aspray, Art Deco, Jade and Diamond Box Pendant. Um, you can see the sizes there, 45 millimetres by 25 millimetres with a cushioned diamond at the top. Um, yeah, I mean, you can see just one simple, one simple, simple bale. Let's get this into three figures. And I'm going to tell you, and I'm going to tell you that we are not even 
stopping there. There's five of them available. They're already going. Well done. Five of them available. All you need to do is drop it onto a chain or cord or maybe maybe macrame um, of choice and away you go. Everybody pays this final low price tag. Also know that you are one of eight people that actually have this piece. Look how lovely oh, that is. That. Oh, it's beautiful. <laughs> it's incredible. You can almost take me seriously, can't you? Even with the turkey on your Even head. with the turkey on my head. Good luck, everybody. Make sure you're checking out. We're at £249 only. Just three of them left. Three of them left within the vault. Um, well, that's... Yeah, we had eight. We commissioned eight in the world. I mean, it's so exclusive. Uh, £62.25 and pence on your 0% interest split payment as well. Anne in Cardiff, amazing. Shirley in Hertfordshire, amazing. London, congratulations to you. When we talk about legacies, and this as well, if I was to, if I was to hand my husband, say, or my children a type A jadeite carving, mm. um, and I've hope, hopefully educated them, but I don't think they'd really appreciate its value without seeing it as a piece of jewellery like agree, this. Agree, agree. Do you agree where I'm coming yeah. from? From. And I think, you know, something like this on its own is just incredible. But I think it makes it quite unisex by putting it on the leather. Um, it also makes it quite contemporary. Mm -hmm. uh, so, again, you can check whatever you put it on is going to change the whole mood of the piece, isn't yeah. it? Whether it's got more sparkle or less. Yeah, absolutely. Whatever chain. <sighs> oh, OK. Right, sorry. Let's go into the donut, shall we? Oh, there it is, just there. Debbie, you've, you've attached it to the purple core, which is just absolutely beautiful. This is super, super, super limited. So you can put either side, that's sterling silver beads with large holes, but you can put a, a pearl with a large hole or a yeah. jadeite, another jadeite yeah. beads, or maybe you've got a string of jadeite that you want to rosary link and then pop that on. Uh, there's so many different looks that you can get. I mean, that's stunning on the chain as it oh, is. Oh, I love it? this one. This might, this might be one of my favorites. That's absolutely gorgeous. And also, you know, when we had the spinners, you know, the jadeite spinners, which mm -hmm. are quite big carrot weights. Yep. And then you bought, you had to buy the sterling silver mount. That's right. Afterwards. That was a hundred pounds. Yeah, I was on that show. I yeah. remember you doing it. The mount was a hundred pounds because there was a huge amount of sterling silver, you know, these are good to go. All you need to do is attach it to a sterling silver chain or, or leather, whichever it is. I love that. I love that little little detail at the bottom there. Can you see with that flourish? These are encrusted with zircon. Topaz, I beg your pardon. So you've got pure, brilliant topaz haloing all the way around. That's a full halo of topaz set in 14 grams of solid 925 sterling silver, 30 carats of your beautiful type A jadeite. How many do we have available in the world? 12 available in the world. That's it. That's all we commissioned. It was an entirely exclusive collection. 12, that's it. 49 pounds and 75 pence. Yeah, it makes me think back to the sterling silver spinners, which were lovely, by the way. They were. But um, they, they, it wasn't the Chantilly that we used with those, because obviously you needed a drill hole through the centre. But also it was 100 pounds just for the silver. Yeah, it was. Just for the silver. I like the carving on this one. It's really intricate. If you, if you look at it closely, how they do it blows my mind. I know, it's I mean, incredible. the artistry involved in these patterns and how they've done it, that in itself, for me, sells the whole piece. All done by hand. Yeah, and, you know, this amazing skill that's been passed down from generation to generation that only a handful of people can do, that sells it to me. Yeah, absolutely. 100%. There's five of them left. Good luck and well, huge congratulations um, to every single one of you that manages to secure yours. If that was in, if that was in... I don't know, Hatton Garden. It is not going to be anywhere near three figures, and it certainly isn't going to be offered to you on split payment either. Um, the final four, I've just, I've just thought of something. Imagine this maybe alongside your bundle that's coming up in, uh, tomorrow at nine with the topaz. 
Just suspending it from the topaz. See how you've got a completely different look straight away. Yeah. There's so many. I know it's seen as a ready-made pendant, but there's so many different things that you can do to make it your own. Absolutely, make it unique. Morag, Lancashire, Maker, Gillian, uh, Mary in Cambridgeshire, Kathleen, Michelle in London. I've got multi-buyers. The final two. Loads of you have that in your baskets. We can't go any lower. Um, hello to you. Oh, it's lovely, Mark. Hello, lovelies. I was escorted out of Harrods once. <laughs> My T-shirt <laughs> sleeves were too short. Never been back. I'll see you Sunday. See you on Sunday. Mark, how That's, very dare they? How rude. Do they know who you are? No, did you say that? How rude. Do you think they'd throw us out if we went Probably. like this? Probably. Look. Oi, turkey, out. I take it as a compliment. <laughs> how rude, Mark. Like, so? Your shirt sleeves were too short. How pompous. Rude. Sorry. Yeah, really pompous. Rude. I don't blame you for not going back either. Mind you, haven't said that I've been escorted out of a jeweler's before. <coughs> because they knew I was price comparing. Uh... They knew I worked for, for, for Gemporia at the time. And they knew, they were like, know what you're doing. Off you pop. Okay. That was the polite version. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. Check out your baskets. These are so, so, so limited. There were 12 of those ever commissioned. Ever, ever, ever commissioned. Unbelievable, Harrods. Goodness me. Do you just think just need to chill out a little bit? Yes, because, you know, millionaires don't walk around all the time looking like millionaires. No. You know, people walk around just looking normal. Like, you know, they're just some people have got more money than others. So how can you tell whether some you should throw someone out or not? Well, do you think for one second, like, think of, I don't know, uh, oh, I think of a millionaire celebrity. Yeah, does he only wear long sleeves? <laughs> Jay-Z, would they escort Jay-Z out? Yeah, for, for having, like, short, short sleeves. They wouldn't. Rude. You know. <laughs> and, Mark, you're the Jay-Z of jewellery maker, aren't you? They're uh, lost. They're lost. They're lost, indeed. Indeed, how rude. Right, then, should we move on? I love this, the oval one. I think there's a lot of you choosing this one. Um, well, I say a lot. There isn't many available in the world, to be honest. And you know what? Uh, um, you go into Harrods and you can have a look at the jewellery, but it's, a, it's a huge margins on Harrods jewellery. Oh, I mean, yeah. Something like this. You're not going to see it in a triple figure price point. Um, good luck to you all. I've only, this is the only oval that we have, so this mm. is... It, it's got this real like, Victorian yes. appearance to it, I it think. It reminds me of, like, a cameo or something yeah. like that. That's beautiful. Absolutely. And it is hand-carved in the same way that cameos would be. Very classic. I love the positioning of the prongs on this as Agree. well and the detailing, the contrast between this and the actual topaz. It almost looks like a locket. Yeah. Doesn't it? Yeah, it does. How many do we have available? Eleven available in the world. Um, bringing it to you at £699, that would be unbelievable. It's be you look at that Jemmy translucency. You know, the frame aside, you know, you've got that beautiful translucency, 11 grams of solid 925 sterling silver with your zircon. Is it zircon or topaz? Topaz, they're all topaz. Okay, amazing. There are 11 available in the world, and that is in the world. £199 only to get hold of these. I love it on the leather. Yeah, that looks cool. It's very different look, isn't it? It just shows you what you can do with one pendant. Like that has immediately become uh, a bit edgier, yeah. you know, and maybe you don't want it to look so bling. You want it to... But the wonderful thing is you can just take it off. If you get sick of the leather, just take it off and put it on a chain. You know, there's a lot of, it is interchangeable. You know, or you get a lovely strand of pearls and you think, oh, I'm going to put that on. I do that all the time in my jewelry. Yeah, well, uh, the chain I'm actually suspending each of these from, it's one chain and I'm just literally taking the pendant off, putting it back on. So they are interchangeable. You've got a nice space in that in that bale to be able to do that. Yeah. There are 11 of these available in the world, £49.79. And obviously you can create around it. You know, it means that you don't have to buy the bale. It means you don't have to buy the mount and the jade separate. Uh, make sure you are checking out those baskets, everybody. So yeah, you, 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 normally this is like what we strive to achieve, isn't it? Mm, definitely. Um, the end result. Shall we do? Yeah. Okay. This is lovely. Ah! Oh! Hang on. Look at that bale. 
Oh, it's gorgeous. There are nine of these available. You've got a nice open bail so that you can put chain or cord or whatever you want through it. This is the only rectangle that we have. And this is your beautiful oil green. How amazing is that? Oh, I can't choose. That's pretty amazing. I prefer too, ours. I'm, that's just my personal opinion. I definitely think the carving is significantly better. Yeah, I Significantly mean, what better. What is that carving? I, mean, I don't know. I reckon I could have had a go at doing that. Yeah, the carving is far, <laughs> Michael's far, far. No, you couldn't. <laughs> you think you could, Deb, but you couldn't. But like, look at ours. Look at the intricacy of ours. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? And I'm showing it against a white, uh, a black background. So look at it's that, all the little... The colour. It looks like it's growing in there. Oh, it's gorgeous. Loving this one. There are how many of these available? Nine available in the world. Again, the exclusivity of that. Um... Yeah, you can pay £14,000 if you want to go pop along to what is probably first dibs. Yeah, there's gold it's not, and, and there's diamonds in there, but for, that doesn't justify fourteen grand, does it? Ooh. It's about the framing of that amazing work of art. And that's why we took the inclination to do exactly the same, because it was like, OK, not everybody knows how to do wire work, gallery wire, bezel setting. Um, yeah, this is done for them, and you can sort of carry on jewellery making in and around that beautiful frame. Um, OK, let's do the pair. Um, this is beautiful. I'm I just going to hold it like one. so. Now, we're showcasing all of these pieces. You can go ahead and confirm, safe in the knowledge that we will bring them to you at the most unbelievable price point. They are all available on pre-order. That's beautiful, isn't it? It's so simple and the silver work has mirrored the carving and it just kind of continues into that beautiful silver work. I think this is my favourite. Yeah, do you know what? I think it might be one of mine. Mm. It's hard because... To be honest, I'm, go I'm not going to be disappointed if I get any of them, to be honest, but this is lovely, isn't it? Oh, it's it? gorgeous. This is very, something very floral in this, and I'm just going to grab my tweezers for a second so you can see, really appreciate the clasp itself as well. We're going to go straight down to that prize point, almost like a vine, like a clematis or something has wrapped itself around. Um, £49.75 pence only. Ah, oh, Debbie. So you get a completely different look if you put it on the cord there. It's really nice on the cord, isn't it? I like the I light love cord with that. Um, your cord, oh, and, you? cord yeah. and jade art is quite common, yeah. I just think that gives you, you know, you almost don't see it. You're just looking at the pen. And we even have, with your masterclass, by the way, we even have the ends so you can complete that finished if piece I move of jewellery. So if you're thinking about making this, yeah, you've got the actual ends to do that. That echoes the oh, silver does. work on the on the pendant because they're quite ornate. These little these little end caps are really lovely. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. A lot of collectors there getting involved, loving this one. Um, we've only got a couple of these. We haven't got many available. They're all very exclusive. And like I said, um, giving you the potential and opportunity. Do you actually use it just on a chain directly or do you not with it? Go on to jewelry, make with it even further. Um, okay, let's now do... <gasps> There's two of those. Is it one with a gem in the, in the bale or one without? This is incredible. Absolutely incredible. I'm going to put it on the chain. Oh, my goodness. I'm shopping with you on this one. It's absolutely beautiful. But, again, just to highlight the exclusivity. Now, with this setting, and you can see it's just a halo of your topaz all the way around. Love this. It's I can't decide. No, I know. And it, the carving on this is just amazing and again you know our studio honestly doesn't do these justice no. not because of the, the intense lights I had a really good look at them this morning and there that's it I put that one on on leather and the intricacy of the mm. pattern on this one really struck me but can, you know if, if you've got that in your mind I couldn't make that there's no way I could make that. No, 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 no. no. The full halo of topaz. No, me neither. I mean, I'd you know be there forever. I'd just be so fiddly, I'd give up. Yeah. I mean, you're, you're talking serious gem setting there. Absolutely. I mean, I've put um, some sterling silver spaces either side of that. It would look different again, just as the bale on the leather. So yep. again, you've got all of these options to make it your own. Nuala, you're there. Brenda, Debbie, amazing. I can see. I love it. 
I couldn't make it. I could not do that. I've got the, I've got marquees. Mm -hmm. I'd love them to be like this because then yeah. I'd be wearing them all the yeah. time. Tell you what, we can see you there. We commissioned how many? 15 available. And for that reason, we're going to take it low. Extra low. We're at £199 for the same type A grade that we've been showing you mm -hmm. elsewhere. All right, obviously different colours. These are hand carved, so they're going um, I actually think these are better carved than some of the ones I've actually seen photographed. Me too. And here we are. For the first time we've ever commissioned and framed them in 925 sterling silver with your topaz. And the reasoning for that is because your master carvings, feedback from our audience has... I, I can't I can't set them. I don't know what to do with them. Yeah. You can just literally put a loop loop of cord through, but if that's not your style, then we're obviously restricting, aren't we? Yeah. But you have to take it to a jeweller's then and yes. then the added cost. Then that's a, you know, it's an expense. Yeah. If like me you can't do this, then it's just looping it onto a chain or maybe knotting from that. You can still do your jewellery yeah. making. But it's obviously taking the sort of gem setting side of things out of it. Good luck to every single one of you. We had 15 available of this one. Oh, goodness me. Oh, £37.25 pence on split payment. That's unbelievable. And that's no interest, isn't it? No interest, yeah. So you can, it just gives you the opportunity to pay it in instalments, which I think is so much easier. <sighs> that's my niece's 18th birthday this summer. I think that would be a lovely 18th birthday oh, for her. Yes. And she's she's... It's not she too, liked jewelry. But yeah, 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 and she's she collects crystals as she calls it. Oh, well, there it. you go then. So how perfect would this be as an 18th perfect. birthday present? Perfect. I can imagine her wearing it too. At 149 pounds only, there are three of them left. It would be appropriate, absolutely, as well for a 60th birthday present, Roscoe. There you go. Are you design? Are you choosing between? Maybe the next one. I don't know. I think maybe the quantity might be what decides if there's any of them left. Well done, everybody. Down to the final one. It's stunning, isn't it? Absolutely stunning. Good luck. Good luck. Now, I've got one more marquise to bring you. And it's all down to, you know, what you prefer. Do you prefer there to be a halo of gemstones all the way around? Or would you prefer there to be one big statement round brilliant cut topaz? at the top and it is a big round brilliant cut on this one so bear with me that's why i like like it because like i said before you've got the different tastes catered for yeah you know, if you wanted something Oops. with a few more topaz in if you want something with less um you've basically got got it um, have i done this one i must have, have you had this one yeah i must is it here somewhere here we go no oh maybe i didn't have that one then no probs where have I got it here now? I can show you now. I'm doing that live on air, just dropping the chain through the centre so you know that you can do it with your chains already in your stash. <gasps> oh, that's very elegant. That one's elegant, very elegant. It does look a bit Lord of the Rings. Absolutely. You could almost imagine that in like a on your forehead or something like that. Yeah, you could like a um like an elf. Yes. Like some mythical creature. Yeah. Kate Blanchett wearing this, I can oh, imagine. Oh, on the red carpet. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. We're going even lower. How many did we commission of these? How many did we... Okay. 11 available. Good luck, everybody. It's natural, type A, pure, uh, gemmy jadeite, framed in a huge amount of sterling silver, with your lovely topaz and a round brilliant cut. I mean, look at that, that on its own, the, you know, the, the, the bale itself on its own. Sorry, I'm moving it around. You know, this part here on its own. If you found that in the jewelers elsewhere, it's... Have we got, have I got the wrong one? Should be which? Okay, that's all right. It's very similar. Let's go off that then. Yeah, so mine is slightly different. Oh, I think I prefer that one anyway. Okay, perfect. Let's start the clock. The, yeah, okay, let's, let's start the clock. These will be great, absolutely amazing with your Topaz bundle um, that are coming up at nine o'clock tomorrow as well. We've got, did you say 11? 
11 available. There's nine and a half grams of sterling silver. There's a lot of uh, there's a lot of work that's gone into those bales. I mean, a lot of work. I love the fact that you've got a gemstone set in. I think it lends itself to that rather than you know a glass or a fake anything. You know, yeah. It's, it, I think it deserves to have that. Um, topaz in there it's just beautiful well i think most of us wouldn't be able to do that no and you know unless you've got you know you are a f fully, fully fledged yeah. yeah i mean i that would take me weeks yeah and lots of mistakes and lots of swearing oh, 100 percent, and it's 149 pounds that's amazing that's really, really that's good. the difference and we know you, you can still jewelry make around yeah. these obviously yeah, yeah, yeah. you can still you know not or or, or um, bead around it, whichever you might be. I've got three of them left though within the vault. It's stunning. Julie, Mary, Maker, Brenda, um, and I've got people still on the phone lines. I can't see your names as of yet. Look at that split payment though, folks. Look at the quality of that. Uh, look, look how low, sorry, that split payment is um, for something of this grade. I mean, it is Harrods worthy, isn't it? It is hat and garden worthy. Only if you're wearing long sleeves. Oh, clearly. Or else you can't. You definitely can't go. In I've with never a heard anything hat. so ridiculous in my life. You can't go in a turkey hat because they won't sell you it. It'll be more expensive and they won't sell you it. Do you know what? That, that that almost makes me. If ever if ever any of us win the Euro Millions or anything like that, to do like a full uh, no, Julia Roberts. You yeah, know? pretty woman. Pretty woman. Big mistake. Big Huge mistake. mistake. Huge. Yeah, do one of them. Yeah, do one of those. Um, okay, moving on to. Oh, it's beautiful. It's abs it, again, it's going back to kind of your vine. This is the finale of our carvings. Um, oh, my word, this is stunning. There's a big amount of sterling silver, and you really notice that. You can feel the gram weight. Look at this. Let me show you side profile first. I can't take myself seriously right now, but look. <laughs> it's properly caged in there, isn't it? I mean, you've got so much going on in the back as well. I love that one. I think Let's it's Let's put it up to the bust. Oh, wow. Did you have this one? Um, can't remember. I think I did. This one's going on pre-order, proven to be really... Uh, to be honest, I, I don't envy you the decision. If you're choosing between these, they are all absolutely beautiful, aren't they? They really are. I think it's what one you're drawn to. Yeah. I always say that with things. Yeah. I love it. Absolutely love it. Good luck to you all. Look at that. It's very sensitively done, this one. So if you're more of a minimalist um, jewellery wearer and yep. this really echoes what's been carved into the jade, then this one might be for you. It's just beautiful. Yeah, with that round, brilliant cut, at the, it's yeah. just huge as well. Oval, sorry, I beg your pardon. Look at how stunning. I know, and it just... It, I marvel at how they do it. Well, I mean, it, it, yeah. Wow. I mean, it just, these little flowers and leaves and vines all intricately cut into a stone that's not really fat. It's, it's really delicate and. Mi millimeters in yeah, thickness. Yeah. It's incredible. Yeah, millimeters in its thickness. Um, again, like I said, this would look so. It would slot perfectly in that million dollar window that we saw not um with it would. Dave yeah. saw over in uh, in Hong Kong. Thirty seven pounds and twenty five pence only on your naught percent interest split payment. There's a lot of collectors getting involved right now. Know how exclusive these are. But again, you know, if you're thinking what right now, well I'm a jewellery maker and um, you know, I want to make jewellery. That's what these were designed for, to be made with as a component. If you want to just keep it simple like I've done or just loop it onto a chain, that's doable. Mm -hmm. But you can still go on in the same way that we saw with the carvings without the bale. Um, you know, we'd have had to have bought those separately, wouldn't we? Yeah. We'd have had to have bought those separately. Now, they are all available on the website, so you can, um, you can shop on those. They're priced up accordingly, but know that they are extremely, extremely limited. Limited. So single figures of every single one of those, and I've seen a lot of names um, with it in their basket. So first come, first serve. Can't say any fairer than that. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Now coming up, we have Debbie's amazing masterclass. If you like this look of the leather, um, and also think, how do I complete that leather though? I can't just tie it around the back of the neck. <laughs> oh, don't you worry. Debbie's got that covered. Yeah. Um, shall we? bring you a strand that we launched with Mr. Troth. Right. On not far off the eve, it was last Saturday, almost two weeks ago. Um, basically, and I'll, I'll say it as it is, if you haven't watched for a while, Dave was trying to generate cash. He went to our finance director and said, um, okay, I'm off to China. 
can I have some spending money, please? <laughs> and they said, no, you can't have spending money because you spent it oh, already right. on your... Yes, yeah. he's in charge of jade. So he was like, oh. They were like, but you can sell some of your existing jade. So he did close out deals. And he came on air and told, told that message. He said, look, I'm about to meet Mr. Lou. I can't go there penniless. <laughs> Effectively. No. So he sort of, yeah, generated some income, didn't okay. he? Good. Um, and this was one of them. Now, the only reason they went to this price point was because he needed spending money. Oh, that's nice. Now, um, I've been with you pretty much most of this week. And I've seen pretty much all of your red jade I sell out this week. Mm. That's it. There is no more. We cannot get any more type A red jade. I, it is the end of the road. I've never been so definitive about a statement than that. The only way you can get it is in a few multicolored strands like this. That's really beautiful. Isn't You've it? You've got all the colors in there. Look at that. That's so lovely. You have type A cherry tomato red yeah. jadeite. You have your beautiful deepest, the closest to imperial greens that mm -hmm. I've seen. It's very dark, isn't it? Yeah. And then you have that glowing white and lavender. It went stupidly low. Did it? Like I said, they, look, look, if anyone can do it, if anyone can do it, it's Dave. Yeah. He's in charge of Jade. He's got the power. And he had reasoning behind it. Mm. He's like, look, I can't buy it for this. But also, he goes, I don't want to put myself in a situation where I'm meeting one of the most influential individuals in Jade in the world. And say he does give me an opportunity that I go, oh, sorry, I can't, I haven't got the money. Can you, yeah. yeah. He said, I don't want to be in that situation. No, 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 no. Which I totally, totally understand. Um... We know that red jade is completely irreplaceable right now. We've been offered your type B and C, but it's more money than what we've brought to you over the last three years. Isn't that amazing? So much more expensive. And was that you, down to the lockdown and in being able to get hold of oh, it? Oh, it's absolutely yeah. our buying. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But also the fact that over the years, this has never been stockpiled. Red jade eye is the rarest color, fact. It's rarer than imperial green. It's rarer than any other color palette. And that's because red forms from the skin of the boulder and not every single boulder oxidizes in this way. That's why if you're lucky, you'll see maybe a tiny percentage of red, a tiny percentage. Um, Mr. Liu said, Jade that is Taipei will now stay here in Asia because the Chinese market is too strong and is driving the price up for all available stones in the market. For the rare fancy colors, they are, have completely disappeared. We don't even see them in the Chinese market. They've dis uh, disappeared months ago. I have only what remains in my vaults, but I cannot replace. This is irreplaceable. There are pieces I would never part with and the fancy colors are the same now. He is talking about this. Is that the man that Dave's going to see now? Yes, right. one of. Right. Along with the Financial Times, by the way. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I remember Aspreys didn't get invited or Van Cleef or Cartier. You know, Dave Troth from, from Gemporia. Good. It's amazing, but that's the respect that he's got these days, mm. you know, within the Jade world. So good luck, everybody, because this went astonishingly low. It is now or never. It is last chance saloon. There is what we have. We ain't ever going to be able to buy more of. Um, we can bring you. We've been offered type B and C. We don't want to do it. It's more expensive. It's more expensive and it hasn't got the inherent value. These aren't dyed. These aren't polymer impregnated. This is that rare variety, the fancy colours that you heard there um, from Bernard at four hundred and ninety nine pounds only. That's a steal. And they were launched with Dave a couple of weeks ago. How many do we have left? 33 left. Not 34. If you're number 34, unfortunately, we can't. We can't. And there are people multi-buying. Swansea straight away wants three. Janice in London, Kay in Cambridgeshire. I've got jewellers getting involved right now. Look, the, you can get... I tell you where you can get fancy colour jade. It, when we run out of our red jade, do you know where you can get it? You can get it from Mason and Kay. You can get it from Gump's in San Francisco. They're not going to be three figures, though. Mm. They're going to be four figures and then some. Probably even more. 
in, in today's market. Get it whilst you have the opportunity. Certified, totally and utterly natural type A multicolored jadeite. The red, it's not just a hint. No. It's not just a tiny percentage of the red, you know, like that bangle that we've shown in the past yes. where it's more white, it is. which is still a, a fancy color, don't get me wrong. They're exclusively solid red. And when they are solid red, they come at a significant premium. So Gumps, which is a jewelers that has been around for decades, very much high-end jewelers, they do a version of this. Wow. Yeah. Oh, ten and a half thousand. Ten and a half thousand pounds. Or today you can get type A grade, same as Gumps. I can't see much difference there, you know. There's not. Can you? Really that much difference. They've got some honeys in there, I suppose. They've got some of the honeys and aquas in there. But we've brought you those in the past. We're, but we're at £149. Sure. In terms of translucency and quality, no, there same. isn't. No, we've, we've spoken to someone who used to, whose family member used to work in Gumps, and they were saying the quality is the same. So they've seen our jade and their jade. And the quality is the same. You've got to check out, though, because we only have a limited quantity, everyone. Alan, West Midlands, Debbie, Maker, Linda, Angus, Kay, Janice. Swansea's got three. Incredible. What? Are you matching what Dave did? I don't know if he actually meant for us to repeat it, though, you know. I suppose he's in China. He ain't going to know, is he? He's set a precedent now. <laughs> Hang on. 60 seconds on your screen. It's gorgeous. We're going to go lower. Good luck, everybody. Is there much difference? Is there? Our, In fact, our yeah, reds are better. Stronger, yeah. And the greens are better. White's about the same, I think we'd all agree. All right, yours hasn't got honey. This one hasn't got the honey colours, the yellow. Oh, my goodness me. Five millimetre rounds, type A grade, same as at Gomps. You can pay £10,600 for that knotted necklace, which, by the way, has not got a fancy clasp. Or would you prefer 1% of that price? Oh, yes, please. Not 10%, 1% of that price. Wait, 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 wait. We do that. Oh my goodness me. We had how many, Roscoe? 33 available. I don't have that quantity anymore. There's tons of you getting involved. 1% of the price at Gumps. Oh, they tell you what, they must, they simply must have loads of gold on that necklace. They've got a gold clasp, I think it is. Is it knotted? It's, it's knotted. knotted. It's really yeah. simple. Yeah. But. You know, you can not. If you can't, we can teach you. you it's one percent of that price. That's incredible. That's you know, I've got a red. You probably see me wear it. My red J yeah, necklace, lovely. and I wear it all the time. I absolutely love it. Ninety nine pounds and ninety nine pence only to get hold of this. That's amazing. It is amazing. Mm. Or thirty three pounds and thirty three pence on your naught percent interest. Do you think we're ever going to regret these purchases? Genuinely, no, no joking aside. No, we're not away. We? Genuinely. Um, when our Jedi amazing dream has, has, has disappeared. And, you know, you could put one of these carvings on that strand. Yeah. What a oh, piece gosh, of jewellery that would be. That incredible. Would be. Let's, let's imagine, Debbie, let's imagine. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go with one of the darker greens because you've got some of the darker greens in this oh, strand. Yes. I'm going to go with maybe this rectangle. Can you imagine this in an auction house? and the price that that would command. Exactly. How incredible is that? Now, that person? looks like a 10 grand piece of jewellery, right? Totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because if you look at the Gumps one, look, there's just gold. It's a really simple clasp. Which would you choose? That's Don't... what I'd do with it. Yeah, same. Quantity left. 10, and I've got Cynthia Stella, Sorry Helen, Alan Maker, Linda Angus, Kay, Janice, some of you wanting multiples. Oh, you could finish it off with that clasp. Oh, yeah. Oh, the pearl toggle, or the one we've just done on the back of the deal of the day. That would be amazing. Shall we visualise it? Michael? Is he there? Um, have we got that clasp still nearby? Can you imagine that? Sorry, Michael. 
Just one of the deal of the day, sil the silver clasp. Ah. Oh. Look at that as a piece of jewellery. I mean, oh. It's stunning, it isn't is it? Absolutely and this beautiful. is why we framed it with silver. Because, you know, you, it's not just about, oh, well, it's a finished piece of jewellery. Yeah, it is if you look at it that way, but you can always go on and, 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 and make it unique in your own individual way, can't you? Oh, yeah. I mean, you could put spaces in there if you wanted to add some more silver. I think it's beautiful as it is. Imagine that in a shop window, a boutique jeweller's shop window. Amazing, amazing, amazing. We're going to put a minute on your screens to close this auction. Five of them are left. Pauline, Linda, Florence, Suja, Gloucestershire, Maker, Julie, West Midlands, Debbie and Swansea. Well done. I've still got Florence, Cynthia, Stella, Surrey, Helen, Alan, Maker, Linda, Angus, Kay and Janice with it in their baskets or on the phone lines. If you haven't yet checked out, then I would strongly encourage you to do so sooner rather than later. If you haven't dialed through yet and you really fancy this, then you can, you can still do it. Don't let that put you off because it's allocated on a first come, first serve basis. Like Cynthia, who's just joined us on the phone lines. Amazing. If you press your option, one Cynthia you're there like Mary in Cambridge who's joined us on the web and maker on the phone lines Londonry Jenny in Gloucestershire you can or Jeannie sorry in Gloucestershire there are three left and 27 of you with it in your baskets we're at 99 pounds and 99 pence only can you imagine that piece can you not that or can you restrand that if you're answering yes you know even if this is not your style of jewelry I'm going to say something really unconventional here for legacy jewellery, yeah, 100%. I agree. I agree. Approach first dibs with that. Oh, yeah, can you imagine? What do you think they're going to sell it at? Do you think it's going to be anywhere near a double figure price tag? No. 100% no. 100% no. Now we have three strands of high goo still to bring you. Okay. I've got 15 mil, then we've got 12, and then we've got 10. Okay. They are all limited. I've got 20 of each of these, so you will need to be quick. Now, they are drilled through your high goo, but you don't need to use the drill, do you? No, you don't need to at all. I think um, they're nice stranded onto thicker, like we were saying earlier, thicker chains, uh, the leather cord, a couple of strands of gems can go through the middle of that, and they can sit sideways so that they can kind of move and mm -hmm. clink together. That's what I always think of that as the Susie Menem clink. You know, her um, bangles always clink together. And I yeah. think that's how you can tell Jade is Jade is that that's sound. That's the it music. Makes. They yeah, call the it music. the music. The music. Confucius wrote about that. In fact, have you got that, Roscoe? Oh, oh sorry, Ross. No, we can go into the high goo. Let's talk about the high goo, because that is ultimately what we're talking about right now. What is a high goo? Well, um, I'll show you all three strands. Um, it's lovely cool to the touch, by the way, Jade, mm. as well. Type A Jade. It looks so if, wet, doesn't it? Yeah. If you pick Jade up and it's physically warm, then there's your red flag, first red flag. Um, but one of the earliest evidence of human decoration is a stone circle and with a circular hole pierced in the middle. In Neolithic China, elites were buried with them um, and they are now called pie discs when referring to them in the context of Chinese decorations and artifacts. Western cultures often describe them as donut shapes. These shapes are generally associated with the heaven or sky, eternity, everlasting life, um, the whole universe continuous and uh, harmony. Reading on. Uh, pie discs look simple, um, but there is a deep meaning in it, expressing a lot of intelligence and blessing the wearer with wisdom. Ancient Chinese created pie discs as a bridge connected to the heaven. Uh, they spoke to gods through the hole in the middle. Pie discs represent the intelligence of ancient Chinese. It is believed to give the Chinese green jade pie disc pendant of intelligence. Sorry, it is believed to gift um, Chinese green jade pie disc to pendants of intelligence to school aged children, helps them in their school. Work. Oh, how lovely. Amazing. Yes, that's right. They are also associated to the Ouroboros. Uh, the Ouroboros is the serpent of light which swallows its own tail, constantly creating itself in a form of circle. Uh, the Ouroboros symbolizes the eternal unity of all things, the cycle of life, death and rebirth. Uh, in this context, the center of the pie stone represents our energetic spine and the energy which flows through the center of our bodies. Yet uh, there is a further connection uh, to be made with our own spiraling DNA, the building blocks of life. And you think about Glenlera, 
You know, yes. his his Taurus yeah. ring, it's that circular motif, isn't it? It is. And yeah. he was talking about it's the iris of the eye, the circle of uh, the, the eye of a storm or our very universe itself. Yeah. It's, you know, the circle itself is is probably the most symbolic of all shapes. But not just in China. Traditionally, people would use pie stones to ward off evil spirits or to protect their home, their family members, or even their livestock. Both the Incas and the Mayans are known to have employed them. Yeah, so, I'm not surprised. I mean, they've huge meaning, huge, huge meaning. And when we first brought them, they were individual. Now you're getting strands. Mason and Kay, we spoke about them a few moments ago. If you look at the necklace that, that was featured in the film, the jade pendant, it features a pie disc. Um, and it's actually the story about a... Um, um, if we go on to the next one, sorry, Peony, that lady that you just saw, wearing a traditional green jade disc pendant. She was given a pendant by her grandmother to bring her good luck. For hundreds of years, jade has also been known as the stone of heaven, um, has been revered in Chinese culture. It's also uh, a treasured stone said to bring luck and protection. And there's that pie symbol. And that features just one. Now, we're about to bring you a collection of th separate auctions, three strands of high goos. Wow. Yeah, exactly. You know, to be able to carve. And these are carved. That's the thing. These are type A jadeite carved. Would you like me to count them? Yeah, sure, that makes sense. Because they could be individual pendants if you wanted them to. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Oh, that's a considerable amount. 20 solitaires. They're a lovely size as well. Like, really usable. Rings, earrings, yeah, pendants. Yeah, lovely. You could put one of your head pins through. Yeah, you could. That's a lovely idea. One of the head, pardon? Each high goo for less than five pounds. Put one of your topaz in the centre, absolutely. That's coming up tomorrow. If you want to make the simplest pair of earrings, they're lovely, these are. Would a heart? Oh, no, it's a little flower. Would that go in? I think so. Oh, yes, please. That's lovely. So if you've got the head pin kits, isn't that gorgeous? You don't have to use that drill hole, do you? No. Even though it's there, you don't have to use it. How beautiful is that yeah, as a pair of earrings? That's lovely. And then all of a sudden you've made 10 type A jadeite solitaire earrings <laughs> out of this one strand. ka -ching. <laughs> So hang on, that's a tenner per pair. Oh, that's amazing. I think they could be studs. I've got a pair of uh, um, Kotan earrings that I bought from our sister channel that are little mini high goos, and they've got tiny wee and it is weeny, like millimetres, mm -hmm. um, in, a, in a Burmese ruby in the centre. Oh. And that's just, just like that. that. And that would be a lovely ring. Oh, beautiful. You're making type A jade eye earrings. £5 per high goo, £10. And that's 12 and a half carats, by the way. £10 if you turn those into the technique that you demonstrated this morning. Okay, maybe you might think it, Al, they're a bit, a bit too big for me. Righto. They're little chunky ones, so I like them. We're going to do it in one price crash. We're not going to mess around. I've got 20 available. Oh, that, that's perfect shape, isn't yeah. it? Perfect size, rather. Look at that. So pretty, isn't it? Use the bigger ones, maybe for your pendants, maybe these for your earrings. Just glue it into place if you wanted to. But also, if you roll down the head pin at the back, roll, 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 till you get to the... Nice and tight. Bead, nice and tight. And then you can just actually thread that onto something. Yes! And then they'll be movable. Oh, so then they're attention, they're little details, aren't they, within? 170 carats. I'll give them a quick count for you as well, everybody, because these are... You know, we've, we've sold them individually, haven't we, high goos of this mm -hmm. size? We did this morning. Very yeah. similar. Um, so 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 25. 25 hand-carved high goos uh, considered to be protective, not just in ancient China, across the world. We have 20 available opportunities. Wow, seventy nine ninety nine. Are we doing closeout deals right now? <coughs> Basically, so if you do the math, seventy nine ninety nine divided by twenty five. Couple of pound. Yeah, 
Three pounds <laughs> and 19 pence per type A jadeite. Oh, that's amazing. You know, again, lovely. I don't think I've ever seen that price tag for genuine jade. Not type A grade, no. anyway. Even type B for that matter. Even plastic. You yeah. know, plastic pretend jade. Yeah, exactly. Good luck, everybody. Make sure you are checking out those baskets if you want to guarantee your success. I've still got the smallest, the very cute, this next round as well. Um, if you want to do, you know, secure um, all three of those sizes, I mean, if budget allows, they do look amazing, don't they? Um, so, yeah, the smaller size is coming your way. I had 25 of these. Um, you don't have to use that drill hole, but you can also go for a head pin either from the inside out, can't you? And it creates like an illusion, yes. like it's floating. Yeah. Um, right now for the 10 millimetres, which I, you think they're itty bitty, but actually they're not, they're not that tiny. They're 10 mil. No, 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 no. It's just because these two are huge. Um, so, yeah, 10 mil is a big size for a round. Oh, look at them. They're kind of wet. They do look physically wet. I think they'd be beautiful for a bracelet. Yeah. Like that I idea. think they're really lovely. Do you reckon you could sneak a little tiny pearl or something like that? In Definitely, the center? yeah. Just pop it on the end of a head pin and put, put it through. <sighs> £23.99 pence only. They're going to lay perfectly um, on the body itself. You can use them individually, of course. That's a lot of pieces of jewellery if you are thinking about individual solitaires. That's but as a lot. business, if you've got an artisanal market... Yeah. Well, you can have a pendant and then matching earrings. So that's three. And how many are on the strand? Let's count them. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty. So that's fifteen sweets. Yeah. That's amazing. So yeah. I mean, you don't have to go full out. No. Would you make your money back? Absolutely. I think yeah. you'd make it back in one suite. Agree. Um, well done, everybody. Congratulations to you all. Now, I've got one more closeout deal to bring you. Don't forget about um, Debbie's Masterclass. So, if all about the leather. Um, love these boxes. I want to get hold of these as well. And you've also got the endings. So, if you've never known how to actually secure um, or complete a leather necklace, then they're coming up in the next hour. But closeout deal on your type A jade eye, everybody. I can't believe we say that out loud to be honest in all seriousness these are drops but not as you know it they're absolutely incredible we've got a real thickness i love the shape of these they're really unique and distinctive um burmese type a obviously uh, um jade eye have you seen that cut before we're gonna do it for a brand new low price tag lovely jewelry makers make sure you are checking out have we got quantity we're doing close out deals 36 once oh Goodness me, that's low. Really? 36. <coughs> flowers. Oh, they'd be beautiful little, flowers. Little petals. would be absolutely stunning. You could just alternate them in different directions. Do you yeah. see where I'm coming from? One, two, one, two, like in a zigzag effect. I think effect. they'd be beautiful like that. Really lovely. Because you've got that almost like a 45 degree angle, haven't you, towards the actual, what would be, I guess, a pavilion of the stone yeah. towards the drill hole. 19 pounds and 99 pence only it's a major closeout deal we only had a few of them though uh, multi buyers getting involved never been anywhere near what's on your screens right now pauline patricia west midlands angela rupal hello to you Anne and christine and sorry and cheryl Ann. Um, a very very good morning to you we're stepping into a wonderful masterclass as well um wall of fame your wonderful creations as well coming up after the break but yeah the cherry on the proverbial cake on the back of these amazing creations, these works of art that we've launched in the last hour, is a closeout deal. It's going to be an on-screen sellout, though, for sure. Uh, Julie, Margaret, congratulations to you all. Don't go anywhere. Debbie and her wonderful jewellery that you've seen framing these works of art and how you complete your leather, ch leather cord, at necklace, bracelet, whatever it yep. is, coming up just after this. Don't go anywhere. We'll see you. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide, this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour.
If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, this Saturday's deal of the day, we have been listening. You've been shouting out for all of your essentials, haven't you? You've been messaging into the studio. You've been shouting to us saying, we need our essentials. Well, we listened and at 10 o'clock, we have Ross's stash grab. I have the list, which include your featherweight head pins, your lever bat shepherd hooks, your finding wire end tips, and so much more. So if you're desperate for your essentials, it's this Saturday's deal of the day. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. They really do. I must admit, I'm. Go I've, I'm. It's funny, isn't it? Because you manage without glasses for so long, and then all of a sudden, when you get them, you're like, "Oh, I can actually see." Yeah, I'm like that. I can actually. I see. was ages like, I'd go somewhere, go, "What does that say? How long do I put that in for?" And then I thought, "I can't keep doing that." Yeah, I know. They really seat you. Oh yeah. Oh, you're trying to do things like I was like trying that. to. Put, I was trying to do a bat. Put a battery. Change a battery. I was like. <laughs> I like glasses though. I think they're yeah, quite yeah, cool. Yeah, yeah. Me you know, too. That, and that colour's lovely. And being able to see, there's always books that. Isn't there's, it? There are. Um, okay, starting us off, it's Josephine. Hello to you, Josephine. Oh, Josephine, that's beautiful. Loving that. You're number 74, Josephine. Loving those. Um, is that is that C B doing that I can see? Yeah. yeah. Um, hi Jewelry Maker, this is my entry for this week's WAF and my Yuki C B bracelet and earring set made on my Jewelry Maker loom. Ah. Um, 
You have got me totally addicted to sea beading. Thank you. Oh, that's fabulous. So I love sea beading. Is this new for you then, Josephine? Yeah, you love a bit of sea beading. Oh, yeah, I used to hate them and then I just got addicted. You're a lady of many talents. <laughs> uh, number 75 is from Lorraine. Oh, Hello to you, Lorraine. Lorraine. Oh, some beautiful amber just there. Um, hi, this week's bake is a mixture of Baltic amber, a pendant and earring set that I made for my aunt's birthday. That's All components cool. are from Jewelry Maker. Oh, well, happy birthday to your auntie and I'm sure she's going to absolutely love those. Definitely. Number 76 is from Norma. Oh, Norma. Oh, wow. Wow. That's stunning. It's incredible. Is that in the frame? Yeah, it looks it. So Norma is saying, hi all. Something a wee bit different this week for my WAF entry. Still got pearls in it though? Well, they are always appropriate. Totally agree. Absolutely. I decided to try a mixed media project using chain shell, freshwater pearls uh, from a scoop, some wooden rice beads and a wee opalite cabochon. I used julet glue from uh, Jewelry Maker and it was fab. As always, good luck to all in the draw and a big thank you to all at Jewelry Maker. That's incredible. I love that. The attention to detail, like the little the little pearl inside the shell. And yeah. just, I, it's one of those things you could look at for a really long time. Long time, can you? Absolutely. Yeah, lose yourself in what work of art that is. Mm. Uh, number 77 is from Gail. Hello to you, Gail. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's very, so very pretty. pretty. Morning all. My entry this week is a double-stranded bracelet from 4mm Angelites and Appetites. Sterling silver spacer beads from one of my beautiful, uh, and one of my beautiful class, all from Jewelry Maker. Good luck to all and thanks for the inspiration. Gail, loving that. Good luck to you. Uh, number 78. Number 78 is Jackie Woodcraft. Here's my entry for the Wall of Fame. Two pear necklaces, one with freshwater pearls and blue tiny stones. The other one, mixture of pearls, some probably as old as JM. All components are from JM. I hope you like them. Good luck to all the very talented woffers out there. Would be wonderful to have a win. Love to all the lovely presenters, cameramen and the fantastic, talented designers. You all make my day every day. Oh, bless oh that you, was a Jackie. lovely. And that jewellery is absolutely gorgeous. Good luck, Jackie, number 78. Number 79, I've got Molly Rogers. My entry uses bare copper throughout, which I hammered and coloured using my Dremel and my blowtorch. Oh, I love doing that flame painting with the, with the heat on the copper. The stones, Mexican turquoise, are green and beautifully marked. All items from JM, of course. More copper demos would be good. Thanks for everything, JM. You continue to stimulate great interest and innovation, and that is best wishes. Let me have a look at that. Oh, Molly, that's... Oh, that's stunning. That. That's my bit, bit of me, that is. Good okay. luck, Molly. And I've got the last one is number 80, and it's Abby. And she says, oh, good wow. morning, jewellery maker. Please see the silver rose brooch. Studying an old Alison Terry brooch training DVD has helped massively when this rose needed a home. The main structure was made with round silver wire, and the leaves were dressed with JM silver twisted wire. I hope you like it. All from jewellery maker. Good luck to all my fellow Waffers. That is absolutely stunning. How clever are you, Abby? Good yeah, luck. Incredible. Well done, everybody. Keep everything crossed for the draw that happens on Wednesday. So, <coughs> excuse me, you have... A, oh, yeah, that'll be with us. Amazing. So talented. Um, so you've still got time to send your photographs in. The only stipulation, of course, is that they are jewellery maker products. Yeah, not exclusively. But mostly would be good. That would okay. be amazing. And you never know who could be crediting your accounts with £100 or £50 um, in the random draw. And it's not done on merit, folks. It is, you see us literally pick it out. Likewise, items that are shown are not done on merit. It's done completely at random. Um, so how fabulous is that? I know. It's amazing. Right then. Should we get cracking with your masterclass? I... Which... Do you know, you can have... You can have we can do like sea bead weaving, we can do techniques, you could do that amazing bracelet that hopefully yeah. is on the horizon, you yeah. can do wire work, you can do gemstone setting. But you know what? I've been desperate for this. Oh really, for the, there's a couple of little problems that sometimes you get when you're just trying to um, get your ends on your leather cord. It's not hard by any means, but I've just got like a couple of little techniques just that I've... Tips. Tips that I've learned through experience of, oh, this won't go in, what do I do, you know? Well, talk us through, because you've obviously, you've provided the corded necklace for these amazing jadeites that we brought um, in the last hour. I think with cord, you can just simply put something on it. Yeah. Obviously, a couple of problems that you might encounter is the cord's too fat to go through the bell. We're going to address that in a minute. Um, 
but you can also put things either side and you can also do knots as part of your design. Yeah. So I've got some large hold sterling silver spaces, as you can see there, mm -hmm. that I just put just as a different idea either side of the beautiful pendants. But also, you know, we did those um, pearls with the two mil holes, didn't we? Those would be yeah. beautiful either side. And I just think that I'm seeing so many high end things put on cord. And also, I've not seen a cord pack that's as comprehensive as this. You even get the right amount of jump rings that you need for, yeah. so that you can make, I think, is it 10? You can make 10, um, whatever you're going to use it for, well, one, corded two, pieces. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, 10. 10. So if I show you, firstly, let's have a little look inside this container. So um, if I show you in the box, we've got the leather, which is lovely leather. You know when leather's got a really nice smell? Mm. Um, so it's really good quality leather and it's nice and soft. So you actually get two colours in each of these. So five colours in total, isn't it? Yeah? Yes. Um, so five of the colours. Um, and in terms of their length, it's a metre, isn't it? So a metre on each of those. Yes. Yes. Then you've got your chain. Can you see that there? So that's a one metre chain. Then you've also got the lobster claws. Can you see those? So 10 of your lobster claws with jump rings. They've got two jump rings. They've got one jump ring in the jaw, which we will attach to the yeah. other cap. Yeah. And then one jump ring attached to the bottom of the lobster claw that you need to attach that. Here we go. Because at first I thought, oh, haven't they put the jump rings in for the little cap? But it's actually in the jaw. So you just open it and take it out. There you go. See what I mean? Yes. Very cleverly thought out. Very, very much so. So this is, it is put together geniusly. Now, you don't just get that, though. No. You get these. And they're different. They're all different. So these are called bell caps, aren't they? Yeah, they're really good. So the bell cap, if I just pop that down for a second. They're good for tassels as well. Yeah. If I pick one of each of the designs up, probably easier to use my fingers, aren't I? One of each of these designs. So you're getting four of each design. That, that's a lot. Yeah, so some are more rounded on the top, some are sort of more bell-shaped, more and more square. And then you've got one that's got kind of um, a serrated kind of intricate edge. And then you've got one that I would class as a traditional cap, which is the one that you just put out there with the, you sort of see that a lot. Um, I've not seen these sort of other intricate caps other than me having to get them from abroad before now and definitely not in a set. No, well, how many are you getting there? So in total... So there's five different designs. How many in each? Four pieces. Well, 20, so 20. that you can make 10 pieces. Wow. Yeah, so oh, yeah, because you'll need two. You'll yeah. need... Can, can, uh, um, I know these are in a different colour, but can you show me one of the, um, one of the ha endings, whichever yeah. it might be? I know these are silver, but you get the idea for everybody at home how they're actually worked. So of the components that... So you, uh, now that I did this morning and I've put odd ones on there. Trust me to hand you that one. It doesn't matter. It's in the back of your neck. But <laughs> Sorry. I just noticed that. No, it's fine. Um, so as you can see, this is actually a good example of how different they can look. So if you look on the um, one side, you can see what I'd call the traditional cap. This one. The other one. Oh, this one. That one. And it's just sort of like the uh, graduated plain sort of silver looking cap. And then if you look on the other one, it's far more ornate. You've yes. got a really lovely little pattern going on there. So you can choose. I would say that maybe the one on the left is a little bit more masculine than the one on the right. So yep. maybe if you were doing unisex story, someone might prefer one to the other. Uh, so you've got the different choices there. To, but you could also make that a feature. I mean, if you're going to have that in the front and you were going to connect something to the front, then, you know, you can choose what goes best it's, with it. It's, uh, it's always been one of those, how do I finish leather? Mm. You, you need these, that's okay. why. You need the little ones that fit. So, fit. Oh, they look absolutely incredible. Um, okay, and of course, any questions that you have for Deb, uh, Debs, then just message us um, live into the studio. Um, okay, and we've got different colourways to bring you. So we're starting with the rose. Um, then, we get, then we've got a kit with the silver colour and the, the yellow colour. The leather is all the same, isn't it? Yeah. The leather is all the same, the components are all the same, the designs are all the same, it's just down to your preference on the colour. Can we shop ahead on these then, Roscoe? Yeah? So you can shop ahead if you want, and I don't think people are just going to be getting one. They come in the storage, so you're talking about, what, five metres of, of, of leather, mm -hmm. ten of your lobster claws with the double ju jump ring. Yeah. 
A meter of your chain yep. for your extenders if you want them. And 20. 20 different of your cord yeah, ends. Different um, styles. So, and a very. Oh, what? 20 pounds. Oh, that's amazing. And you get the box as well. And, and the box. I just think it's really important that we look at the colours of this because yeah. sometimes there's been boxes and I thought I wouldn't use that colour and I wouldn't use that colour. I think these colours are really usable. Tasteful, aren't they? They're tasteful. Yeah. You know, I think bright colours have their place, of course they do. But if you're going to be putting everyday designs of different colours on, then you need your neutrals. And you've got a couple of lovely colours there. Love that one. I love that one. Yeah, gorgeous. And that one. Yeah. And it's you can tell it's top quality leather. Mm. Amazing quality leather, yeah, because it's really, uh, really nice and soft. It feels nice. It should be flexible as well, not coated and coated and no, coated. No, you can tell. Plastic, yeah, yeah. Um, and you're getting a metre long length there, so you could do wrap around bracelets with these as well. You could do your Chang Lu. Is that oh, Chang Lu bracelets? Chang Bai bracelets? Anyway, you know the ones I mean, the wrap bracelets. Yeah. Um, you can use this for. Oh, I know which ones where you have the gemstone through the centre. Yeah, and, and you, you just weave yeah. it on. Yeah, yeah. In fact, Avon demoed that the other day. Oh, did she? Yeah. yeah so you weave it on. I've done it before. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And so they're perfect for that. But I think, you know, having it so that you've got the different clasps that fit exactly and you haven't got a really thick piece of leather, it's a really good wearable size. Like if you look at it on the pendants there, that's pretty much the perfect size. And of course you can knot it, you know, you can knot it, you can do the, I always call it a spiral knot, but it's not where you do the, you take your leather and you go round three times and then you go back up the middle and it makes like yeah, that little- Yeah, it, it, it is fiddly to do that, isn't yeah. it? It's, it's, I know which, which option I would take. The easy one. Yeah, me too. <laughs> and I was like a little, if I can put a bit of metal somewhere, then I think it adds to it. Yeah, absolutely, I mean, look at that. It just. Just That's glue lovely, it into place. It? Yeah. That's all you need to do. Just glue it into place. Leave it overnight. Do you know, it also makes me think. You remember Claire Perry that worked here some time ago? Remember Claire? Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah go ages on ages ago. On her birthday, yeah. I bought her a leather... Uh, it was a leather um, charm bracelet. Mm -hmm. So the carrier itself from Pandora. Yeah, they she do. Loved, those, she it? loved... Yeah. Pandora so I bought her the bracelet it was in this kind of tan leather because I knew that she was getting a bag the same color um I tell you what it's just literally one wrap of cord yes. sorry I went really squeaky then about seven, <laughs> about seven inches of leather cord that was just sort of wrapped around her wrist with cord ends like this yeah think how many you could make oh yeah well ten yeah you can make 10 of them. Well, you can make more than that. You'd need more cord ends because this is, we're thinking necklace lengths. You can yep. make 10 necklace lengths. If you want to make bracelets, then you could definitely make more. You just need more cord ends or to make, just make your own for some extra. Fabulous. Good luck, everybody. I've got 10 of these kits left. I think they're all going to sell out. These kits. Well, we haven't seen anything like this for no, a while, have we? No, no, um, there's no, uh, like I said, it's really, you can, I know that, uh, Debs, you've shown different techniques of how to do it, and I know Mark's done something as well. Yeah. But actually, I just still, I, I, I would always take the easy option and just a little bit of glue. I, it depends what I'm putting on it. If I'm going to put something like a nice pendant or a pearl, I don't want a load of knots and things going on. I want it just the leather. Yeah. So I might put like a couple of beads if I can get them through. Some of the leather that I've had before, the faux leather, in, in my opinion, <laughs> leather, um, has been too thick for what I'd mm. use. Uh, I like the fact that this is what I would use the most. This, this yeah, it's thickness. quality. It is quality. You can feel the quality of these. And like, uh, yeah, and the fact that you can just glue it on and away you've got. That's what professional jewellery is with the leather bracelets. Oh, yeah. Let's do the uh, yellow gold. The phone lines have absolutely lit up exactly the same components. Yeah, everything the same. Everything the same, but just in different colours, um, effectively. So let me just move that out of the way for a second. I'll scooch that one that way. Okay. Uh, that one that way. And then I'll try my best to pick up. Oh, they've all, they're all rolling everywhere. Try and... Pick up all of these and hopefully you'll be able to see that there's differences. There's five different designs in your cord ends. And that one, you get four of each, was it? So in total, 20. Is that, are they all different so far? And I think, there you go. Is that right? I feel like I'm missing one there. Yeah, I am. I got two of the same. Is it? Yeah, there's one with a little. That one? Yeah, that one. There you go. It's four. Oh, 
Right, hang on. That one's the same as that one. Is it like the bird cage one? No. Got. <laughs> Where's the other design? See? Hang on. Is it the one with the serrated bottom that you're looking for? A serrated bottom? It's got a serrated bottom. Oh, I think it is. <laughs> is it that one? Yeah, that's it. Ah, oh, there you go. Where would I be without you, Debs? <laughs> there you go. So it's you've got tell, what, five different designs yeah. in total, 20 of them. You've got your your um, lobster claws with double or double jump rings. You've got the meter of your chain and you've got five meters of your beautiful leather as well. So in the kind of like, oh, turquoise, you've mm -hmm. got the classic tan, traditional tan leather. Yep. Then you've got what I would describe as like a gold, um, a purple and a black. We had how many of each of these kits? Just under 100 of the yellow and the rose. And how many have we got in the silver? 150. Oh, I need to get some of these. I need to get, can I do a little make along with you? Of course you can. I've got glue. I've got glue too. Oh, but we're best off using this glue. Super glue because right. we're not we're gonna move it around after. Okay. So use the glue that's Oh you super. can use your you can use your glue if you put it in a Here you are. It's just fun. I don't know. Might yeah, be... go for it. Yeah, why not? It seems jewelry that I'm capable of actually. <laughs> Something you're like capable this. of more than you think oh, you're capable you. of. Bless you. Nineteen ninety nine, well done everybody. Anne and Irene and Shirley and Elaine and Jackie and Barbara. So wait a minute. So can I get all three kits? For sixty pounds, how amazing is that? That's the so amount good. of jewelry that you're going to create from that. The silver is absolutely flying on pre-order. We've got a hundred, or rather, had a hundred and fifty of these. Um, yeah, they're going very fast. I'm not surprised uh, by that at all. So here it is for the silver colour. You get your box. You get oh, five meters of your leather. Let's put it that way. Is that going to stay? No, it's not going to stay. Um, then you get, if I move it that way, sorry, Michael. Um, then you get all the three, five designs, four of each of them. Um, yeah. These have been, you know, all mixed up so I can show you which one's which. There's that one. There's one like, like, uh, like a, you know, like a Victorian bird cage. Yeah, I love that one. It's pretty, isn't it? Mm. How's that? There you go. They're flying on pre-orders, though, everybody. So you get a meter of your of your silver plated chain. You've got ten of your large lobster claws with the double jump ring. You get five meters of your lovely leather, which is amazing quality leather, by the way. Um, it's not stiff, which you wouldn't want this to be stiff, would you? No, because it's malleable. Yeah. So as you run it through your fingers, you can actually get it to take the shape. Yeah. So if if it's sort of kinked up and you want it, you can just run it through your fingers and it will take the shape. A bit like you know when you wear leather clothes, like you get a leather jacket and when you first wear it, it's really stiff and then it kind of molds to you, doesn't it? Yeah. Like leather jewelry does that as well. Yeah, exactly. It shouldn't be you know it shouldn't be coated upon coated on coated in plastic really because no. that loses its flexibility as well. Nineteen ninety nine. So we had one hundred and fifty of these, but they're absolutely flying out the door. Um, shouldn't be going any lower. However, purely because we have got marginally larger quantity, we're going to give you an extra saving. Those of you that have already made your confirmation sitting back going, oh, happy days. This is <laughs> silver plated. They are so lovely as well. They're very ornate. Um, just finishes the leather off to a, to a high standard. It just looks really pretty, yeah. I love it. I love the simplicity. I would wear these just with the with the um, end caps and the leather. Maybe nothing, nothing on. I think that would look really nice. Because you can then you can just um, stack. So I, if I put, hold on. Yeah, thank you. So I've got like my stack on today, which I wish listed this. This is the angel light that sold out, and I wish listed oh, it. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Um, and so if you look at that as a stack, and then I could just have my leather. Yeah. Or you can even sometimes just put jump multi rings row. on, multi-row. Just see how it works with a stack. It's really pretty. It works with precious metal stacks as well. Absolutely. Just, you know, so you, you don't have to really do much to it, to be honest. Very, very cool. Good luck, everybody. Everybody pays the final low price tag. 
15 pounds and 99 oh, pence really only. Good. You're gonna get, be able to get 10 necklaces, necklaces, you know, mm -hmm. to about their length um, out of that because that's the amount of caps that you've got. But as far as quantity of leather, once the caps have run out, if you're doing bracelets, you have loads of leather left over. Yeah, which you, which you can go on to finish it with wire like you were saying earlier on yeah or you can do like your your, your changlu bracelets or whatever you, you do with your cord you can use it then for that, those things absolutely mm. amazing well done final 50 of these so these have been hugely popular you can still get hold of the gold uh, gold plated and the rose gold plated but again these have been hugely popular uh, again you know leather um, or corded necklaces are have always always been incredibly popular you know as we said earlier on with the jadeite you know that's very traditional natural fat so take it away well you're going to do it as well well i yeah but i'll do it in the background so Okay. Right, yeah. Oh, thanks. <laughs> no, it's all good. So, you'll find that with these, um, a uh, about three of the end caps go in like butter. But also, this is leather, it's an organic material, and the ends of some of it are going to be fatter than the other. Yeah. So, I've given you the end caps that go in really, really um, easily. You just good. literally just slide in. That's good. Um, so, you would just add a little bit of glue. So, let's. Uh, Let's talk about doing that. Put the glasses on. So. Put the glasses on. So if you've got the ends that actually go in uh, very, very easily, it doesn't matter what state your in ends in. So these, this has uh, not got a load of horrible coating on it, so it tends to be quite soft, and you can see sort of the raw material in there. So all you need to do is what I usually put the glue... Do you want to use...? No, you go first. OK. So you would just pop the glue on the end and then a little bit around the side okay. and then pop that into your end cap. So you need to squeeze the side bit. So I'm not sure how much is left in there. And then you just pop it into the end cap. Now this one won't go in um, to this end cap. This is the one that I found, uh, that's it. And then you just want to pop it, pop it in and just sort of um, twist it into the end cap the leather itself and then if you've got any excess just wipe it with the do you think I have no. now that's it that's done okay that's so it. yeah that's it <laughs> hey, and then it? all you have to do is add your lobster clasp or your chain uh -huh. now when it comes to maybe having the leather that is more difficult to get into some of them just because of the shape of the other leather being organic um, you can do a couple of things because it is organic material you can squish it so you can actually squish this into um, a shape that will then go into your end cap. Or the thing that I found the easiest to do with everything was take a pair of sharp scissors and cut your leather Whoops. Oh, at an angle. At an angle. So you've got okay. this point. And then when you're adding your glue, you're going to add your glue to the side that you've just cut. But you also need to add it round the other side as well and near the end and you might get a bit of excess there and then you're going to be able to pop that straight in and what I was saying to Elle was if you um, it doesn't go like straight into the back if you twist it hold your cap and twist the leather so that you've taken that twisting motion in and then depending on the glue if you're using jewelry jewelry glue then you want to leave that overnight before you hang anything from it um, if you're using super glue, then or whatever glue you're using, just use the manufacturer's instruction. And then that's all you have to do as far as that staying on. And then you've got um, your lobster claw clasp. And you'll see that on your lobster claw clasp, you've got another jump ring that's just hanging from it. So that you can connect your jump ring to one side. And then you might want an extender on there, or you might have cut your leather to exactly the right size. It's completely up to you. So you would just need to open out your jump ring and pop on either, depending which side it is. So let's say we've done the first side. So we would just add in our lobster claw clasp or our extender or maybe you're going to just leave that as a jump ring maybe you don't need the extender now this isn't glued so it might come out and then you're going to close it on that side okay so that 
you've got that extension. You might want to add a bead on the end there and then you can cut it to yeah. whatever you want if you don't want to use One of your little like goos or One something your, like that. Yeah. Or well, those Amazonites this morning. They would be gorgeous. Or, and then on the other side, you would do exactly the same thing, but instead of adding your chain or just your um, jump ring, you would add your clasp and you've actually got your clasp with the jump ring on that you need attached to the bottom of that. So if you're looking for your extra jump ring, it's in the jaws of your lobster clasp. Yep. And then you would just add that on to there. And that's literally as simple as it is. Now there's a couple of things you need to bear in mind. You're getting all excited and you're putting your ends on and then you think, oh, <laughs> you know, if you're adding something with a jump ring, then that's fine. But if you're going to add, say, a bead or something, it might not necessarily go over your end cap. Yeah. So make sure that anything that you're adding, so say you were going to add um, a pearl or um, the little high goos, like I've got some shell ones that I had in my stash. So if you're going to add those either side of your pendant, they're not going to go over yeah. your end cap. So you plan your design, plan mm -hmm. your design before you put your end caps on. Um, so usually I'd put one end cap on, pop on whatever I'm, I'm using there. And then say I was going to pop on um, this lovely jadeite, which I actually put on the, uh, the other colour. So if we're going to get this jadeite, so this bale is very easy because you've got like a, a large area for, you can just put it straight through there so that you could then pop on and then you could pop on your other accent piece. So I wouldn't necessarily put this with this, but you, I'm just showing you ideas. So that might be a pearl. It might be... Um, I think that goes perfectly with that leather. It might be a spacer bead, like I yeah. did with some of the others, or a, a bit of sterling silver, whatever you want. And then when you've got everything on there, then you would go and do the same process on the other side, so that now everything that you want is on there. So that's really, really straightforward. When it comes to something like, and I'll just bring it into shot, something like this one, isn't this beautiful? I mean, yeah, see the light through that. It's, look at that. Yeah, absolutely incredible. stunning. The the little I couldn't get the leather through the little um, bale. So there's a few things that you can do. I've followed the same process with my end cap, but I've used a different one. Look at that. You can get such different looks and I think this one kind of lends itself to to this so you can kind of match your end bale with whatever you're putting on your leather so I've done one side and then I've tried to get my leather through and I might be able to if I really squished it but then I'd be forcing it down and um, I don't really want to do that so you can, there's a couple of ways you can do this we, we often get these we get these in the kumihimo kits we get these in the cord kits they're just like charm carriers oh, okay. so you can pop a charm carrier on and so that would leave you there. And you could just pop on a jump ring. Or if you want to do something a bit more ornate, which I thought would be really pretty, is add a jade bead. Let me move that up a bit so that you can see. So you could, this is where your jewelry making comes into adding a little something to these, these pendants that are already absolutely gorgeous. So in that case, all I'd need is my round nose. Oh, oh thank you. It's <laughs> all right. I was, here, do you want... Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Let's swap pliers. <laughs> you would wrap loop the pendant through the bale. You know what? Also, this bale is lovely because you could get multi strands of gems through that. So if you wanted to do some micro pearls through that, that would be beautiful. So then all you'd have to do with that is wrap loop onto the bale itself. And because of how beautiful this pendant is, I would use sterling silver wire myself. And our sterling silver is inexpensive enough to be able to do that, I think. Especially today. So now you've got a lot more options because you've popped on that wire. So then I might pop on, in this case, jade or a jade and a pearl. And I've already made that different to how it came to me in the post. And then all that's left to do is to wrap loop that onto either my charm carrier which I just thought added an extra dimension or if you don't have a charm carrier you can wrap loop that onto the leather itself so that you can see that we've now 
made that different from exactly the same pendant that someone else is going to get. Um, bearing in mind, you're never going to get two exactly the same because they're handcrafted anyway. But you can still add your, your jewellery making skills into these, these ready-made pieces. When I saw them, I really wanted to see what they looked like with maybe a jade or a pearl bead mm. at the top. So that then, I'm just doing this quickly, but you get the idea. I'm wrap looping. This is also making a very secure cold connection. It's what we call in silversmithing a cold connection, which is um, something where we don't use heat. So obviously when you solder, it's very secure if you do it properly. And um, sometimes if we pop a jump ring on, it can come undone. And with something like this, we would definitely not want to, to lose this beautiful pendant. So I've now made that so that I can attach it, but I've also made it different. So you could pop a pearl on there or whatever. Once you're happy and you've sorted everything out here, you've got everything on there that you want, you might want to add a pearl or a jade either side if you've got a large whole bead. And then you just have to attach the clasp onto the other side. So you can do exactly the same one or you can do different ones like I did. Wasn't on purpose, by the way. Um, now this one just goes in so easily this little one here look how beautiful is that and I've already added the chain onto this side because I've got the lobster claw on that side and so then you've got a lovely piece of jewellery which is really really simple and I've also fixed the problem of not being able well it's not really a problem to get the leather through this particular little bale without forcing it, which I didn't want to do. Now you could try squishing the leather with the pliers and you probably would be able to get it through there, but without squishing it um, and making it maybe bespoke to you and a little bit different to what everyone else has got, I've added just that charm carrier, a jade bead, two wrap loops. So now I've enabled that to go onto the leather and put the ends on. Are you all done? Ta -da! And look at what Elle's done. I mean, uh, yeah, glued it. <laughs> easy peasy, right? Yes, absolutely. Easy peasy. Let me see. Who wants a closeout deal on what? Jet. You can't do closeout deals on Jet. Did you not hear about the nightmare of me in Tucson? What was the nightmare in Tucson? Look, there was no jet in Tucson the whole, the I whole love entire... The feel I know, it's jet. beautiful. Sorry, you know what we always say, what? When it's bundled... Yeah, there was no jet in the whole of Tucson. None? None. Wow. None, none, none. When it's bundled, you get an absolutely fantastic deal. Now, this strand, jet is... It's what we call a, a, an organic gemstone, meaning that it's formed out of... A living organism, jet like your amber is physically quite lightweight. This was actually once upon a time. It's a prehistoric monkey puzzle tree. Really? Yeah, fa fascinating, isn't it? So this is multiple millions upon millions of years. And what I always find amazing about the likes of amber and jet is that it has defied Mother Nature's natural decay process. Yes. You know, absolutely yeah. amazing. If you get a bundle, you get a better saving effectively. So yeah, Jet's lightweight, complement absolutely all of your jade that we've brought you, Debbie's beautiful kits that we've brought you. I can't remember the last time I brought Jet to air. Me neither. I haven't seen it. Probably on the back of Tucson. Now individually, per strand, No, they're not £25 each, are they? For Jet, jewellery maker price, that's amazing. We have 50 available and we want to do it as a closeout deal. With the larger size Jets that we've got, and I genuinely, genuinely, this is such a difficult gemstone to get hold of. Um, I know some of you already know the story, but yeah, it, 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 it is, you don't see it. Lovely um, from Marla, if you could. Oh, amazing. You know, if you could get enough of them, long line necklace or very sort of Mary Quant, very, <gasps> very traditional. You could go with pearls, couldn't you? Be yeah, beautiful. pearls would be lovely. Yeah. Love, like the feel of jet I like I as love well, the feel of jet. Because it's very lightweight and it's warm because effectively it's like yeah. a, it's a, it's a fossilised wood, an ancient fossilised wood. It's, it's not too heavy as well, is it? It's like a nice weight. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's like amber, isn't it? Yeah. Both have got a, both have got a warmth and both have got a, a, a lightness to them, but not so light that they're not going to drape beautifully. Um, how lovely would they be in a mala or something like I that? I think so because if you knotted in between with a coloured cord, yeah, that would be so yeah, lovely. Yeah, create a real nice yeah. pop. Now, normally that's the, uh, for, in my eyes that's the price of the ten mils, and you're getting your twelve millimeters for free. This is a big closeout deal opportunity. It'd be lovely with pearls as well. You know, Definitely. keeping all your organics, maybe with your amber, um, keeping your organic gemstones together. Twenty nine pounds and ninety nine pence only for this beautiful bundle. Make sure you are checking them out, lovely jewelry makers. These are full thirty eight centimeter strands. There is a little bit of a queue on the phone lines. Um, I've got one more bundle of jets, slightly smaller sizes. Stella, Staffordshire, Catherine, Philippa, Stephen and Susan, Maker, Janice, well done. Let's uh, duck into the next. Is there the same quantity of these? 25. Let me look at this. That's not, they're not going to hang around, are they? Yeah, that's what I mean. Imagine that. And you could have a Baroque pearl on the end. You could yeah. have one of the jade pendants. Nice. You know, anything. It would just look so stunning. Yeah, gorgeous. I'll just put spaces ah. in between. How much? Oh, that's good. That's very good. And it might sound sound obvious, but with quality jet should be jet black, hence where the name comes from, the yeah. terminology comes from. Jet black is, that's where it comes from. Jet. Um, how amazing. Yeah, honestly, there was, it, it was such a headache. So basically, yeah, a land, a pro, a, a, um, a product didn't land on the back of Tucson. So they were like, it's okay. Yeah, we've got a great bundle of jet. Go and speak to somebody that sells jet. Nobody sold jet. Oh, no. um, okay, last closeout deal. <laughs> wow. That's like the pretty woman moment where he opens the box. That is so beautiful. It's incredible, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Oh, I've not <gasps> seen that in real life. Is that oh, the... my goodness Which me. Which one is that? Yeah. Well, Christmas Day, we launched the first ever Olmec bangle. Whoever gets this is... It, I mean, everyone will be unique, of course, but look at the quality of this. How much? When we launched them on Christmas Day, they were smaller carat weight, smaller in size as well. See, that's a good size. Yeah. And then they were at 799. We managed to get a bigger quantity of the same rare, desirable type A Olmec Guatemalan jadeite, and we took this exact bangle... Mm -hmm at 499 pounds how many have we got 20 left 30 seconds look you can see oh it's gorgeous. a much better size in terms of if, if you've struggled with full bangles let's do a massive massive closeout deal for the final auction of the day we launched it at 499 so many of you got involved we've got the final few opportunities christmas day Christmas just gone as well. I say just seven months ago. Um, <laughs> it doesn't yeah. seem that long. No, it doesn't. They were what seven nine nine. It's not type B or type C, and that's why you're getting this level of afford. Uh, you know, three hundred pounds off. Close out deal though for the final twenty. Over two hundred carats, but also one of the bigger bangles. So if you've struggled with the other carved bangles then here's your opportunity. Because ideally, if you're buying a bangle, you want to be able to wear it, don't uh, yeah. you? That's the thing. Um, I've, got, I've got some jade bangles that I've purchased. Mine are, uh, mine are actually nephrite jade. So, um, But I, you know, I bet they're quite snug. And if you suffer with any kind of swelling in your knuckles or anything like that, then it's going gonna, it's gonna to hurt, is it, pushing a bangle over? Whereas yeah. this is much more generous, in its, uh, more generous in its size. It's difficult to do that, though, because obviously you would need more jade. And more is wasted. I was going to say, there must be a lot of waste. Yeah, during that cutting process. Look at the split payment here. It's 0% interest, £99.75. pence. Well done, Nottinghamshire. Hello to you, uh, maker, another maker in Nottinghamshire. I've got Paula there, Elaine there, and London there. Um, split payment today of £399. There's just six left of them within the vault. Oh, I'd never want to take that off. No, that is absolutely stunning. You the spoke colour. about the music of Jade, didn't you? It is the, that's the sound of it. You, yeah. you know, I could tell that anywhere. Yeah. Five of them left in the world. It's such, and, and of course, we know only in Guatemala do you get this absolutely beautiful, distinctive Olmec colour. The lost treasure of Guatemala. Patricia in Hampshire, you can get hold of yours, lovely. Nottinghamshire, you can do it. 
Paula in Rotherham and da Taff, you can do it. I've got five left, so if you'll make that confirmation, um, get the get it home. Use that thirty day money back guarantee. Get a second opinion as well if you wish, um, and you'll straight away realise that three nine nine is an absolute steal. New telephone caller, congratulations to you! What an amazing achievement! Amazing, Ooh, amazing beautiful. achievement! Let me feel it. Yeah, it is lovely. Oh. Do you want to? Yeah, it's been amazing, isn't it? Give it a try. Give it a try. Give it a try. Right, I'm off. Um, I've loved it. Every single one of you that has it in your basket, oh, check out beautiful. like Patricia has just done, and you can guarantee yours. Now we're running out of time today. I've loved it. I've, I've loved it. I've enjoyed um, enjoyed the, the you know Mrs. Claus hat and the turkey. Don't forget that beautiful mega deal of topaz that's coming up tomorrow at nine o'clock. So make sure you set your alarm for that as well. Full of brilliance. We're going to do a massive mega auction huge saving when you back beautiful lady next saturday with the most awesome kits i've ever seen oh i love that oh, it's exciting on. that's one for the diary isn't it um we love you thank you very much love you too thank but you for having me oh always a pleasure never a chore i'll see you bright and early in the morning everybody have a wonderful day and don't forget to tune in tomorrow for more christmas in july and a bit more of this <laughs>